welcome in. How's it going, guys? Um, hello, hello, hello. I hope you guys are doing uh well, having a fantastic morning. Um, because well, I mean, hell, we're playing more Tears of the Kingdom. Uh, hey, what's the Gavagu? You know, got you do about that. Um, I don't. Just, the Italian came out. Uh, but hello. Um. Today we're playing more Tears of the Kingdom. Uh, this is we're nearing the end, actually. Um, we're we got like a I think a couple more things to do, and then uh, then we finish. So might be like one or two more streams left. Um, if even that, we might even finish today. We'll see. Um, but um, uh, yeah. Uh, if you're watching this and you are liking the Tears of the Kingdom playthrough, um, either while you're live or you're a VOD frog who is watching this later. Um, subscribe, you know, uh, because big number go bigger and all that stuff. So, uh, yeah, you know, helps out the channel. Well. Anyways, uh, I mean, let's get into it. I'll do a little recap. I'll do a little fun, you know, hey, this is what we're doing. Um, but, uh, yeah, also, um, uh, yeah, I'm gonna, uh, like, like the stream too, you know, go, go, go team. Haha. <laughs> Okay, so um, let me go and uh, let's play some Tears of the Kingdom. Um, so uh, look, it's us. Uh, we have a lot of things and um, there's a, a lot completed. <laughs> there's, we've done a lot. We've done a lot. Um, basically uh, up until this point, uh, there's four different regional phenomena that have happened. Um, that being the Rito, the... Um, Gerudo and uh, the uh, Gorons, uh, but we have yet to actually find out what the original phenomena is happening in the Zora. So today, uh, we're going to start off today by looking at the regional phenomena that has been happening with the Zora. And I know you guys are like, Sidon! And uh, yeah, we'll see Sidon. Um, so that's going to be a, a fun start today. Uh, we're mate, uh, we have, uh, I think, two more memories as well there's one memory right here and then there's another memory right over here uh that we still have to complete um i want to also check out the labyrinths that's a huge deal i want to see Terrytown. um i want to just like go over to the akala um sort of like region check that out and um uh maybe even tide i don't i'm not too sure uh but uh yeah we've kind of been everywhere Oh, I say that as you can see, our depths map is not like nearly completed. Um, but yeah, uh, that's kind of like the goal for today. That's kind of what we want to do. And so we'll, I don't know, we'll check it out. Uh, yesterday, um, oh, before we get into exactly everything that's going to happen, let me do uh, some, some, a little disclaimers once again. Right now, first off, uh, no spoilers uh, at all, uh, like whatsoever. They're just like not allowed. Uh, no tolerance for them. Just don't spoil things. Uh, there's three different ways that you can spoil things. Um, and you might not know all of, all of them. Now, one, the first one is the most egregious and obviously the um, the obvious one um, of like, hey, Point Crow, this happens in the game. That's like a full spoiler. Like that is like, why would you ever do that? You're just being an ass, right? Um, the second one is a little bit more understandable. It's like, hey, Point Crow. Uh, have you done this yet? Um, which seems in, like an innocent question from initially, right? However, uh, what if I haven't done that thing yet? Uh, in which case, you have now informed me that that thing exists and that I can go do it. Uh, so you're spoiling that portion of the game for me. Uh, the third thing um, is, uh, let's say I'm, I'm solving a puzzle. And you're like, um, you know, uh, th this is what we call backseat gaming. Um, where you uh, will be like, Point crow, uh, use use ascend, use ascend, use ascend. Point crow, um, that is backseat gaming. Uh, so that's like telling me what to do and everything, and uh, that's like essentially also might be telling me the solution to it. So you're spoiling like how to do a puzzle. So if you guys uh, ever feel the need to do any one of those three different types of spoilers, just put a little smile in chat. Um, literally just smile um, because it's kind of fun to see um, you guys start to like get it yourselves and be like, oh, I know. But like you won't tell anyone. Um, it's a it's a really fun thing that we've started doing. Um, we actually have done it a ton on Twitch, but um, I'm glad that we've adapted it to the YouTube streams. Uh, so yeah. Um, that being said, now I'm going to um tell you about where we are at 
in the game, right? Um, I'm going to literally just uh, give you the story so far. So if you want to hear that, then go for it. Uh, if not, then, well, I mean, close your ears <laughs> for a bit. Um, so um, what we're going to do um, is, uh, yeah. So uh, Link and Zelda at the end of Breath of the Wild um, end up trying to explore more about Hyrule. So they go underneath Hyrule Castle into the Zonai Caverns and find a whole expanse underneath. Uh, they end up finding um, a the mummified body of Ganondorf, uh, who was sealed away by this arm. Now, the arm breaks off, and Ganondorf re um, revives, um, making Zelda disappear and cutting off Link's arm, essentially. Um, Link wakes up. Uh, turns out he is actually given the arm of Raru, um, which, uh, who sealed away Ganondorf initially. Now, Raru is the first king of Hyrule ever. Um, we go around the Sky Islands, um, uh, purifying our, our arm. And then, um, with the Master Sword, which is broken, uh, we then, uh, sort of, uh, give that to Zelda. But we don't know where Zelda is. The Master Sword just disappears. We would later find out through all of these memories, um, that Zelda is actually stuck in the past. She is the Sage of Time. And so she... In, instinctually, I guess, uh, through peril, teleported back in time to the very first foundings of Hyrule ever with the Zonai. Um, and so we are stuck in the present, uh, sort of trying to figure out how to get, you know, where is Zelda right now? What happened to Zelda during the past? And I mean, what we can do to hopefully stop Ganon in our time uh, from taking over the world. So, um, we've been instructed to look at four different regional phenomena across the world. The first one we went to was Rito, um, which had a, a huge blizzard. Uh, then we went to the Elden Volcano, which had a drug problem. That's not a joke. Uh, and then we went to Gerudo, which had, um, giant zombie wasps. Yeah, that's, that's pretty, yeah, that's pretty accurate. Um, and then, um, the last one over here... Uh, is the Zora's Domain, which we need to figure out what this regional phenomena is. Now, we've also realized that Zelda has been appearing across Hyrule doing a whole bunch of nefarious things. Uh, however, while going through the memories, uh, we have discovered that that Zelda is not actually Zelda. It is a spirit of Ganondorf um, who is going around trying to cause mischief um, in order to destroy the world. Um, we've also learned through the memories that Sonya who is the Hylian that uh, the Zonai uh, Raru married, was literally, kid you not, stabbed in the back by Ganondorf and then had her secret stone, um, which amplifies her powers, uh, stolen from her, in which Ganondorf now becomes the Demon King. Uh, so, uh, that's where we're at with that. Then Raru uh, forms the Six, Seven Sages, um... The Six Sages, uh, by giving them all secret stones of the Zonai, uh, and they can amplify their powers at will and are going to take on Ganondorf. Um, so yeah, that's what we're, um, going to do. That's, that's, um, the story so far. We've also discovered the depths here. Um, we, uh, uh found Koga and did the whole Koga quest line, which was hilarious and actually amazing. Um, through the, uh, um, the, the Gerudo mine, Lineru mine, Hebrew mine, etc. Uh, and then, uh, yeah, I think, I think, uh, oh, we found Phantom Ganon, which is like a random ass mini boss that we, that we discovered yesterday. Um, but yeah, I think, uh, yeah. Chat, was that like a good explanation? I think so. I think that was a pretty decent one. Uh, Kede, uh, Ka Kaidehara Lilia. What a name. Thanks so much for the channel membership, by the way. Appreciate that. We actually have 350 channel members now, uh, which is crazy because um, that's like triple what it was uh, before uh, about like five days ago. So uh, I appreciate that. Uh, we've also been uh, gaining a bajillion subscribers a day. Um, so I just want to say thank you so much for enjoying the... Um, thank you so much for enjoying the streams. Uh, there's actually uh, one, one last, last, last thing. Um, before everything else, um, is, well, let me make this, like, morning real fast, um, for, like, aesthetics, but the, um, um, the second video, um, of my edited playthrough, um, is available right now.
uh, for you to watch. Uh, so if you want to go watch that, totally go watch that. This is obviously like the live stream. Um, but if you want to watch the edited video of me, you know, getting up until this point, it is currently live on the channel. It's it's called um, here. I'll just show you. Yep. Um, it is. It is called Tears of the Kingdom is creepier than I imagined. Um, so this is part one. This is part two. Um, I already broke Tears of the Kingdom. Tears of the Kingdom is creepier than I imagined. Um, and uh, yeah. So I'm super stoked about that, dude. Can't wait. Okay. Um, let's go over here um, and pray. I think we have a light blessing. I think we have like four light blessings here. I could be wrong. We do. Okay. Um, okay. Wait one second. Um, okay. So what we're going to do now uh, is we're going to go over to the Zora's domain and see what the regional phenomena is happening over there. Uh, but first, uh, I want to I want to upgrade one of our sages, uh, and then also like probably give ourselves like a heart or two. Um, yeah, sages wills. Okay, so make bonds stronger with the sages and two Lin, I think is the best one we got. But I wonder what that means. Does that make like the? We'll have to see. Uh, your reinforced bond has increased his avatar's attack power. Oh. Okay, so it's not like the actual ability upgrades. It's just the attack power that upgrades. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Um, and then I also want to... Chat, yeah, should we do hearts or stamina? Um, should we do hearts or stamina, guys? Uh, we have, uh, I think, 13 hearts. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We have twelve hearts, and then we have two and a quarter rings of stamina. Heart. Okay. Hell yeah. All right. We'll get thirteen hearts. There we go. Thirteen hearts. Dude, this game is amazing. I mean, we got the phantom armor too, which is it used to be DLC armor. Uh, but now the phantom armor is in the game uh and it is one of the best armors in the game actually um that being um the fact that we get from it eight defense and then we also get uh just attack up from it actually you know what let me see if i can sorry i know we're we're getting sidetracked a little bit here um uh i'm gonna go to the great fairy real quick see if i can upgrade it because in Breath of the Wild, you couldn't upgrade the Phantom or any DLC armor. It just wasn't like a thing. Like, you got what you got, and you, you know, don't get upset. Um, I, But I wonder if you can, like, do it in tiers here. Um, we'll have to, like, see. And then we'll go to Zora. We're, we're doing... We're literally doing Zora. Okay. Oh, yeah. That's, it's, what, like, 13 minutes into the stream? Uh, like, three minutes into, like, starting... And um, I'm already getting sidetracked. This is literally like, welcome to the game. All right, this is this is this is what uh, uh, Tears of the Kingdom uh, does to you. All right, you just get distracted, and then you get distracted, and then you get distracted a little bit more. That's really that's the whole thing. Um, it's just it's dude. It, there's just so much in the game, and it is so fun. Uh, we've already played about uh, 40. I, I've around 45 hours of the game to like completed so that's kind of crazy <laughs> hello okay oh cough cough it smells a bit of gloom i think you came uh okay um all right let's enhance my clothing uh you can okay so you can't enhance the phantom armor okay that makes sense that makes sense uh, but you can enhance other stuff. Oh, you can actually enhance the tunic of the depths. Oh, yeah, hell yeah. Mm -hmm. huh. <sighs> okay. And then, uh, yeah, look at that. Okay. Dude, I just love it so much. Yeah, I love the tunic of the depths. It's so cool. Okay. Oh. Um, okay. 
Enhance away. I wonder what the special bonus for the depths is. Um, yeah, sure. I'll do another. I'll, uh, I'll do another depths. Because we just look so cool, dude. I mean, like, look, look at, look at that. It's so neat. Oh wow. Okay. And then, uh, okay, enhance. Uh, my mask for sure. Because I love this thing. It looks badass, and I want to keep the mask. There we go. All right. Um, what else do we want to enhance here? I don't think anything else. Oh, the trousers of the hero. <laughs> it's just okay. Maybe not that. Um, I mean, we can do the rest of the miner's gear. I just don't really want to. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Uh, chat. Should we get another gray fairy? To upgrade our armor a little bit more. Should we do that? Um, I mean, because we'll be wearing this probably, but if I can make the tunic a little bit like better, I just like the aesthetic. It looks so cool, you know? Like this is like this is like our aesthetic. Yeah? Okay. Um, let's see. Where were these where was the other ones? Uh, there was one right here, which was actually like, oh, it was there, but then like we needed to uh, draw, like drive the guy from like here. No, we need to find the coarser bee honey, give it to him, and then we need to like drive him over, which is a lot. Um, let's see, where was the other ones? Uh, we already did this. Wait, did we? No, we didn't do this one. I don't think. Okay. I'm already getting sidetracked. I'm so sorry. I, 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 I apologize. I said literally the first thing we were going to do today is Zora. But like, guys. But, but like, let me do my armor really fast, okay? Just let me, just let me upgrade my armor. And then we decided. I swear. I swear to God. Okay, this is the last sidetrack, okay? Keep me to this. Keep, goddamn, keep me to this. We are doing the Great Fairy, and then we are going immediately to Zora. All right, sounds good. Does that sound good? Is that a yes? Chat, that, that better be a goddamn yes. Okay. Great fairies over there. Um, how troubling. Okay. Um, it's Eustace. It's heartbreak. Think the poor fellows in Rito Village. I'm glad he's out. Uh, and Funk is a fiddle. Um, cool. Uh, are you out of... Yeah, Great Fairy. Yep. Uh, Great Fairy Kaisa. Okay. Um, hasn't come out in a while. Oh, Piper play his flute. Oh, okay. We actually don't have Piper then. Oh, but we do have the French horn guy. Um, okay. Uh, it's not a flute, a Highland stable. That's a little far from here. Um, so we're going to actually do this Great Fairy up here. Um... Yeah. All right, we're doing the Great Fairy. And then we'll go to Sora. Uh, Zora. Not Sora. Is What is this? Kingdom Hearts? We're going to go to Sora. Um, and then uh, we're going to... Uh, dude, I... <laughs> I wish I knew more Kingdom Hearts. I Actually, do I wish I knew more Kingdom Hearts? I don't know about that. Um, I just, I'm just not as relatable to the masses. I, I can't be like, oh yeah, uh, how about those, uh, materials, uh, uh, Donald or whatever. I don't know what they say. Um, but, uh, uh, Trey certainly does. Hello. Hi there. Hello. He's so cute. He's so cute. You can't pet the dogs in this game. It's trash. Uh, where is the paper? Um, the French horn guy. Where is he? Because we need to take him to uh, the great fairy here. Why? Why aren't they here? What? What? Uh, maybe... 
Oh, maybe maybe they have to be. Maybe it has to be done literally in order. Um. So it has to be the outskirt one. So then, okay, is this Highland Stable? No, this is Lakeside. Highland Stable's like over here. This is Highland, isn't it? Unless I'm wrong. Mini Stable, Gerudo Canyon. No, no, this is Gerudo Highlands. Wait, what? New Serene Stable, the Bantha Bridge. They said the right. Oh, it's in Farron. Yeah, this is Highland Stable. Yeah, this is Highland Stable. Oh, shoot. Okay. <laughs> like a little bit farther than I thought. Um, uh, Guardian Gamer, thanks for the channel membership. All right. Um, I said we would do the great, the great fairies. And so we're going to do the great fairies. We're, we're going to do the great fairies. I said we would. Did what? Did I stutter? Did I goddamn stutter? Great fairies, it's happening. And then Zora. <laughs> Hell yeah. Um, yeah. Go check out that uh, edited video chat. Um, in the meantime, uh, if you want to see where we've gotten from here, okay. I just need to go this way. Like, over here. That's not foreboding at all. Yeah, alright. So, over over this way. Uh, to... Right there. Yeah. That's, that's, that's where we need to go. Alright, I have three stamina bars, basically, too. So, we'll be able to get this, I think. Okay. A little farther, uh, farther. You can go a little farther by uh, activating uh, uh, Tulin's uh, ability, and then um, unequipping your paraglider, and then re-equipping uh, it. I can't speak today. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's the morning. Maybe it's maybe it's me. Maybe it's Maybelline. But um, yeah, I just can't speak today for some reason. I keep slurring like my speech. I'm a little, 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 you know. It's like one of those one of those things. Literally, that's that's why I tweeted out today. I was like, do you ever... Because, I mean, same, you know? Like, literally. It's just... Look at me go. <laughs> oh, God. It's one of those days, isn't it? It's one of those days where you wake up and you're like, dude, I'm so excited to do something. And then, like, you just, like, literally are just... You know? Is that, is that relatable? I can't tell. I can't tell. I think it is, but it's one of those things where you're like, it's, it's today. It's that's the sound. That's the sound today makes. Um, super excited though, uh, because Tears of the Kingdom is fun. So it's like super easy to stream, uh, and also like a uh, super fun to play. Um, I've been getting like a decent amount of sleep during my playthrough. Um, like decent amount. Uh, it's been like six to seven hours a, a day. Uh, shrine. Uh, about six to, uh, let's see. Yesterday I went to bed at around like 1 a.m. I woke up at 7 a.m. So that's six hours is what I got last night. So that's probably, probably why. Uh, long or wide? How about long and wide? That's, uh, that's, that's what they, uh, called me in college okay long or wide is the uh thing here okay uh let's see can i just do this oh nice it worked go team uh okay so not too hard so far uh and then uh, this one requires a little bit more, uh, I guess, motivation to do. So let me attach it here. Yeah. And then grab. And then, yeah, make it a little bit heavier. So then when it does swing, it'll swing like... Oh, God. What? 
Oh, oh my god. <laughs> it wasn't like a, uh, attached to, uh, properly. Okay. Right. Nice! Go team. All right. All right, so uh, it's just teaching us there that weight matters uh, for shooting off the ball. Uh, okay, so there's another one right here. Uh, and uh, this needs to be added uh, for length. I guess. In order to hit the ball. Uh, please make it. There we go. So close. Okay, nice. Okay, then we got a mine cart here. Why a mine cart? Wait, also where the... Huh? Oh, the mine cart's over here. Okay. So then, how do we get... Oh, 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 okay. So for the mine cart then, um, it's long or wide, right? So then, uh, what you need to do is um, attach this here, right? So then um, you can uh, actually shoot off the minecart with yourself to go finish the shrine. Up, oh, up, up, up. Um. Okay, it's coming back. Okay. <laughs> I was like, um, I mean, I guess I could like do some funky sort of like rail grindy sort of like nonsense. Actually, that might even work. No, you know what? No. Screw this shrine. <laughs> I, I don't care about your solutions. Anyways. You see, here I am trying to play by the rules. And then the game's like, no, you fail. Start to think of cheese. God damn it, dude. Whatever. That reminds me of the other shrine that we completed. Um, by totally, actually, genuinely cheesing it with bomb flowers. Actually, no. We, we cheesed the other uh, shrine with uh, bomb flowers, too. It was like this giant like puzzle you had to do. We had to bring a, an orb... Like, all the way across the place. Uh, but we just used a bomb flower and it shot across. <laughs> and landed um, basically at the other side. It was great. It worked. It worked out pretty well. Okay, so the flautist is over here. We're looking for great fairy. Great fairy stuff. We're looking for the flautist. Island stable. Um... I, oh my god, I need to reach my friend. Okay. Alright. There's a Korok here. Hello. My friend and I got separated. Okay, but where is he? It's not... Oh, that's not too far, actually. That's actually, like, pretty pretty close. Okay, I hope you find him, though. <laughs> I I hope you find him one day. Um, Where is the flouting? It's like around Farron, right? Yeah. In Highland uh -huh. Stable. Okay. Uh -huh. oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, shh. I missed the dialogue. One second, chat. Sorry, I, I always end up skipping the uh, the Highland Stable dialogue. Or, sorry, the, the, the stable dialogue. Okay. So, what do you say? <laughs> Okay. The, there was a fire north of the stable the other day. Just a small one. Apparently, it started by a young flute player. Heard he was saying fireworks off as a prank. Can you imagine? I haven't seen him since. Okay, so north of the stable. Look at that. You know? Problems require... Some problems require very creative solutions. Uh, so to the north of the stable... Is where the uh, flautist is. Um, okay. Oh. Wow, up here actually. Hello. Oh, you're you're a youngin. Uh, so I bet you climbed up here with me for a good reason. Need something, or did you come to listen to my performance? Are you a stable trotter? Um, I need you to join them so I can upgrade my equipment. 
the, tro the troop is touring again and they want all of us musicians back that's great but first i have something to do here um can't go back to the stable trotters until i take care of it let's move down where it's safer i need to tell you what happened uh you might be uh you might hear about this from someone at the stable but what happened is that there was a fire in the field yeah right on the spot it burned a patch all around us there were some flowers here before it's all my fault an accident but still my fault you see i have a friend who lives at the stable her name is hate uh maybe you've met her uh, she's been asking people if she could see a glowing tree it's just something from a picture book uh you know it's not real but she really wishes it was uh it's not my brightest idea given they don't exist and then i was stuck so i thought i'd just use a little tree a little fire make a glowing tree oh so you literally set fire to the field in order to impress a girl i've done crazier Aww. um that's how things burned here but i was only thinking of my promise to hate oh, besides it didn't even work Aww. uh st <laughs> it's still like to surprise her with a glowing tree uh but somehow safely uh, so now i'm collecting fireflies i need more 10 uh 10 more sunset fireflies do I have any? Also, where the hell do I find sunset fireflies? Huh? Maybe they're like, maybe they are here and I just need to like wait until morning or wait until night for them to appear. Um, like really fast. So let me, uh, let me do that. Okay. There might be some like around. Um, okay. Um, bum, bum, bum. Uh, maybe there's some down here. Oh, maybe we can buy some from Beetle, actually. Uh, where's Beetle? He was just... Oh, he's over here. Okay. The dude, I love Beetle. Uh, favorite character, I think, in all of Zelda, uh, Zelda games. Legitimately. Hey! Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah! Is that a rugged rhino beetle? I love rugged rhino beetles. Will you give it to me? I'll give you something in exchange. Sure. That wasn't worth it. Um, okay. Excuse me while I spend the day uh, spoiling this, this beetle. All right. So what have you got? Let me buy something from you. Sunset Fireflies. You have three. Okay. Uh, okay. Wow! 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 <laughs> Yay! Um, okay. Uh, no bugs, no us, no nothing. We're in this together. We're all in this together. Okay. Um, so I could probably buy some more sunset fireflies from Beetle across the land, actually. Let me go do that. Oh my god. Chat, wait, chat, are we getting sidetracked? <laughs> Does this count as getting sidetracked? I can't tell. Yes. No, we're going to the Zora. I promise. There's just a couple things we need to do first. <laughs> Trust me, guys. It's important. It is important. Yesterday was literally all about sidetracking. Like, not even not even joking. Um, I was like, oh, um, let's go do the Zora. And then we spent the entire stream doing anything else. Wow. Wow. Okay. All right. Do you have Sunset? Oh, you don't. Wait, does the only do only certain beetles have them? Um like is it like every every beetle has like a Oh god. Oh no. Uh I got to find like the other sunset fireflies then. Cuz I know he sells them at a couple stables. Um from like my niche knowledge of Boatwa, Breath of the Wild. Um but uh yeah, I need to like figure out exactly Um, exactly which ones do. Hello. Wow. wow. Okay. Sa. You don't have them here. Okay. Um, there used to be some, uh, if I recall, here too. Like, like whenever it would be like nighttime, they would appear um around the river that runs through Kakariko Village. Uh, there was also some I think in Hyrule Field specifically. Um, so we'll try it like around there. Um, 
we'll, we'll we'll see about this we'll see we'll see we'll see um so makasura okay sunset fireflies were around here in kakariko uh they were are they no longer here oh yes they are okay we need we need a couple of these okay we need uh actually eight of them specifically okay uh now we need seven count down with me guys Six. Five. Oh, did I scare away the others? Damn it! Ah, oh, stupid! Stupid, stupid, stupid! Oh, I totally scared them away. Damn it! Okay. Okay. Um, let's see. I wonder if we go back. All right, let's try this out. Uh, okay. We need five more, right? I think it's five more. Uh, and then once we get these, we then do the Great Fairy, and then we do the Zords domain. That's what we do. That's what we do. That's what we do. Right? Because we have... How many do we have? Um, we have six. Oh, we need actually four more. Oh. That you lied to me. How could you? You, you literally lied to me. I trusted you guys. I was like, hey guys, how many do we have? And you all said five. All of you said five. I was like, no. Actually, it's only four. Yeah. Um, nomad. Oh. Okay, I'll pass. Okay. Uh, I don't want the soup ladle, but sure. Okay. <laughs> Worst viewers ever. All right, uh, Beetle. What's going on, Beetle? Um, I need you to give me more Sunset Fireflies, particularly, hopefully, four. I mean, th you only have like three in stock, right? Oh, okay. So every time I sleep, I can okay. Uh, I can rebuy. All right. So I need I have nine right now. I need one more. Okay. I need one more, and then we can do the Piper side quest and then the piper side quest will allow us to do the great fairy other side quest and then and then because we have upgraded armor then what we can do is then we can go to zora sounds good that's the plan that is the plan that's what we're gonna do it's gonna be great it's gonna be amazing and uh yeah, don't say copium. No, that's real. We're going to Zora's domain in a second. That's why. That's yeah. why we made the thumbnail today, uh, like an ocean. Ah. Hoo -hoo. All right, just one. All right, nice. Yay. All right, we're good. Everything's fine, guys. Wow. We did it. We did it. We did it. Yay. All right, ten fireflies should do it, and I have ten fireflies. You have the fireflies with you? I sure I see. Uh, I'm sure I see a glow coming from your pouch. I have the fireflies for you. Ooh. All right, you have them with your fireflies and some I've also collected. I can track even more fireflies and I can make the glowiest of glowing trees. Are you helping? Can you do me one more favor? Oh my god. Um, uh, this will only work when the fireflies are going. So I'd like to bring height this, uh, to the spot while it's dark. Um, you know what? If you don't have time, bring her on a different night instead. Hey. Uh, and I want it to be a big surprise. Okay. Um, 
So we need to sleep at night. Uh, and then bring height. Uh, who is height? I found height. Okay. Um, <laughs> okay. Let's sleep until night again. Um, I'm glad there's a free in right here, technically, by the fire. Uh, and then we should have a glowing tree that we bring height to. Is this the... Okay. It, that might be the glowing tree. Okay. Oh, good evening. Piper isn't back, even though it's night. Honestly, where'd he go? Hey, right, follow me, please. Uh, what's this all about? All right, come over here. Wait, this might be kind of cute. Wait, this might be actually, like, kind of cute. So, if we bring height to this tree with, uh, with Piper. Over here. Come over here. Right here? Ah! Oh my god. Wait, this is so cute. Me and who? Wow, this is so much prettier than the one I once saw in a book. Uh, it's just like I see it in my dreams. Thank you. So the best glowing tree ever. I feel really happy. Aw. Happy, did you hear that? Yep, finally happy. What a relief. I knew there was a bright smile in there somewhere. Good for height. Uh, but it's going to take more than that to keep her smiling. I need to do what I can to make sure that happens. I figured it out. I'm going back to the stable trotters. Uh, I'll get better and better at playing my flute. More fun, more amazing. Because if the crowds love my music, then height will too. And she's always she'll always smile when she hears it. Well, anyways, thanks a lot. Um, you helped me with all sorts of stuff. So you can have this if you want. Ah, uh, thanks. I'm heading out soon. If we meet again somewhere, music is going to make you grin from ear to ear. Um, alrighty. The flute player's plan. Okay, so now that we've done that, we got a little sidetrack. That was so cute. That was adorable. Oh, I've only seen the fire. I've only seen fireflies like once in my life. Um, I was uh, visiting some family in Michigan and uh, they had a bunch of fireflies in the backyard um, at night. And it was like a, kind of like a really like somewhat magical experience. Um, seriously, like it was it was like. It was it was crazy. Uh, I want to do that again eventually. Um, like, I just I just want to like, dude, I, OK not worth going to Michigan just to, just to see some fireflies. Okay. Um, I was about to say, yeah, maybe I'll go visit Michigan again for... No, 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 no. If I ever happen to be around that area again. <laughs> all right. Then I'll make it a point. All right. Let's not, let's not go too far. All right. It was a, it was a great experience. It might be showing uh, an experience I want to share with someone one day. But um, going to Michigan... I don't know about that. That's a lot. All right, let me let me save here real quick, and then let's go do the Great Fairy. Uh, it's all the all the side quests are collapsing right now, which is great. Um, let's do the Great Fairy, and then we uh, then we go. Ah, it's you. Look, I mean, listen to this. Piper's here. Our flautist Piper has made his triumphant return. Uh, who knew how to s how smitten Piper really was? Not I. Affairs of the heart are something I've yet experienced firsthand. I, you know what? I, I could make a joke here. I could make a joke. I really could make a joke here. Um, but you know what? Hey, man. What one, one day. One day you'll find someone. Well, anyway, uh, the return of Piper's delightful flute has revitalized the stable trotters. We're ready to make some music. Um, by the way, I remember you, Traveler. Are you here out of concern for the Great Fairy? Yes. Um, all right. So the Great Fairy is over there. Yes. Um, and then we probably have to bring people there. 
She loved his sweet notes on the flute with Piper. So I'm sure the sound of his flute would cheer her up. But now, uh, the road's been blocked by some rocks that tumbled out of the sky. Uh, but maybe we could drive over it. No horses came past it. All right. Uh, poor Breezer, uh, the indispensable sixth member of our troop, has broken down yet again. Our Breezer has seen uh, us through thick and thin. Without it, our hearts won't be in a performance. Th uh, I'm thankful Piper has returned, but I'm so worried about the Great Fairy that I can't just lead the players with my usual flair. Okay. So, I mean, this is best. This is why this is here, you know? Um, so, let's put this down here. That's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> there we go. Put that down there. Um, and then we'll take this. And uh, Nero. Oh my god, it's it's the return of the great dune buggy. Are you are you kidding me right now? Are you actually serious? Okay, there we go. Nice. <laughs> it's like I was like, really? Okay, and then we'll take this. Uh, I saw um, Trey playing uh, uh, Tears of the Kingdom uh, last night a little bit. Um, and the man's, like I predicted, is having the goddamn time of his life. It makes me so happy. All right, so let me just put this right here, right? Nice. Uh, and then let me put this over here. Look at this. Oh, we've tricked it out. Look at that. I woke up in a new moon, right? All right. Uh, I can't possibly abandon the great fairy. Piper has returned. I get in. I'll handle it. You know, don't worry. I got this. I got this. Uh, oh, dude, look at this monster truck. Sure. God damn. All right. Let's go, boys. Yeah, damn. No, no. All right. We've done it, guys. We've done it. This all-terrain vehicle is too amazing. He's simply too good at his job. He's a builder, an engineer, a constructor. Dude, this thing has four-wheel drive. It's crazy. And there we go. Great fairy, we're here. Now prepare the performance of a lifetime. So pretty. Oh, I love it. <laughs> to be supplemented by that um, is great. Hello. Yahoo! Yahoo! That's like Mario. Uh, look, Piper. Look, she's awakened. Oh, I didn't know she'd be so shiny. Uh, thank you again. I have a reward for you, and it's too much for these pockets to handle. No need to be humble. You deserve this. Uh, 100 civil rupees. That's better. Now we can concentrate on our performance. Uh, but she was the last great fairy uh, still shut away in her flower bud. That's why we must. the show must go on. They're an aide to Kaisa. Is complete. Okay. Uh, uh, you're the one who brought the musical trope to me. Uh, don't be shy. I could tell it was you, even if you were hiding. Perhaps the reward should be me joining you as a co-adventurer. Hmm? I mean, <laughs> uh, uh, <coughs> since you offered, uh, I mean, I'm just saying, uh, Zelda ain't here right now. And, uh, I, you know, uh, she's kind of in the past. So, I mean, does she even really exist in the future? Um, so, like, I think, I think as Link, I think Link is kind of single right now. So, if you wanted to, uh, you know, be my co-adventurer, we could make that arrangement, you know? <laughs> I'm only teasing you, uh, but you get even cuter when you're blushing. Mm -hmm. uh, I really can't thank you enough, young man, but that won't stop me from trying. 
if you have the materials, I will gladly help you um, uh, enhance your clothing. All right. Uh, so can't we? Can we? Uh, we need a frox fang and a dark clump. Okay. So after all of this, we. Oh, but we can do this. Actually, we can upgrade our mining uh, mask. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Do you feel it? Uh, the care I put into it. Uh, some enhanced uh, sets of clothing. Uh, when each piece is enhanced twice, will grant you a new power when worn. You can give it a try. Um, okay. Two of my sisters are still cowering in their flower buds. Um, consider it a special request uh, for me. Uh, here, my sister uh, Kotera is near a stable not far from Dueling Peaks, often included in the east. Take care. <laughs> okay, hear me out. We could really just fast quick through the other fairies. Like... Like, we actually have it all ready to go. <laughs> no, I know I told you not to tell me to get sidetracked. Okay, I know I told you, chat. I know I did. I know I did. Okay, but like, it's we were so close to fitting this side quest. And we might as well just do it all at once, right? Um, right? Right? I'm not getting sidetracked. You're getting sidetracked, chat. That's you. you. You guys are doing it. You, you guys are the ones getting sidetracked. It's not me. It's not me. You are the ones getting sidetracked. All right. Maybe. Maybe I said great fairies. We do the great fairies with an S. All right. Let's do the third great fairy. Ah, uh, we meet again. Uh, did you come uh, see the great fairy? Yes. Uh, the great fairy Mija settled close to uh, Snowfield Stable. Yeah, yeah. Right over there. You can still see it late at night. Last, the Great Fairy is hiding inside her flower bud. Uh, the Great Fairy always liked the uh, timber of Eustace's horn. Uh, I'd like to depart for the Great Fairy's bud straight away. Only one small hitch. Our breezer's roof is broken, so we'd be at the mercy of the elements. Just look at all that snow falling. We might fall ill in such weather, so how should we perform our best then? Um, okay. If we put a roof on Breezer, our performance for the Great Fairy is good as canceled. Okay. So, um, wow. Let's put a... It's, it's crazy. How do we put a roof on the Great Fairies or on Breezer? That's crazy. That's nuts. I hope we can figure that one out. All right, done. Uh, let me get the... Um, uh, let me get the, the horse here. Jet, you, you yeah. made the mistake, uh -huh. I think, of thinking that you have oh. any sort of free will. Like, whatsoever, right? Oh. Um... Of like, you know, maybe your fate has been predetermined by this stream, right? Oh, oh. Consider, oh. consider that uh, me getting sidetracked huh? is actually part of the main track. Oh, all right, of life. Oh, um, mm. okay, stars and uh. okay, cool. Um, just, just, just consider that possibility here. That maybe I, uh, um. Yeah, maybe, maybe, chat, maybe you guys are the, the ones who are, um, um, yeah, you just don't have free will. Consider, consider getting free will, actually. Did that attach properly? It totally did not. How did that attach so poorly? I don't understand. Okay, right here. See that right there? Okay, we'll take this. Oh my fucking god. Okay. And then attach to the main part. All right, you know what? Perfect. That works. All right, let's do this. Uh, Polter Bit, thanks for the $10. Uh, and you said Michigan was not worth the time, and now we're on the second hour of the Great Quest. Okay, okay, still, hear me out. <laughs> All right, well, I'll take you. Uh, I put the roof on the breezer. I'll take you to the Great Fairy. What's this? Our breezer has been fitted with a roof. Crazy. All right. Um, 
All right. Uh, the road for the Great Fairy starts by going around from the left and climbing a little ways up the mountain. Okay. So, let's take our horse here. Hello. Uh, and go towards the Great Fairy. Okay. So, it starts a little bit to the left. Uh, and we need to avoid these enemies, probably. Okay, they didn't see us. That's good. And then up the mountain. Now, there's a Gleok over there, too, which is a little concerning. But we'll probably be fine. Yeah, okay. Okay, the Bokoblins didn't see us. Uh, so, we need to go over here and then to the left. The Great Fairy. Yeah, this is great. This is actually, like, super easy. Um, yeah, okay. So I just, I mean, like, it's so, it's so fast yeah. to do, like, the rest of this quest, you know? Just like, bing, bang, boom, great fairy, easy, boom, boom, bang, bing, bing, boom, ba, ooh, ooh, ba, blah, 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 skinny, pop, pop, you know? Yeah. I feel like that's relatable. <laughs> hello, hello. And now we're here. Oh, great fairy, the stable trotters have arrived. Yeah, yeah. We've done it. We have our thanks. All right, no time to dawdle. Strike up with the band. Our audience is the great fairy herself. Uh, okay, there it is. Is so pretty. Mr. Worldwide to infinity. We set the roof on fire. Oh, sorry. Mr. 305. <laughs> yeah, we're, I mean, I just want to know when uh, the stable trotters have a pit bull feature. All right, that's the third great Yahoo! fairy. Yahoo! Yahoo! Uh, the great fairy has returned to us. Uh, this, is the, this is one of the greatest days of my life. Uh, the great fairy is uh and joined my humble horn playing. What a day. Uh, what a divine presence. What splendor. I'll remember this moment for all my life. We must return to the stable, though, to share the good news. Yeah, yeah. Thank you again, which leaves only your reward. Now, now, don't be shy. I'll take 100 rupees. Yeah, yeah. Um, all right. Uh, clear conscience is worth yeah, every rupee. Yeah. Captivating Misha is now at peace. But she wasn't the only great fairy shut away in a flower bud. Oh. That's why the show must go on. Oh, yes. I'll be borrowing this horse so we can get to the next destination. Oh. Uh, but I won't cause you any trouble. But we'll do the responsible thing and return your steed to a stable. Don't worry. Yeah, yeah. Well, then, good traveler. Thank you again. You just stole our horse. Okay. Sounds good. No, that's cool. All right. So the one who arranges the soothing sounds for me. I would have liked to be released by someone. Wait, I would have been. I w I would have liked to be released by someone bigger, but well, a slim little lad like you is fine too, I suppose. Um. Okay. Jeez, I like the other great fairy better. <laughs> it seems the world is not so corrupted as I thought. Thank you for opening my eyes. I can enhance your clothing. Um, all right. Huh. The power veil with me, I can greatly enhance your clothing. Mm -hmm. Uh, okay. I don't have enough giant bright bloom seeds or glowing cave fish here. Uh, for a tier three miner's mask. Okay, that's fine. See you later. Huh? So long. I want, I want to do, uh, the reason why we're doing this too is I want to enhance my clothing before we go to Zora. Um, however, we might as well do the last great fairy right here. Because there's only four great fairies, and we just need to find one more musician for the stable trotters in order to uh, awaken that fourth great fairy. Um, did she call me small though? Like I just, I like I, I feel like we should gloss over that. Like, <laughs> you know, I, I mean, you know, I don't know about that. Uh, Esho Shrine. Okay. Uh, Polterbit, thank you so much for the channel membership. Thank you. Welcome in. Welcome in. Now, um, small thing is, uh, I don't normally stream on YouTube this often, 
Um, I've decided to stream on YouTube for the entirety of the first Tears of the Kingdom playthrough. Uh, but normally I stream on YouTube uh, like once every like Wednesday or so, you know. So I uh, I do really appreciate all of this. Okay, uh, fourth great fairy. Uh, who's who's the uh, fourth musician? Uh, yes, I'm coming to meet another great fairy. I merely assume because the great fairy Kotera is such a noble. Uh, uh, I merely assume because the great fairy Kotera is such a notable attraction. Yeah, she is. Oh, uh, the great fairy has emerged from her flower bed in quite some while. Um, she used to li listen to Beat's drum so fondly, hearing his lively beat. Right. Uh, but Beat simply isn't here. Right, we need the coarser honey. Um, uh, that traveler who heard a drum somewhere, uh, maybe near Kakariko Village. Okay. Um, so, if I'm correct, uh, we, we met, uh, Beat's a while ago. I love his name is Beat's. It's hilarious. Um, uh, we met Beat's a while ago, and he said that he wanted three... Uh, coarser honey. And I think we have um, some. I don't know how much. We have one coarser bee honey. Uh, let's see if Beetle sells any, though. Um, but we need two more for beets. Alright, alright. What have you got? Um, ooh. Ooh. Um, how? The Sunset Fireflies was one thing, but. How do we get bee honey? Where would it be? Oh, that's funny. <laughs> Chat. Oh, where would it be? Oh, 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 where would it uh, be? Um, uh, I'm trying to think of a joke with wasp, but I can't, um, where wasp, wasp up guys was, was up like what, what's, what's up? What, what's, you know? Oh, by the way, chat, uh, I don't want to know where to find the honey. Um, FYI, uh, I said it at the beginning of stream, and I've said it every single stream since. I don't want backseating. I'm not asking genuinely where to um, find things. I want to figure it out for myself because that's part of the um, experience here. Okay. So I appreciate it. I, I bet some of you guys know, and I'm not doubting that. Um, I just don't want to know. I want to figure it out for myself. Um, so... Thank you. I, uh, if, if you know, I'll put it like this. If you guys are curious when I'm going to ask you of like, Hey, uh, like, like here, can you help me solve this question? Um, then I will literally be like, Hey chat, I need your help. Please answer this question for me. I cannot do this. Can you answer this for me right now? It'll be that obvious versus, huh? I wonder where to find bee honey. All right. Speaking of which we found some bee honey. Nice. And now some bees are following us. Okay, we need one more honey. Over here. Let's see. Uh, yeah, it looks like it's just in forests. Oh, are, do you have honey as a stick? That's not going to work for me. <laughs> we need, like, honey as in, like, just regular old-ass honey. Um, let's see. And yeah, like that. I mean, unless that guy stole the honey from the tree, in which case, screw you, dude. I'm trying to make a living out here. And here you are. Here, we go. here you are, stealing my honey. My thunder. Um, okay, let's go over this way. Yeah, because you can't, like, get the material and then unfuse it to get the material back. Uh, once it's fused, it's gone, basically. I think that prevents you from, um... It prevents you from doing a lot of things, which is, like, actually... Oh, my God, those are silver book goblins. Uh, okay. Have we not been over here yet? Okay, up and around. 
Okay, I just want Corsair B, honey. Oh, okay, here we go. Okay. <laughs> it's part of the monster forces, these bees. All right, there we go. Third B, honey, down. Let's go, dude. Oh, God. Jesus. Oh, God. I, oh, oh, I just cracked some weird lower back. Oh, my vertebrae. That felt so good, but so weird. Oh, it was like, that was like my hip. That was so weird, dude. Man, I just saw God. Meaning I just... <laughs> Oh, yeah, this is what uh, turning uh, 25 does to you, you know? No longer am I uh, a youngin. Uh, my brain has stopped developing any farther. Uh, it, it's, it's all dying. It's all downhill from here. I'm now dying faster than I'm growing. Uh, no joke, though. Like, legitimately. The past couple months... Uh, okay, so when I turned 25, like everyone was like, hey, you know, um, you're going to start feeling some weird pains just generally because you're going to start just getting older and that's what's going to happen. And I was like, all right, guys, like, all right, I, come on, come on. What do you mean? Like, what are you talking about? Come on. Um, and then uh, and then I did um, every couple days. I'll just be like, oh, oh, God. Oh, we got some crackles. One second. Um. Uh, I was just like, oof, you know? Uh, so that's been, that's been like lovely recently. All right. Uh, yeah. Um, but I haven't like, this also could be because I'm not like sleeping like a ton of hours every day anymore. Uh, but it's kind of like funny. All right, what's up, Beats? How's it going? Hello. Uh, yeah, I got some coarser bee honey for you. Yes, there it is. All right, my bee didn't catch the bees, but I got you moving. Uh, I can whip up a honey crepe for the conductor of my troop on the double. Uh, here's something to helping uh, for helping me out. Wow, we're getting a lot of rupees. I'll take it. Um, what do you say? The stable trotters are back in action. Then what am I doing here? They need me to bring the rhythm. If I hit up every single stable, I'll run into them sooner or later. Shouldn't be long before I can offer the troop leader my services again. Wait until next time if there's a next time. See ya. Okay. Uh, okay. Now that we have collected the drummer, let's go. And, uh, well, let's do the final great fairy here. The final great fairy. And then we go to Zora. Hey, what's up, Raz? How's it going? Okay. Uh, great fairy. Um, uh, chat, say hi to Raz. All right, let's go do this drummer. Okay. Wait, wait, they're all here. Okay, uh, this is the man of the hour. Look at this, or rather listen. It's Beats. Our stalwart drummer Beats has returned. Uh, sorry, troop leader. I am making my band members worry about me that way. What they really have to be worried about is their declining audience. But the beat heart, uh, the beating heart of the stable trotters pulses once more. Every member is essential for our signature sound. Together, we are not just the stable trotters. In my heart, will always be the stable gallopers. Okay. Oh wait, his mush. Wait, his mustache are our music notes. I didn't even, I didn't even see that. Let me start with this. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And thank you. That's five thank yous from the five of us. Yeah, yeah. Attention everyone. This is a new start for the Sable Trotters. May our performances let the great fairies know all travelers. Yeah. No, let everyone in the world be awash in sweet, soothing music. <laughs> I'm brimming over with happiness to the point where I can't keep a lid on it. And I must say, it's good to see a friendly face. All right, let's go do the Great Fairy. Um, 
and bring everyone with me. Yes. Um, I'm sure she's scared to come out. Um, but she was used to listen to beat drums so fondly. Um, uh, the bridge at the Great Ferry is broken. How are our horses supposed to cross? Uh, if the bridge is no good, how about we cross the river? That's right. We can cross the river. Okay. Uh, if you have the time, I'd be honored uh, if you could be there for our performance. So, do we need to build a boat or? Um, yeah. Okay, we definitely need to build a boat. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's cross the river. They say not crossing the river. No. Um, yeah, hard to cross the river. Even if we took off Breezer's wheels and float across, the current would run that plan oh. aground. The Great Fairy is so near. Okay. No. Um. Yeah, Gray Fairy is literally right there. Um, okay. The bridge is no use at all, though. Uh, our breezer was built for traveling roads, not rivers. Um, all right, but... Um, what we could do is uh, pretty easily... I don't know if there's any anything here. No, there's no Zonai devices that we can just, like, nab off the, off the rip. But we could just use uh, some fans. Let's do three. That might be, like, good. So, let's put, like, one, like, right here. And then we'll put, like, another, like, right. Oh, two might be enough, actually. Let's see. Put it, like, right here. And then a third, maybe? I don't know if that's going to fit. might fit enough okay <laughs> um all right and then we'll get a steering wheel it's probably the worst thing you've ever seen in your life uh steering wheel and we'll take the steering wheel and put it like right here yeah okay and then we'll take this we'll take this boat that we've now made Hopefully it doesn't sink too much. Uh, and then we'll, so we'll try it out. Let's try it out, you know? Uh, hey, if it's stupid and it works, it's not stupid. Yo, Connor, thanks so much for the 20 bucks. Appreciate it. All right, hop in. I'll take you. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's go to the Great Fairy. <laughs> board, everyone board before he changes his mind. Yeah, before we go to the Zora's, uh, Zora's domain. All right, here we go. Let's go. Oh, shoot. All right, let's go. It does work, sort of. Every okay, everyone's kind of drowning a little. Okay, it's okay. It's fine. <laughs> okay, no, it's it's all good, guys. It's literally fine. Don't even don't even worry. This is how you uh, drive boats. <laughs> how did, dude? They are drowning right now. <laughs> I'm in a submarine. The Great Fairy. Yeah, yeah. All right. Here's the last Great Fairy. Shred in the gnar, dude. I love this. Oh my god! It's so pretty! I love this music! Wow! That was so pretty! All right, the last great fairy. Oh, we've done it. Yowza, I think my heart just picked up the tempo. The musical stylings of the Sable Trotters are the cure for anyone's 
Uh, yeah. Thank you. Once again, I've prepared a token of thanks. So substantial. I hope your pockets are double stitched. You deserve every last bit of it. Okay, it's the same amount that you gave last time, but we'll take it. Sure. And now that my own pockets are lighter, I can concentrate on the performance. Our musical trope has finally performed for all the great fairies. I'm moved. I'm inspired. I'm beside myself with joy. Thank you so much for not giving up and forging on despite all the obstacles. Every time the great fairies emerged in response to our music, it gave us all in the troop confidence in our playing. If you ever want to hear my beats, stop by a stable. We'll be there. The show is not over. Far from it. We're just getting started. We'll keep playing and make audiences smile over the kingdom. That's best to pour all of our thoughts and feelings into the music when we play. From now on, I want our music to soothe every traveler who comes to the stables. Oh. Consider you an honorary member of our Grand Stable Trotters troop. Might I know your name? Oh. Link, huh? Ah. That's what we can call the hero who saved our Grand Troop. Yeah, yeah. I'll remember that. I surely will remember. Our Grand Troop will continue playing for one and all under a new name. We're the Stable Trotters no more. Yeah, yeah. In honor of this genuine hero, let us be known as the Stable Heroes. <laughs> The Justice League. Wait, that's taken. <laughs> the Serenade. Oh, there we go. Uh, Eric, maybe you'll get girls now that you're in a band. Okay, I feel like that. I, I don't know if that is like that correlates there. You know, I feel I like maybe it's like it diverges if you like. If you go to like band to Riz level, you know, it's it's actually like a it's a, a low it's a curve to the lower right, you know, just right. Anyways, what a feeling. That first breath of fresh air, it's so intoxicating. The beat of the drum has lit a fire deep in my heart. Mm. What about you? Can you feel the heat? Are you ready for more? <laughs> sure. Uh sure. <laughs> Allow me to enhance your clothing. Okay. Um, I can enhance your clothing to the maximum now. Okay. Uh, we do not need to right now, but, uh, for later. Aww. Bye. All right. And that is all of the great fairies completed. Um, that was a little bit of a side, uh, detour. But now we can go to Zora. All right, it's Sidon time, everybody. All right, uh, Zora's domain is uh, this way. Uh, Tulin, where you at? I guess not. Um, uh, okay. All right, this, we're going to do the last of the regional phenomena today. And then, honestly, we might be able to get the last of all of the memories, too. Like, genuinely, we... I think... Dude, I don't know. We, I, we might finish the... I don't know if we're going to finish the game. I mean, we might. It's... We'll see. Um, but, I mean, there's a lot to do. But, all right. Zora's Domain over here yeah and akala is uh is is over uh over as well okay uh so chat um one second um i uh need to go to the bathroom but i will leave you with something um here um uh and now i know you guys are probably uh expecting abby uh however uh, she has uh, some more important work to do right now. So um, I will leave you um, with this. I, I have, I have, what? Just, it's going to be a DVD logo. All right. And, and a little, a little, where is this? Uh, text box. It's this one of like Point Crow in bathroom currently. All right. If it hits the corner, let me know. All right, I'll be back in like uh, a minute or two. Actually, probably two to three minutes.
Oh, sorry, I was muted for a second there. I'm back, guys. Look at me go. It didn't hit the corner. Oh, I'm sorry about that, guys. You know what? Maybe next time. Maybe next time it'll hit the corner. It's a sad day today. Very sad day. Um, chat, in case you guys are curious, uh, there's a uh, edited video out uh, today uh, on the channel. So check it out uh, for the Tears of the Kingdom playthrough if you want to see it. Uh, just want to give you that little FYI um, right here. Um, but uh, okay, cool. Uh, let's go to Zora. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> uh let's see let's see let's see um okay well there's that tower over there we definitely want to get the tower before we go to zora um but i think i think we'll be fine i think we'll just like head on over um i want to see like what's what's been going on with the with the fish people with the fish people Is this gonna be a youtube video uh yeah i mean like all of these streams are so far uh, uh the first day of breath of the uh, sorry tears of the kingdom has been made into a video the second uh, and third days have been made into videos, and uh, everything else will be too. I mean, the edited videos are available right now. Um, if you want to get caught up on those or go back or, and see it and everything, um, that is uh, that's that. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Up here is the um, is the tower. Okay, we do want to head over to the tower. I think. Uh, so yeah, chat say how to YouTube. Okay. Yeah, whoa. I mean, we could, like, get that shrine over there. Is that worth? Oh, whoa. You can see it from here. You know, uh, I think we don't get the shrine. I think we just get the tower here. I think we just nab. Yeah, nab the tower. Actually, you know what? We could nab... Let me do this, actually. Well, let's go to this tower and then fly over from that tower to the other tower. I think we do that. I think that's the way we go. Uh, and then, uh, yeah. All right. Cool. Oh, so close. Dude, we're, we're, we're close to finishing this game. Uh, I'm excited, too. I'm actually, like, super stoked to see what, like, all of this is about. Uh, so then I can also, like, stop avoiding spoilers. <laughs> All right, so we're going to go. Whoa, that's right next to us. Jesus. That skyline was close. Um, let's go over this way. Yeah. Because this is uh, to... Yeah, this is towards the next tower, I believe. Uh, over here. Okay. Yeah, this tower's over here. All right, so we're going to check out this tower. See if we can make it, actually. I don't know. I don't have too much uh, stamina here. Yeah, and then the Ocula region. Oh, this is going to be so... This is good. Is that a Gleok in the sky? Around the tower? Oh, dear God. What is that too okay zora's domain is gonna be actually kind of wild here i don't know what to expect but it definitely isn't that okay hi gleok how's it going hello how how's it going guys oh my dear god oh he's after me he's after me where is he? Where is he? He's, up. He's right there. He's right there. He's going to snipe me, isn't he? Okay, run. So far, so good. Okay, we're almost to the tower. It's literally right there. I don't know where he went. Oh, he's still, he's still behind us. Okay, uh, do I have any stamina food here? Yes! Not much, but enough. This could work. I just need to make it across. We're almost to the tower. 
come on. One more gust to land. Okay. The, okay. We outran the flame Cleoc. Thank God. Oh, please make it. 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 Oh, just barely. Oh, my God. Oh, we just barely made that. Damn, dude. Damn. Okay. We're all fine. <laughs> Everything's good. Uh, so we just, you know, had to dodge a flame Gleok, you know, uh, and then make our way across Hyrule. And there was a lot that was going on. I'm not going to lie. Uh, but we ended up making it. So that's what's great. What the hell is this stuff? Yeah, I want to get the tower before we get to Zora. But what is this stuff? Huh? All this sludge. Oh, do I wash it? Wait, can I like wash it away with like water? I know water is like a mechanic we haven't really used yet. So I've been like looking an eye out, for, like keeping an eye out for like water itself. Because choo choo jellies, you can like use for water, right? Oh my god, I was right. Oh my big brain. Actually, big brain. Let's go. Damn! Hey, you see dirt, you wash it away with water. That's how it works. Okay. This is one of the last towers that we gotta get. Uh, link to mission control. We are a go! What the hell is that? Oh, there's so much. What the? That's disgusting. What the hell's... Huh? What is this place? Okay, what's... Dude, what is happening with Zora's Domain right now? Yeah, it's like... It's all muddy. There we go. Oh, oh, that, that's supposed to be water. Ew. Oh, God. Okay. Yeah. 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 Something, something bad's happening here. <laughs> uh, eh. Yeah. <laughs> Piss water. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, there's a sphere here. Any sphere squad? What's moving? What the hell? Anyone in Sphere Squad right now? Oh, there's a shrine in here? What? Okay. Sure. That's kind of cool. Yeah, it's like the Death Star. A flying device. Okay. Uh, so we have gliders here. Can I just glide off the side? Can I just glide off the entire... I meant to do that, actually. Uh, I actually meant to do that. Uh, that was that was like on purpose. Uh, you know. Oh, okay, we got it. We got it. We got it. Okay. So I need it to go up. Um, can this glide all the way? No, I can't glide all the way. Okay. That was literally not worth it then. Um, then how do we make this glide all the way? Uh, clearly, uh, with, uh, this. Okay, but how do we bring this back up? And sleds? Why do we need sleds? Huh? What is the shrine?
I do have an idea, though. What? Okay, I have a stupid idea. A really stupid idea. I don't think I care about this puzzle. Okay? I'll be honest. It, it seems like an okay puzzle. Like a very mediocre puzzle. Where's the glider here? Okay. Oh, oh, maybe I use this to like cat. Wait, let me let me see if I can like catch it with this. Okay. Okay, nice. All right. So then we got that. Um, there's another glider here. Uh, do the gliders keep coming? Like, keep spawning? Oh, yeah, they, they do keep launching. Okay. I missed it. Damn it. Okay. All right. Let me try to get another sled real quick. Shit. That's fine. Okay. Watch this, guys. Uh, I'm going to solve this in the best way you've ever seen. Nice. All right, got another glider. Awesome. So are the gliders going to keep spawning or is it only like a maximum of like two? Let me, let me cook guys. Let me cook. Important here. Use recall to stop time and then grab this. Okay, so it seems like it's a maximum of two gliders. Okay. So then if I take this up here, the stupidest idea. Wait, that one's not like launching for some reason. That's okay. That's fine. Okay. All right, here we go. There are no stupid ideas, chat. There are no stupid ideas. So let me take this. Um, and then I think I can... Um, patch over here. That works. Oh, it's shoot. Okay. Guys, I'm an engineer, okay? I have my degree in engineering. This is worth it. No, 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 no. Okay, wait, that actually worked. Oh my God, wait, this could actually genuinely work. Okay, let him cook, literally, let him cook. Yeah, that works. Okay. That works. That works. Okay. If I take this.
Perfect. Okay. Okay. I think I can make this work. <laughs> All right. Give me some extra height here. Wait, no. No, no, no. One sec, one sec. Oh, it might just be better to bomb jump. Uh. Wait, let me, let me, if, okay. Let me take this over here then. Okay. Then I have idea. So let me take, no, that's not it. Uh, where's, I have some wood around here somewhere, right? Yeah. Okay. And then here. Really? Are you kidding? There we go. Okay. So we got that. And then I think this will be better. And where's my Hylian pine cone? Okay. Oh, does that not create an updraft? Really? I thought it would. Okay, I can't take out this. But if I already have it. Okay. Okay. Hear me out. Hear me out, guys. Hear me out. I don't think any of you guys are hearing me out right now. I, I actually don't think any of you guys are hearing me out right now. And I uh, want to say that I'm disappointed in you. Oh, shoot. Damn it. Wait, I didn't want to go back inside. Okay. What if I'm hard of hearing? No, just, but like, but like, hear me out. Okay. <laughs> Listen to me. I, I think, I think I have a solution. I can do this. Mega Smash, thank you so much for the five month membership. Welcome back. Glad Tears of the Kingdom is awesome. I was just afraid was, I was going to find it boring. Yeah, same. I was actually afraid too. Um, but I'm glad that they uh, uh, did it better. Or I'm glad they did it. I'm glad that they did it very well. Okay. Okay. Okay, here we go. So let me do this. Okay. How far does this make it, though? It makes it pretty far, actually. It actually makes it really far. Wait, we can do this. No! Oh, damn it! Wait, wait. That's the idea, though. That's the idea. What if we used our rocket shield right at the end? Damn it. I think I think it could literally work. Stop. 
There it is. Oh, okay. It'll just keep respawning. Okay. Wait for it. Oh my god, of course when I stop going away, it stops. Okay, there we go. Let's do rewind. Okay. And then now we do it. Okay. Okay. Right about, I think, here. Okay. Okay. Wait. That might just work. Oh, please. 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 It's so close. Oh, are you kidding me? Are you actually serious right now? Are you serious? Are you actually kidding? You can't be, you can't be serious. It's right there. It's right. It's literally right there. I think I went a little too early. Probably went a little too early. We're doing this. I like we're 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 literally doing this. I don't care, chat. We're we're doing this. Okay. Uh let's do blah 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 da, 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 take out device da, 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 fuse the rocket and then we go in. Okay. Okay. I wonder if we could like do some like weird like recall shenanigans. I don't know. Okay. I just need to be closer. You kidding? There we go. All right, I'll stay in the middle. I'm going slightly to the right as well. Right? Okay. It's going actually extremely well. Wait. Are we actually just going to... Make it? Wait. What? Huh? Wait. Can you literally just... You don't even... You can just skip the shrine with just properly. I'm so confused. There's no way. What? That's there's no puzzle there. You don't even have to do a puzzle. I can't. I can't believe it. I actually can't believe it. You can just glide. I thought I had to use a rocket too. You've got to be kidding me, dude. That's crazy. You just stand still and like slightly to the right. I'll dig it. Don't mind, don't mind if I do. Yeah, I thought I was supposed to go like like um back so it get some lift and then go back down, you know, like it was so so it was supposed to like do that. But no, you can literally just go down. Okay. Uh oh. And then, um, what can we get from you? Uh, let me do this. 
All right, give me rockets, though. I want rockets from this Gamba. Huh. Uh, no, we got some new things. We got the cart. Oh, I, okay, cool. We got a cart uh, and a beam emitter. Shoots a beam with its horn. Cool. And wings and stuff. Okay. Okay. Bro didn't even cook. He just got takeout and went home. Accurate. Actually accurate. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Uh, let me actually remove my rocket shield just in case I accidentally use it. I want that for backup. Okay. So what the hell is happening here with Zora's domain? Oh, we actually, we get the tower. We got the tower, yeah. Uh, let's check it out. Yeah, what the hell? I mean, I can just go to Zora's domain, but I want to like go through it a little bit too. And we've gotten to the point where like we can probably just like teleport over, but um, if we like go through it, I'm I'm curious to see like what all of this is. Yeah, whoa. Ew. Ew, what is this? It makes me move really slowly. Ugh. Oh, the sludge, dude. Oh, it's grody. Ludo's crossing. Oh, hello. Oh, and there's stuff falling from the sky, too. That's like polluting the water. Yeah. Ew. Ew. Oh, God. Yeah, this is a lot. Okay, hello, guys. How's it going? Okay, I'm going to beat you guys uh, with this Colgara Reaper. Oh, okay. It's a sword? Really? Okay, I didn't know. Okay, nice. Got the boss goblin. Oh, it's a blue boss goblin. Okay, I can like beat you in like three tries or three hits. Okay, you can also beat me in three hits or two hits. One of them. Nice. Damn. Sheesh. Beat him in like five seconds. Let's go. Ooh, a red choo choo jelly. I don't think we've ever gotten one of those. Uh, goblin fangs, all this stuff. You dropped a, um, a soldier's claymore. I don't. I think I want it. Yeah. I can't pick it up anyways. So, all right, let's continue on to Zora's domain over here. God, that's disgusting. What has happened here? Ugh. Yeah. Um, so chat, uh, this is what happens uh, to your sewage when you, uh, when you dump it out. Ew. Oh God. It keeps falling from the side sky too. Uh, this is the poop domain. My God. Uh, okay, a little grody. Hard to walk through. Okay, well, let's, let's figure out what's up with this. Oh, and then we're going to see Sidon as well. Oh, it's been a while. It's been an, a, a, a hot second and since, uh, since we've seen Sidon. I'm actually, like, pretty stoked for that. Uh, I wonder. This, like, is there, like, some mini Zoras as well? Some baby Zoras? Okay, so there's a shrine down there. Uh, oh, looks like it, it's not raining all the time either because Valruda isn't here. Now we still don't know what happened to the Divine Beast, but, and I'm, I'm getting a suspicion. I'm getting a suspicious feeling that um, there's actually no mention of the Sheikah technology in the past, um, that they're just kind of sweeping that under the rug. <laughs> but, you know, whatever. Uh, all right, let's, uh, yeah, let's, let's see Zoro's domain since Breath of the Wild. Whoa. It's disgusting. Oh, that's actually so gross. Ew. Uh, let's go get the shrine first. The Mogawak shrine.
All right. Uh, what is this? The power of water. Okay. So this is like somewhat of a tutorial for this location. So before we go, uh, the power of water. Uh, we just need to go up there. That's the thing. Um, now, normally I'd just be like, hey, let's just use the send. Can we do that? You know? Haha. <laughs> Uh, but no, we can't because we need to probably wait. Can we? No, we can't. We need to be a little bit higher. Can we cheese this? <laughs> can we like actually cheese this? Okay, so this is like a a water thing. Or, no, this is like a battery, whatever. I just need to get a little taller. So can I like go here? And then do this? Oh no. Why not? <laughs> Why not? What's in the way? Uh, let's see. Dude, I feel like solving shrines in like the weirdest ways is more fun than solving them like the correct way, you know? Okay, one second. Okay, so that's not tall enough. What is this? Okay, wait, actually, let's let's do this. I think this is... Okay. Oh. Oh, we have to make a... um. Um, like a motor here. If we do this, like a paddle, and then uh, do this. Awesome. Okay, then we can uh, create some um, uh, some electricity here. Okay, why do we need that? Um, I think the next thing we need to do is something with this. Got some balls here. Nice. Um, that need to be connected via power. I wonder, can I just like, do I have electric choo-choo jellies? I don't, I have shock fruit though. No, I do, I have electric choo-choo jellies. Can I just like, put one down and like electrify it? That worked for a, for a little bit there. <laughs> okay, that actually does work though. Okay. And then let me put one over here. And then, so if I just, I just need to open long enough. No. Okay. That didn't work. <laughs> but like, imagine if it did, that'd be sick. Uh, all right. I think this probably is like an electricity, like emitter or something that I can like put on this, like this spot. Right? No. Or something so i put it here and then i activate uh okay so no that's not that's not what we're supposed to do here uh i can put this maybe on the electricity oh maybe it charges it it's it's a chargeable battery i think oh my god it totally is oh that's that's cool that's cool that's cool so we're literally like charging the battery so that we can put it down Aha! Yes. Uh, but we need to do it before the battery discharges all the way. Oh, we got an opal. Cool. Okay. <laughs> we also got a death. Oh, I knew that was good. I, I just, you know, sometimes you need to take a strategic death in shrines, you know, when you think, when you like, you know, sometimes it's just like, I need to purposefully uh, die here uh, because I was too smart, right? I, I, I was solving it too fast and I wanted to make sure that you guys, um, you know, all of your, all of your uh, um, egos wouldn't be hurt. By me solving the, the solutions like too quickly. So you know what? You're actually welcome. 
uh, you're welcome for uh, protecting your uh, your lives. Um, I don't want you guys to seem inferior to my intelligence. <laughs> All right, let's charge that. And then we can put that uh, battery uh, on here, right? Yep. Uh, but I want to do that when I'm in. Okay, that was that was not what I had planned there. Uh, we'll do this. Put it there. And then, uh, uh, I'll just do it the better way, I guess. Okay, nice. Yo, team. Okay, that's two light, three lights of blessing. Oh my God, we're completing so many shrines. Okay. Uh, wow, dude, this... God, Zora's Domain looks awful. <laughs> like, geez. What is going on here? It's like an environment. It's a full environmental disaster. Is this Flint, Michigan? Like, what's going on? Uh, and then we can go up, right? I don't know why today has such a strong Michigan vibe to it, but, you know, we'll take it. What, should I have said, like, the, uh, like, Ohio? Like, is that, is that too soon? Oh, God. Oh. Jeez. Oh, wait. Is that... Is that Sidon? It's Sidon! Whoa! Sorry, I cleaned it off. Uh, splash room. I'll have splash food. Um, please accept my apologies. Uh, I'm grateful that everyone is all right. Now, we can only do something about that statue. I, I did something. Um, are you a traveler? I'm sorry. I did not notice you until now. Uh, Zora's domain is, uh, in troubled times of the present due to the sludge falling from the sky. Things have finally calmed down. However, this precious statue remained covered in sludge. Hmm. We were just discussing, uh, how we need to wash away the sludge. Regardless, I... Wait, what's this? I did it! <laughs> They're really, like, doing the most with this. Oh. Wait, is that us on the statue? The sludge. I see you've managed to wash it away. Uh, the statue is a symbol of hope for Azora. Very precious to us. Thank you so much for cleaning it up. Yes. In truth, that statue depicts the majestic form of the pair who saved this cherished domain in the past. Yeah, it's literally us. Beloved Prince Sidon and his very best friend, Sir Link, the heroic Hylian swordsman. That's us. Ah. It's simply wonderful, isn't it not? Um, how I would love to meet him someday. So you have a similar statue to the Hylian hero. Similar eyes as well. Oh my. And you were also a Hylian. Yeah, I mean, you can... I, we're wearing a mask right now, but... I mean... That's what the point of the mask is! Sorry. Um, yeah, no, we're wearing a mask right now, so I don't, I don't know if you can see our face, but... Um, and you're also a swordsman. Wait, could it be? I, hi, I'm Link, actually. Yeah, I am the swordsman of legend. Um... Uh, <clears throat> Please remind, uh, remember to remind your manners. Um, uh, all right. Please accept my apology. Yes. Uh, please pardon our rudeness. Uh, I'm quite surprised to learn that you are the legendary swordsman, Mr. Link. Uh, I've heard mention of you nearly every day since I arrived at this domain. I am Prince Sidon's, or forgive me, I'm your best friend's fiance. Oh! <laughs> oh! Let's go, Sidon! Beyonce? Let's go. Where's the ring? Yeah, you know, like, damn! Okay. Oh, I'm also... My name is Yonia. Uh, Yona. Um, I also want to say, um, for every every Sidon stand um, uh, out there, I'm so sorry. <laughs> but he's taken. Uh, but let's go, Sidon! Yo, best friend! Hey, let's hype him up! Am I going to be his best man? Oh my god, when's the wedding? Dude, I didn't know about this. I'm truly honored to have the opportunity to meet you, Sir Link. Yona, caretaker of the Zora. 
I'd heard that you were missing along with Princess Zelda. May I ask what brings you here? I just think that such a thing took place beneath Hyrule Castle, and now you're traveling to the kingdom to investigate? So your search for Princess Zelda is what brought you to this domain? Sure. Uh, in, in that case, feel free to investigate the area around the domain as thoroughly as you see fit. Uh, actually, I have a lovely idea. If you don't mind, I ask that you please go and meet with Sidon. I'm certain that he'd be delighted to see you. Yes! I gotta support my best friend! The sign can be found at Mifa Court, located at the peak of Polymus Mountain. Okay. Oh. That's where we found the Lionel last time. Uh, in Breath of the Wild. Uh, Lady Yona, it's time. I fear we must be going now. Uh, forgive me, Sir Link, but I must be on my way. Uh, but if it pleases you... Uh, after you've met with Sidon, perhaps you could visit me in the infirmary on the floor above. I'm determined to be of assistance uh, as best as I can. <laughs> I just love our, our stupid face. <laughs> the sludge-covered statue um, has been complete uh, unintentionally. Um, I actually completed the shrine before I even knew it. So, uh, whoopsies. Uh, let's actually change into our trip here. Because that's why we got it. Damn. Um, okay. Yeah, oh, plus with our sword. Oh, we look so cool right now. Wait, 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 wait. Chat, we look so cool right now. <laughs> ah, yeah. That's so cool. I love it. Okay, this is where uh, the shrine was in Breath of the Wild. Bright-eyed crab. Uh, stamina, okay. The best boy, seal shield. I'd love to see him. Uh, let me do this. Actually. Oh, crap. crap. Ugh, the sludge, dude, is so gross. Ugh. Okay, so we got to go see Sidon on Polymus Mountain, which is way, way up there. Um, it's always been a difficult to climb Zora's Domain because of all the water. Uh, but I'm wondering if, like, we have a better option. Uh, I mean, we also have, like, Ascend now. Rather than what we had before in Breath of the Wild, which was, uh, nothing. We also did, I mean, we did have the Zora's armor, which was nice. But, um, besides that, it was essentially nothing. So. Um, and we're going to Mipha's court. Rip Mipha. I do, I do like how they actually, like, canonically killed off everybody. And they, you know, in Breath of the Wild... And they weren't just like, it wasn't like a cop out. Like, oh, we, once you save them, they're saved forever. And then now you can be all happy. It's like, no, they're gone. Ganon killed them. Uh, sucks to be you, you know, anyways, right? Actually pretty neat. God, Zora's domain. Oh God, look at the poop. Oh God. Princess um, Mononoke core. I've never seen Princess Mononoke. I feel like I should. Yeah, it's disgusting. Oh my god. Uh, well, how do I get up here? I mean, I can't climb the uh, waterfalls like I used to. So we gotta figure out somewhere else. Um, probably like up here. Um, yeah. Okay, yeah, I think we go to the dam. I'm joking? No, I, I'm not joking. I'm serious. I haven't, I haven't seen it. Um, I have seen, uh, from Studio Ghibli, I have seen, uh, Grave of, wait, is Grave of Fireflies Studio Ghibli? No, As the Wind Rises. Um, I've seen Spirited Away, Ponyo, Castle in the Sky, Howl's Moving Castle, a lot of castles. Um, I've seen my neighbor Totoro. Oh, this is where, this is where, uh, Varuda was. What the hell? Oh, they're pumping some. Ah, yes. Yes. So I think I've figured this out. So Elden, uh, Volcano, the Gorons was all about drugs, right? Um, I thought the Gerudo, uh, had to deal with mining rigs, but no. Turns out that uh, we're going to pump crude oil right into Zoro's domain. Got to get all those big bucks out for that, that goddamn oil. 
Ain't that right, fellas? Dude, dude, I'm, I'm, I'm just saying. I'm just saying if America saw this right now, uh, we'd invade. Uh, just saying. I'm just putting it out there, all right? That's that's Jesus Christ. Like, like there'd be some sort of political upheaval in which we're like, oh, we actually have to take care of this. Um, turns out um, Zora's domain is um, uh, uh, bleeding oil, uh, which is going to activate the military industrial complex uh, to... Um, sort of mobilize in order to um, take care of Zora's domain. Ain't that right, fellas? <laughs> Yeehaw! America! Oh, God. I would say, um, I would say no one hates Americans more than Americans, but uh, that's actually, like, so... Now that I think about it more, it's that's so untrue. I think everybody hates us more than we hate ourselves. But like, we also hate ourselves. Like, I just want to put that out there. Like, don't worry. Don't worry. We like it's not it's not without it's not without uh cringe. Okay. Uh, wow. All right. Uh, I guess. Okay. So we climb up the mountain, uh, this way, uh, through these ruins, looks like, uh, kind of around where like Varuda is. This is grody, dude. Ugh. Nice. Easy. All right. So how do we get up? Past here, Apollonus Mountain. Uh, there's a couple of ways we can do it. Uh, but Ascend seems to be the uh, prevalent one. Uh, the, the most appropriate one. Uh, and the best one. Yeah. Um, I actually kind of like doing this. Yeah, without the uh, the, the, the tunic. I, there's pro the tunic probably still exists in this. The tunic probably still exists in this game, you know? Uh, but, uh... Uh, I have yet to see it. So. Uh, oh, oh. Uh, I guess we can climb up. Um, I wish I wish we did have Revali. Like Revali's Gale was really, really nice. So I do kind of miss it. I'm not gonna lie. Um, oh wait, I can make it up here. So I do kind of miss it. I'm not gonna lie. Um, but. Uh, two Lin is actually pretty good too. Um, it's like a close second. Yeah, uh, I kind of I do really like how they come up with uh, four different four different abilities, uh, and they've actually like, kept them like pretty unique. So it's not like oh this is exactly like the same ability recycled but like slightly different, you know? Okay, come on, Link! Come on, Link! Come on, Link! 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 Fuck! <laughs> Okay, maybe this is an easy way to get up. Yeah, let's go over this way. Oh, you actually, the electric whiz rope made back. Let me miss three times in a row. Jesus. Okay. There we go. Hey, uh, chat, uh, for those who have actually, like, seen it yet, um, how'd you guys like the recent video on the channel? Uh, the edited, um, uh, the second part edited playthrough of Tears. Was it, was it everything you've ever hoped it was? Or have, uh, the majority of you just still not see it yet? Oh, what the? Oh, we can go inside of Zora's Apollonus Mountain Cave. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. All right, uh, let's go through uh, the cave and go find side it. I'm going to splice for the editors and then record again. Chat, say hi to the editors. Really good. Okay. I haven't watched it yet because I'm watching the stream. Oh, that's also valid too. Uh, let's see. I want to do more Ashend shenanigans. 
<laughs> oh, but it's it's like wet mountains, so it's gonna be oh god. Okay. But the first edited video was great. I'm glad you liked it. I'm glad you guys liked it. Um we're really trying our hardest to get them out fast, but then also like with some like high, high quality. The next one out uh the next one won't be out for like a couple days. I actually might finish the game on stream uh, before the next one's out. Uh, I, actually I'm pretty confident that'll happen. Uh, I'm pretty sure that will. So. Um, in the yeah, I mean the second video is about uh, like the halfway point too. Uh, maybe slightly less than halfway. So, you know. Really? Oh, it's a kid up there. It's right there. It's right there. Okay, we got it. Alrighty, nice. All right, so so literally making your way up. Uh, is wait what is this wait oh i thought we would go to side and through this what is this thing a climber's bandana oh yes oh that's actually gonna help so much for climbing we have now times two climb speed up oh that's huge that's actually huge uh can i like ascend through this mountain though maybe maybe possibly all right, then this means that we should be able to go all the way up to the top of Fall this Mountain. Wow, this is actually... We're, wow, we're, we're really going. Oh, we are. Um, I feel as if that we came here from a weird, weird angle, but... What the hell? Okay, Sidon's supposed to be around here. Oh, there. Okay, Sidon's over there. Oh. Well, first off. Okay, let me do the shrine here. <laughs> I'm glad we got some Chichi jellies. All right, and then we'll see Sidon after the shrine. Uh, mid air perch. Uh, okay. So we're supposed to kind of just like do this. Oh. Okay. Oh, wait. Wait. I feel as if like we could like really get some cheese going. Okay. So we're going to do this. Okay. Solved it. Okay, cool. Um,. Oh, I solved it, and then I didn't solve it. My bad. You, like, you, my favorite thing to do uh, when doing, like, this. Really? Okay. Wait, one second. My favorite thing to do uh, is, like... Are you kidding me right now? Why is that happening? There we go. Okay. Uh, my favorite thing to do with, with this stuff is to, like... Uh, take the materials from one puzzle and then put it um, on the next puzzle and see if we can like cheese it like that, you know? Okay. There we go. Okay, so then this is the next one. Puzzle. Where we have to like put this. Okay. So if I just like hit this really quick. It's like a moving bridge. Like that will float. <laughs> okay. All right. This absolute monstrosity is beautiful. Oh, and then there's another one here, which, oh, we can just, I think we can just literally use what we have already right here to do it. Yeah. Okay, what, sorry, one sec. This is disgusting. This is the worst thing I've ever created. What monstrosity is this? Oh, damn it. One sec.
I, I refuse to change it. I, I, I am going to just do this. Right, and then go here. And then... No, damn it. Um, Why does it keep doing that? Why change perfection if you've reached it already, you know? Okay. There we go. I got it. I got it. There we go. Okay. The double jump with the shield jump is too good. Alrighty. So the next, we have this. Oh, there's so many more. Okay. Let's bring our blob. Let's give our blob more things to do with. How do we, how do we like... Do this one. Okay. Um, and bring it all together with that. Okay. Oh, and then can I just like attach this to the end? Yeah. Oh, that works. Okay. And then I'll just take this and this just like put it across like here. Right. And like that works. <laughs> right, guys? <laughs> <laughs> okay, we did it. Ah, oh, easy, dude. Dude, easy shrine. Actually beautiful. That's how you solve it. The blob bridge. Blodrick is alive. Is alive. Hey, you can solve 90% of the problems in this game with bridges. Putting it out there. Oh, Blobrick. That's his name. All right, Light of Blessing. That's four. All right. May the Light of Blessing uh, grant you the strength that you seek. Oh, and I, you know what? And it will. And it goddamn will. Okay. Now let's go do Sidon. Uh, the quest. the Do the sided quest. <laughs> Let's go continue with the main quest that happens to involve Sidon. Alright, yeah. This is it. In Mipha Court. This is uh, a new spot that they made. I guess after Mipha. In order to honor her. Uh, hello? Oh, it's Sidon. Hello? Hi, Sidon. Hello! Him. Is it really you? <sighs> Sidon! Our best friend! <laughs> Listen to the. It's good to see you, my friend. Dude, the, the music is the entrance music from Valruda in Breath of the Wild. I love that detail! <laughs> uh, Link, it has been far too long. I received word that you had gone missing and was beside myself with concern. What could have transpired? Okay, I just, I, I love Sidon here. I'm not going to lie, but I can't help but think that this is just like coffee and Taco Bell mixed together. You know, like you feel me? It's like, it's like maybe you have some coffee, maybe you got some Taco Bell an hour later. Um, anyways, what could have transpired? No. Uh, to think something like that could have been taking place beneath Hyrule Castle. And afterwards, you mysteriously woke on a sky island. Hmm. The sky, could it be that the sky is the key to everything after all? Huh. Uh, anyways, uh. Yeah, we did awaken in the Sky Island. What? What? Th that does make me question. How did we get up there? Why are the Sky Islands up there? I've actually been wondering if these floating Sky Islands could be the source of the falling sludge. That's why I've tasked a Zora historian with investigating ruin fragments and all the historical documents. Mm -hmm. As for me, I'm not at liberty to leave the spot at the present as I'm uniquely qualified to deal with the sludge here. Okay. Uh, you see, old friend, this place is the source of water that flows into Zora's domain. That is why I must use my power of water manipulation to separate the sludge from our water in order to clean it. If I cease, then the sullied water will flow into our beloved home. That's why I cannot afford to leave here, no matter what. Hmm. Say, Link, it does not seem that Princess Zelda's whereabouts might be related to the floating sky islands and the ruins? Yeah. <sighs> so perhaps you should go and speak with our historian, Giotto. His many years have blessed him with great wisdom. 
quite possible that he can provide you with some useful information. At present, you should be able to find Giotto continuing his investigation at Toto Lake. By the way, I hope you know that I'm truly happy to see you again after such a long time apart, my dearest friend. Visit me anytime you like. Your presence is never anything less than welcome and appreciated. Okay, so Sidon is purifying the water here uh, of the sludge that is falling from the sky. So we got to talk to Giotto. Um, are you Giotto? Oh. No. Gaddison. Okay. Mm. Only daughter of Duna is... Okay. Um, a veteran soldier is simply not being for him to get distracted he's apart from his daughter. Um, okay. Uh, yeah, so... Okay, we can go talk to Giotto. And Giotto is the Zora historian that'll let us know about the connection between the Sky Islands and Zelda. Um, we don't know uh, the Sky Islands and Zelda, actually. Like, at all. Um, we don't know why they appeared where they like how they appeared or anything uh, or why like when we fell into the chasm we appeared at the sky island there's a lot of like really weird things that are going on and i'm glad that we'll probably find some answers okay now, let's go down uh the historian might be around here somewhere is this unless i'm like Stupid here. Uh, and, uh, speak to Giotto at Toto Lake. Oh, is wait, where's Toto Lake? They're like, oh, Toto Lake's over there. Oh, whoopsies, I'm going the wrong way. Yeah. How do we stop the sludge? Like, is there like, like, what's going on? I guess we're gonna like fight another boss in the sky like Rito maybe oh, that was really cool uh we haven't really fought any bosses in the oh no we did go to the depths with Gorons which was a really cool touch might I add you know there's a, there used to be a lion uh li not lion a Lionel um there used to be a Lionel uh on Polymus Mountain that was like what you would you'd have to defeat the Lionel or like like sneak around the Lionel to get like all of the shock arrows. Um and I haven't seen a single Lionel <laughs> actually. Like at all. Um this entire playthrough. Like I haven't seen one. I mean we saw one in a memory, but I wonder if they like still exist. Right, so this is Toto Lake, looks like. And we uh, speak to the historian, Giotto, here. Are you? Are you Giotto? No, you're Dunma. Um, do not conduct an investigation more appropriately. Uh, it's not as it sounds, really. Uh, Giotto keeps interacting with dangerous things. That makes things quite difficult for me, as it's my job to guard him. Do uh, you see the opening there? Uh, that's uh, The cliff crumbled as a result of the upheaval that revealed ancient ruins. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, Giotto's a historian, so this is uh, his specialty. All right, let's go. Yeah, let's go talk to Giotto. Hello, Giotto. Uh, looks like you got some ancient ruins here. Oh, right. It's the old guy um, from, from Breath of the Wild. Uh, yes, uh, this dignified presentation. Um, uh, yes, the writing looks like waves upon a stormy sea. Extraordinary. Uh, this ancient stone slate was written by our Zora ancestors from the distant past. Um, uh, yeah. Whoa. Stand upon the land of the skyfish, a droplet, the watery bridge. Okay. Hmm. I wonder what that means. Lost. I cannot decipher it. Uh, Link. Uh, my apologies. I was deep in thought. In any case, I have news. I've made a monumental ah. discovery. This is undeniably an ancient Zora stone slate. Uh, better still, upon its surface, there appears to be text regarding the sky. However, the slate is broken. And so I'm unable to read it in its entirety. Uh, I wish I could re... I wish I could view the full text. Okay, so are we... Yeah, okay, we have to find the rest of the broken slate. What I'm assuming is probably somewhere around Toto Lake. Uh, here? Yeah, we need to find the rest of the broken slate. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Um, in order to... Uh, open it for G oh oh speaking of which there's one here but um uh, we need to throw water uh, at it 
Wait, is this actually the rest of the broken slate? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, that was fast. It was actually ridiculously fast. Oopsies. Nice. All right, what do these Sky Islands say then? Or what does this ruin say? <gasps> what is this? I can hardly believe my eyes. Link, I must thank you. Ah. Incredible, I can finally read it uh, very well. Stand upon the land of the skyfish and behold its lofty view. Among the floating rocks you see, a droplet waits for you. Okay. Through this droplet, shoot an arrow with the mark of the king. And do this task and you shall reveal a most wondrous thing. The mark of the king. Okay. See the watery bridge's resting spot with your own two eyes. That which connects the Zora and its people to the sky. This is an extraordinary discovery. I wonder what this is. Okay. Uh, though in truth, that mystery just leads us straight into another. One difficulty has been overcome, yet another has appeared in its wake. As I mentioned, the mark of the king. Perhaps it would be prudent to consult King Dorofin. Oh, he's still alive. I assume he'll be returning from his investigation of the sludge shortly. Oh, okay. So we have to shoot the mark of a king at like a watery bridge. Is it? Um, and then some things will appear. I might have gotten that a little bit wrong. Um, however... Uh, we should probably consult King Dorofin, uh, who is probably nearby here. Yo, I got food from uh, um, Abigail. That is so good. Oh my god. Chat, say thanks to Abby for feeding me food so I can continue streaming for you all. Mm. That's so good. That is so good. Um. Okay. Uh. Are, uh let me check to see if there's like a shrine here, so we can like teleport back or not. You know. Uh. And then we'll continue going. Okay. Yeah. Uh, all right. Let's go to King Dorofin then. Uh, I didn't know he was still alive. Um, so I'm happy he is. I kind of assumed that he would die for some reason over the past couple of years uh, between Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom. So. All right. Here we go. What's for food? Oh, I didn't show you that. Uh, it's like teriyaki chicken. Super nice. Okay, here we go. Zora's domain, King Dorofin uh, should be returning soon. Is he not here? Or The king's in trouble. What? Oh, no, I got beat. Oh, they're playing a game. Uh, you got me, you big dumb monster. There's no other choice. I'll, I'll have to hide in the secret spot. And the spot is... Hmm? What's up, my guy? We're full up on folks who are allowed to play our King Dorovan game. Uh, we can't keep playing uh, with you here. So take a hit and scram. Oh. Okay. Interesting. Where would King Dorovan be? Um, Clues to the sky. Yeah. Where is King Dorovan? He should be re uh, returning from his uh, investigation about the sludge soon. So, where is King Dorf? Is that something about a secret spot? I don't know if that's like accurate to where he is. That might be like we might have to find where King Dorfin is. Oh, healing, nice. Hmm. Where is the king? All right, let me let me try this again. Uh, let me like let me try uh, again to. Oh well, first off, let's get a stamina or heart. One of those. Guys, should we get hearts or stamina here? We have thirteen hearts, by the way. Um, heart or stamina? I'll let you guys choose.
All right, stamina it is. So King Dorfin should be like up here. Yeah, the secret spot where King Dorfin's hiding. It's what's up, my guy? Huh? Um. Okay, so we have to like sneak around, I guess, maybe, <laughs> and figure out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's sneak around. Let's like go over here. Um, it was this? Learnings of the Zora, Anna Group 2. Um, I, Sidon, was entrusted with the great task of renovating the Zora stone monuments that had fallen to ruin. There are 11, um, stone monuments in total. Now, the former text written by my father, uh, could not be salvaged, and so sadly it had to be replaced. Uh, whispers are bound that it's inappropriate for someone my age to write over the king's glorious words, but they do not realize there was King Dorfin himself who ordered me to undertake this restoration project. Father says it's not set in stone. That should be the one to inherit the throne. It's not as matter blood alone. If we ask the eternal skies above whether I'm fit to rule, they shall remain silent, and so we must look to our fellow Zora. He urged me to use these monuments to share my learnings and speak to our people straight from my heart. Um, so I've inscribed these thoughts upon these eleven stones. I do not know how far reaching my words shall be, but it's my hope that they will reach whoever needs to hear them the most. So one of my sentence writes over my musings many years from now. I pray they resonate with whoever reads them. Oh, that's kind of heartfelt. I like that. All right, so let me ascend up here. Okay. Okay. How do I like listen in? What's up with all the smiley faces? Uh, people put smiley faces uh, so as to not to, uh, spoil anything. Listen in. Oh, yes. I did it. Uh, but the sludge is too thick and gross. I have failed. My king, King Dorvan. I'm pretty pleased. Oh, what if you went to that one place to hide? Hey, come on. Do it right. That didn't sound like him at all. All right. So they're playing make-believe. I can't play Muzu and the monster. Not all by myself. That's funny. Oh, I got some crackles. One second. Let me uh, restart my capture card chat. Um, in the meantime, uh, subscribe. This is your uh, best chance to subscribe uh, while I restart the capture card in the capture card software. Might as well do it. It's free. You can always change your mind later. All right, the secret spot where Dor King Dorfin is hiding. What kind of place is it? <laughs> you know, right? I asked King Dorfin about it once. He said it was a pristine sanct uh, sanctum. Okay. A pristine oh. sanctum. Um, I guess the spot with clear water where you can get your tummy clear and stuff. Okay, so he's hiding um, in a place between Polymus Mountain and the Domain. Um, and there's a secret behind a waterfall. Okay. A secret entrance behind a waterfall with clear water is where it is. Muzu told me we could never tell anyone. It's fine. No one's listening. Anyways, let's go through our game again. This time with feeling. Can we play something else? Okay, so if we want to find King Dorafan who knows things... It's hidden behind a waterfall uh, with clear water. So it's probably, it's one of these waterfalls here. Um, uh, between Palmas Mountain and the Domain. So it's probably either Lulu Lake or this one right here. Because uh, we actually already found this cave. So I think it might be Lulu Lake. Don't worry, nobody was listening. Except for a couple thousand people. Okay, there's a, a hiding spot behind one of the waterfalls here. Huh. Huh. 
Alright, not this waterfall. Uh, not this waterfall. Maybe this waterfall? Yeah, this seems like more of a hiding spot place. Okay. Uh, not this waterfall either, looks like. Okay. Uh, maybe it is, uh, this waterfall then? Over this way? Could be. This is the other waterfall. There's, there's one more after this. And it clears entrance behind a clear waterfall. Okay, not here either. So it's probably this waterfall. Um, yeah, it has to be. Literally has to be. Uh, and that it is. Ah, yes. Discovery. Pristine Sanctum. Behind the waterfall. Can I stand up here? Probably can. Yep. Right. Let's see King Dorfin. Uh. Um. He doesn't look so good right now. Um. King Dorfin? Oh, there's Muzu. Ah, who approaches? Is that you? So it is. Link. How did you find this place? What cruel ploy are you plotting? Ah, oh, God, I hate Muzu. Hold on. My ever loyal Muzu. If you speak in such a way without explanation, Link here will only be confused as what's going on. Zorfan, King of Zora. Hello, Link. It's been a while since last time we spoke. I'd received word that you went missing along with Princess Zelda. Why have you come here? Well, to think that such a thing would transpire for the hero of Hyrule and Princess Zelda. Uh, you expect us to believe that Zelda simply disappeared just like that? Do not sully our ears with your lies. I hate Muzu. Uh, I hate Muzu. If uh, I saw Muzu in real life, it would be on sight. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. You know, like there's... Uh, I, if he was in front of moving traffic and I was behind him, um, I wouldn't see anything. You know, I'd be blind in that moment. I'd lose my glasses. Crazy, you know? Um, what a prick. I saw Princess Zelda with my own eyes right after the phenomenon at Hyrule Castle took place. Oh. Okay, so Ganondorf was here. Hmm. Calm yourself, Muzu. Link's eyes betray no hint of deception. He remains a trusted friend of the Zora. There must be an explanation. Link, I will now tell you what happened when we last saw Princess Zelda, as well as the reason behind my seclusion here in Pristine Sanctum. Hmm. We encountered uh, Princess Zelda just after Hyrule Castle ascended to the sky. Floating islands appeared as if from nowhere. Sludge and fragments of ruins began raining down. Muzu and I had left the domain to investigate these strange occurrences. That's when it happened. Princess Zelda descended from the sky, accompanied by a sludge monster. What happened next was by surprise. She then unleashed the beast upon us. King Dorofan valiantly vanquished the threat. However, he was gravely injured by the sludge during the battle. As for Zelda, she vanished without a trace. Word got out that Princess Zelda lost her mind and harmed the Zora King. The resulting turmoil would be devastating. That's why we were temporarily remaining hidden within Pristine Sanctum. Oh. According to your story, Princess Zelda disappeared suddenly in the depths beneath Hyrule Castle. On the other hand, she suddenly appeared near Zora's domain and unleashed a monster upon us. The waters of truth have become murkier still, but from Zora's perspective, one thing is clear. It all leads back to the sky. This disaster, the sludge, the monster, and even Princess Zelda. It may well be the answer to these riddles. can only be found skyward. Titan ordered Giotto, a historian well acquainted with the ruins, to investigate. I wonder if any progress has been made. Uh, oh, so I've actually already I've already spoken with Giotto. Um, and the mark of the king was mentioned, though. Uh, it refers to a Zora King's scale, one of my scales, in other words. I've heard it called by the name you mentioned in an ancient ritual. However, none remain who know how it was used. If the particular scale of mine may prove if this particular scale of mine may prove useful to you, by all means take a few. There's no need for restraint. This is simply nothing to me. If you run out, simply return and acquire more. Okay. A king scale. Okay, cool. Um, so if we run out, per se, um, and just acquire more and acquire more and acquire more, uh, what's going to happen to you, my guy? Uh, after all that's transpired and after much reflection, I've come to a realization. I must truly be getting it on in years uh, to have allow a mere monster to catch me off guard. Perhaps the time is nearing for me to pass the title of king on to Sidon. King Dorofin. In any case, uh, that is a matter for another day. Uh, the chaos surrounding the sludge has quieted. 
Please inform Sidon about my situation in the King's Scale. Tell him that he needs to go forth and do what he needs to get done. Oh, he is not worse for wear. Oh, he looks worse for wear. Oh, boy. Oh, Lord. Okay. Um, well, let's go talk to Sidon. Uh, tell him about his father. Uh, and uh, that we got the King's Scale from him. So we can complete the ancient riddle and head skyward towards that monster that is raining sludge upon Lazora's domain. Wow, yeah, this is this is crazy. What the hell? What the hell? Okay. Hi, Sidon. Uh, I have news for you, but it's not good. <laughs> ah, Link, uh, have you made any progress in your search for Princess Zelda? Uh, what? You say my father was attacked by a monster and that Princess Zelda unleashed it upon him? What could that possibly mean? Uh, well, uh, for now, I feel all... Uh, for now, I fear all we can do is take my father at his word and try not to let her concern overcome us. Link, thank you for telling me about my father. Hmm. Princess Zelda descending from the sky, not to mention the monster in that filthy sludge. It seems our course is skyward. We now know that the mark of the king written uh, of on the scale refers to my father's scale. The only remaining mystery is that the land of the skyfish and the floating rock in the shape of a droplet. Stand upon the land of the skyfish. Okay. Hmm. Uh, I'm sure that if we locate the land of the skyfish, it'll lead us to the floating rock in the shape of a droplet. If you find any leads, let me know at once. Okay, the land of the skyfish. Uh, okay, well, everyone keeps telling us to look skyward. So, let's do so. Uh, oh. Oh, I, 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 I found it. It's in the shape of a fish. Okay. Yeah. 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 It's over here. So we need to get here somehow. Some. How the hell do we do that? How do we get up here? Oh, there it is. That's the solution. <laughs> wow. I wonder how we get up there. Uh, guys, I, I think I know how. Uh, I think we use uh, recall on that thing. All right, get out of the sludge. Oops. Ooh, I'll take these two. Uh, okay. And here we go. All right, let's go to the skyfish. That was actually um, a lot easier than I thought it would be to solve. Uh, it's just like in the shape of a skyfish. Uh, now we have to find something about the droplets. Uh, which I, I doubt there's any droplets that we can do here. Um, I mean, the only thing we can I can think of with droplets is... Um, whoa. I got some major lag with the game there. Okay. Uh, floating Scales Island. Yeah, only thing we do with the droplets is like wash it away with water. Is this what it's looking at? I mean, there's some watery stuff here, it looks like. Huh. The droplet. The droplet. And once we find this, we can find the droplet. That's like the answer? I mean, there's this. Everything else is like a bunch of Zora uh, islands or Zonai island stuff. The droplet. Um, is it over on the side here? Yeah. Uh, me fear is that um, we will be doing this for a hot second in order for me to find whatever this means. Wait, is this it? Or what is uh this is there's a uh mark right here. No. Uh let's see. Back to the adventure log. Uh if you find a clue about a watery bridge connecting Zora to the sky, you should let them know. 
a watery bridge. Oh, is it this? Is this the watery bridge? Oh, it totally is. That works. Uh, okay, well, this is the watery bridge connecting the um, Zora to the sky. Uh, so let me tell Sidon about it. Oh. Um, but, oh, I have to shoot like a scale at it or something. Um, yeah, let me let me check Sidon again real quick. Uh, the Mark of the King uh, is my father's scale. Uh, only rain mystery is the floating rock in the shape, uh, in the shape of a droplet found. Floating rock in the shape of a droplet. Okay. Okay. So we were there. I just need to find one of these that's in the shape of a droplet. Okay. It should be pretty obvious then. Um, and I should find it. Okay. Oh, that's funny. If you want to get up there, um, you can just use, uh, like, a hot air balloon if you want, I guess. That's kind of funny. Um, or you could just be a Giga Chad and use Recall. Okay. Yeah, shape of a droplet. Hmm. A floating island in the shape of a droplet. Uh, so we find this. We found the sky fish. Which is this is the sky fish island. Is there? Is this the droplet? Oh my god! <gasps> what? Wait, did I just figure it out? Oh my god, I just figured it out. That's crazy. Oh, that's such a cool oh that's such a cool puzzle. Oh, I love that. Look at this. The shape of a droplet, right? It's right here. And then we shoot. Uh where is it? Where is it? It's uh uh, the king. All right. Then we shoot a king scale through the droplet. Oh, damn! That's really cool. That's really cool. Uh, I, I think that has to be one of the coolest puzzles in the game so far. Because it shoots precisely at that moment, and then what happens here? Ooh, it's a way into the sky. That's cool. That's really neat. Let's go. Let's go, dude. Oh, I found that so fast, too. I'm so happy about that. Okay. Uh, let's go. Let's see. Let's talk to Sidon again about this. Just tell him about it. Uh, cause I mean, we could just go, but let me tell him about it real quick. You know? Uh, you were right here. That's not you. You're Kira. Um, okay. Oh, um, oh, Sidon's over here. Okay. Oh, Sidon's over here with, uh, Yona, his fiance. Lady Yona, it's far too dangerous for you to be here. Yes. Darling, I, I came here because there's something I need to speak with you about. And I've been thinking for quite some time. Oh, she's giving him the, we gotta talk. You know, the, the, hey, can we talk? The, oh, this has been going well, but we're like, do you mind if we hop on? Oh, no. Is, is the marriage called off? Hmm? Oh. <sighs> Uh, hello there, Link. Oh, I'm sorry for interrupting. <laughs> what happened, my friend? Did you figure something out? Oh, you solved the ancient stone slates. You solved the ancient stone slates riddle and a pillar of light appeared? 
The words upon the stone are correct. A path to the sky may open up and we investigate oh. the location. Well done, Link. This is a huge development. I see. <laughs> My dear Sidon, I think you should go with Link to investigate the Pillar of Light. As I was just about to say, for a long time, I've been concerned that you were holding yourself back and not acting as freely as I would have expected. Oh, oh no. Oh, Sidon, man. Oh, I thought I was going to be your best man. Oh, no. But my love, if you and Link are going to join your powers, I'm certain you should be. Uh, but my love, if you and Link join your powers, I'm certain you shall be able to overcome whatever danger awaits. Oh, oh, it's oh, it's all fine. Oh, we're we're all good. Oh, sorry, I was you know brain overthinking it a little bit. You know, I thought it was just gonna like you know happen. Oh, we're fine. Everything's good. We're good. We're good. We're good. All right, back up, back up, guys. All right, we're fine. All right, yeah, marriage is still on. Very you know, wedding's wedding's great. We cool. We cool. We cool. <laughs> Okay. But that is undoubtedly true. However, uh, whatever is troubling you, Sidon, uh, why are you hesitating so? Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, God. Sidon. <laughs> Sidon's about to do the... We're, we got to talk, you Yoda. We got to talk. Uh, it is simply that... Oh, huh? Ooh, what the hell? The sludge like. Oh God. <gasps> the monster's covered in sludge. Could be that foul beast that's harmed father. Mm. Now, Sidon, oh, we can take care of the water, at least for a little while. Do not fret about the domain. Huh. Uh, you're right as ever. It's up to you, m'lady. Mm. Uh, Link, please, I must ask that you fight my side once more. <laughs> m'lady. That beast is protecting its body with sludge. The mighty opponent certainly but we must not falter when an opportunity presents itself call out to me i shall use my power to envelop you in water thus shielding you from our foe oh at that point you may shoot forth the water as an attack by swinging your weapon sidon's power of water what you can create a bubble of water that blocks an incoming attack if you swing your weapon the water will be channeled into a long range strike also the music is amazing this is so cool okay Let's try this. Okay, so we're blocked. Like this, right? So you can't... It's a shield. Oh, okay. Um. Okay, can I just do this? Okay. So I'm gonna do this. Whoa! Okay. Oh, God. I hate the... I hate how the like like lurks. Uh, the, the, the sludge like just is. That's so gross. Right, hit there, and then we should be able to go. Yeah, yeah, that's a lot of damage. <laughs> yeah, we kind of have like end game weapons right now, so you know that would do a lot. Uh, let's let me use my flame gliok blade. That works. Okay, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Are you coming back? Okay. Nice. Can I just like hit you? No, I can't. Okay, but I can I can do that. Oh, oh, wait, this this actually works really well. Right, so I hit you with that with fire. You come out like that. Oh, okay. But I can like cheese. It's not even cheese. It just works. Okay, I need to be faster than that. Damn. Okay. Okay, nice. Oh, damn! Oh my god! Bro, let him live! <laughs> the corpse is on fire in the cutscene. Jesus. That was so much damage. Yeah, okay. Yeah, we do have endgame weapons. You didn't link. Take that foul beast of the sludge. Is everyone all right? Seem great. We're unharmed. All right, now back to our marriage. Yeah. <laughs> now back to what I was about to say. We got to talk. <laughs> uh, in any case, it's possible that another monster will reappear. I suggest that you return to the domain at once. Thank you for the sentiment, Sidon. However, more importantly, you must consider what Sir Link spoke of earlier. The pillar of light, he said, appeared at the reservoir, uh, begs to be investigated. Um, yes. Leave this place to us, dear Sidon. Your friend needs to uh, your friend needs help getting to the bottom of this mystery. Mm. Of course, it would be best for me to accompany him. However, 
Oh, I cannot leave you alone in this dangerous place. Do you not entrust the task to us already? We will not be on our own for long. We shall just be fine. Hmm. But, Sidon, my darling, I truly appreciate that you worry so far for my safety. It speaks to the kindness of your heart. But you're the prince of the Zora. One day, you will lead the people of your beloved domain and see right through you, whether you want me to or not. You're yielding to the fear of losing someone you love again. You must overcome your past and face whatever the future holds with courage. But I... Come now. Enough is enough! Oof. You are not acting like yourself! Hey now. You must leave this place to me! Sweet Sidon, don't get lost in the past. You must keep moving ever onward. Like my old self. Like I always do. Yes, yes. It's all right, I swear it. Oh, they make... Aw. They bring out the best of both of, uh, of each one. Like, they bring out the best of each one of them. That's so cute. I see. And there it is, clear as day. I was giving into my fear of once more losing, losing someone I love. Like, Mifa. He lost his best friend, Mifa. <laughs> ha! Ah. You're right, Yona. I will not give into this fear. Not to forsake my trust into you. I leave this place to you, my love. Oh. Off we go, Link. To the Pillar of Light. Yes! Yes! I shall blaze on ahead, my friend. I love I love that he has a fiance in this. That's, that's awesome. Uh, it seems Sidon has finally put his doubts behind him and returned to his usual feel of self. I'm so glad. At this time, uh, all this time, he was clinging to regret over being unable to save his precious sister, Mipha, my poor, tormented Sidon. And to think he was unknowingly paralyzed from taking action because he feared losing me as well. Whoa. Yet he has to overcome this trial and place his face in me. At last... The Sidon I know and love has come back to me. <laughs> Link, uh, please good take uh, please take good care of my dear Sidon. He is the sun in my sky. Okay. Uh, we got a chest from the uh, sludge lake. Okay. Royal Claymore yields a, far a pow yields a powerful flurry rush during a perfect dodge. Okay. Yeah, I like that. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Yeah, we'll use this. Uh huh. Um, let's see. I think I put my Gleok Flamehorn with it. I think I'd do that. Yeah. So we get the power of fire and also, yeah, and the Royal Claimer too. I like that. Yeah, let's see that. Also, I don't know if you guys remember, we got the Gloom Sword from defeating Phantom Ganon. It's so sick. It's a full katana. Damn. It's so cool. It's so cool. Uh, let's uh, let's also make some other weapons here because we definitely need to. Um, black horriblin horn. Um, and then um, the rusty halberd stick. Let me destroy the fuse. Material, we got the sturdy long stick. And then um, let me put a Gleok wing here. Oh, we haven't done one of those yet. Great, right, that works. Okay. Um, and that's, I think, all we'll take for now. Let me drop these two things so we don't need them. Okay. Uh, let's go on and uh, uh, investigate the light that brings us to the sky. Dude, I love that. That's like the best weapon we have. It's 41 damage and without like upgrades. Uh, so whatever, whatever we find, like the next biggest, like most important thing, we got to put it on that blade, like for sure. All right, here we go. Looks like this is uh, the pillar of light and let's go check it out. Here we go. East Reservoir Lake. Oh, and there's there's Sidon right there. Oh, cool. What's up, Sidon? How's it going? How how's it hanging? How you be?
Right, eating. All right, here we go. Let's see what this pillar of light is. <laughs> Look at us with our with our two uh, spears next to each other. That's such a fun. That's such a fun shot. So that's the clue for reaching the sky. Oh. We're hearing the voices of the ancestor. What was that? Uh, never mind. Uh, now's not the time for fights, uh, flights of fancy. Just where could that light be coming from? I have an idea. What's your idea? Oh, is it just like old times? Oh, no, it's not just like old times. You're making a whirlpool. Oh, oh, go on. Yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. Rance is going crazy. It's just as I thought. I can see an entrance at the bottom of the lake. I'll make a path for you. Dive in, Lee. Oh my god. Correct me if I'm wrong. Uh is is uh is Sidon does Sidon have a new voice actor? I, I I feel as if um I don't recognize the voice. I don't know. I don't think so. Oh, maybe maybe it's just me. Maybe I don't recognize it. All right, here we go. Oh, let's go in the middle. What is this place? Okay. Let's find out what's at the bottom of the lake. This is like some weird Zoni device. Oh, what the hell? Okay. Um, we can, uh, we can explode this. I didn't mean to do that. Sorry. Let me over here. Yeah. Yeah. And that'll raise up the water. Oh, look at us go. Solved that already. Easy. Okay. Um, and then what's down here? What is this? This is like a secret area underneath the... Oh, my God. Ancient Zora Waterworks. What the hell? Okay. Um, well, uh, good news and bad news. Good news. Um, I think we know how to, like, climb up there. Bad news. Uh, we have to do some plumbing. There we go. Yeah, it's like raising and... Oh my god, wait. If, if it's... I swear to god. If it's like raising and lowering places... Like like some sort of ocarina of time... Uh, what's the word? Water temple? I'm going to lose my mind. Please. Please let me rest from that temple. I still have PTSD from it. While a um, well-written dungeon, actually debatable, um, uh, was not as intuitive as you would think. 
Oh, a Zora shield. Actually, I will take that for sure. Oh. Yeah. Oh, do I? Yeah. I think we say bye to the sand seal statue. Okay, so what is this? In here? What the hell? Hey, we still have the plushie, all right? Okay, so we just need to get inside here. Okay, but I can't. Okay, or hear me out. What if I just like became like a god? Yeah, I did that and then up and then did that and then into the side and then, okay, nice. Cool. All right, so I do this. Okay, and that releases some more water. Okay, so this is all about uh, releasing water into this, uh, I wouldn't say sanctum, uh, into this area here so we can reach the top. It's all about uh, it's waterworks, the Zora waterworks. Okay. Uh, I could have made a bridge, but I didn't make a bridge. Um, I just want to put it out there. I think I'm growing as a person. Okay, I think we're seeing some real character development here. You know, not everything's about bridges. Okay. Not everything's about bridges. Uh, let's see. And I want to get into here. Okay. Oh, shoot. Okay. I can. I'm. I, I'm so glad I upgraded my stamina. I'll put it like that. I'm extremely glad that I did that. Okay. Uh, I just gotta go around too. Here we go. There it is. Okay. Link, what's going on? Did, did I just void out? What the hell? Oh, shoot. Hmm. Okay. Damn it. Happen again. All right. Oh, you know what? Oh my god, I'm so stupid. Oh my god, I can just solve this with a rocket. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Uh, an opal here. Okay, so how do I open that up? What? Um. What? I, mean, I could probably rocket jump to there. But yeah, let me get a rocket here. Um, just to open this a little bit farther. I want to do this like right though. Yeah, because it leads us up to here. We're, still f we're supposed to figure out like. How to unlock this next spot? Does that have something to do with this? Oh, it does! I'm supposed to be able to get in there. Oh, okay. Okay, so there's there's a like a drainage pipe right here that I can like get into. Yeah. There we go. Gotta, gotta refill my rockets. It is the best, is the best thing I've ever done. Okay. Uh, let's not do electricity here. I don't think. Maybe not the best idea. Okay. 
Oh, oh, uh, and then, you know what I probably do here? Um, oh, we can probably just climb up. I was going to use, um... Oh, no, no, we do, that's what we do. We ascend. Okay. Okay. Nice. Korok, maybe? No, okay. Good shot, though. Uh, let's see. This will work. Nice! And that should raise the level all the way up, right? Yep, there it is. That's really cool. All right. I could have just rocketed it up, which is probably cheese, but I chose to do it the correct way um, because I felt like it. I wanted to see what the actual puzzle was. <laughs> see if I, like, part of the enjoyment uh, of cheesing is, like, I know what the solution is, and then, like, I want to keep doing it. Actually, I think every time I've cheesed so far, I haven't known what the solution is. Never mind. Um, part of the fun with cheesing is, like, I can't figure out the solution, so therefore, um, I cheese it. Uh, in a way that makes sense for my brain. Uh, but in this case, um, it's like I kind of could figure... I, I felt I could figure out the solution myself. So. Okay, here we go. We made it to the center. Let's examine. Whoa. <laughs> Scotty, beat me up. Damn. Like one giant ascend that I can make here? Oh, what the hell is this? Yeah, the sludge. Oh, a giant waterfall. It's sludgy again, but still. Oh, uh, and Sidon can bring us up there. Uh, that's what that's what he did in Breath of the Wild. Oh. A waterfall. A waterfall descended from the sky. Link, what happened? Is this your doing? Yeah, we did it. That was us. So you activated a mysterious device in the ruins. And then the waterfall appeared. Okay, I believe I understand. Great. To Azora, a waterfall is no different from a path. That must be the meaning behind watery bridge. Yes, it must. If we climb this waterfall, we shall ascend into the sky. Uh, Link, I knew you could do it. All right. Let's ascend into the sky for what I presume is the water temple. Oh. We hear the voice again. Tia. Come here. Come Interesting. Here. It's happening again. Someone calling to me? What was that sound I just heard? Okay. In any case, we now have a path forward. All that is left is to press ever onward. I just want to say uh, they had that line be here, not come. So they changed it up for the, si uh, for, for the Zora for some reason. Link, if you wear the Zora armor, you can climb the waterfall as well. Uh, you must acquire said armor from Yona and Mifa Court. Okay. Uh, okay, let's go get the armor really fast. I've been saying to talk to Yona the whole time. Okay. Well, I'm also not reading chat too well because I don't want you to spoil the game for me. There you go. Um, no, seriously though. Um, don't uh tell me what to do. Uh, I wanna I'm gonna figure it out myself, you know. Um, because uh, otherwise you won't get some wacky gameplay, and also I won't enjoy it as much. Uh, so if you feel the need to uh, tell me something in the game. Just put a smile in chat. Just put a smile. All right. What's up, Yona? You're going to give me the 
Uh, Zora Tunic. It's about an item of yours that was entrusted to the domain. Uh, it's your Zora armor. The repair is mostly complete, but it does require one more thing. It's I need a fish called an ancient arowana. Oh, I have those. Uh, we're not seeing ancient arowanas around lately. I have no idea where they can be found. Uh, in the sky, they can actually. Um, if you look at one, please bring it to me. Okay. Uh, and it allows Hylians to climb waterfalls. Okay. I found one. Uh, we've not seen them here recently. Okay. So they're used for making. Um, okay. Yes. Uh, Zora armor allows. Yep. Yeah, cool. I have one though. Do I not have one? Oh my god, I totally probably I think I ate them all. <laughs> I think I genuinely ate them all. That's actually that's kind of funny. <laughs> Oopsies. Oh my god. Alright, let me go get some more real quick. I think I know where I can find some. Ba -da -ba 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 -da -na -na. Uh, I also got the news today, um, or I read in the news today, that Breath of the uh, Tears of the Kingdom has sold um, 10 million copies um, in three days. Which, if I recall, is more copies than Twilight Princess HD has made in its lifetime. And also more copies than the Wii U has ever sold. Um, so, yeah, crazy, right? Uh, let's see. I want to go over this way to get some ancient marijuana. Isn't that crazy? It's nuts. Absolutely nuts. And I'm just saying, you know, I, I'll put it out there. Um, creating content for this game. Doing some challenges. Oh, dude, you guys are, uh, you, you guys are not prepared for the things that we got prepped. It's going to be so cool. Dude, it's going to be so cool. You legitimately have no idea. Uh, it's over here. Uh, let me go back. Pretty sure there's ancient, ancient arowana in those uh, basins. So, uh, yeah, that would be... Okay, let's see. In uh, income... Um, 10 million times $70 is $700 million in income for, uh, the first three days. Kind of crazy. Also, uh, I want to put it out there for every, uh, game developer ever. Um, it's really crazy how well a game performs when it's finished at launch. Isn't that crazy, guys? Isn't that just nuts? Um, actually, wait. Is it? It's not in there, right? I want yeah, I mean, just look at Elden Ring. Like, fantastic game. Finish that launch. Look at Breath of the Wild. Fantastic game. Finish that launch. Look at pretty much every game that's done well in the past decade. Finish that launch. Mine is like FIFA, but that's like gambling. So, you know, they got that audience. Okay, Ancient Arowana should be right here. I got one. All right, nice. That's all we needed. That's literally all we needed. Okay, let's go. Let's go back. Okay, we have so much of the map complete now. Elden Ring had some issues at launch, though, but they were pretty mighty minor. Um, no, I mean, having issues at launch is a separate problem altogether. Um, launching with a finished game is what I'm talking about. Like, the bar is, like, the bar is here, okay? Like, really down there. Okay. Uh, I got an ancient arrow wanted for you. Yes. Uh, here you go. Here's your ancient arowana. Whoa. Uh, an ancient arowana. With this, I can finally finish repairing your treasure Jora armor. Please wait a short moment. Mm. 
Uh, I am so honored to reunite you with this item, dear Link. Yes, Your yes. armor is good as new. Ah, oh, there it is. And we get swim speed. Awesome. Uh, please take this along with our well wishes. I'm so happy that I was able to return to its pristine state. I, it is a precious, precious piece of armor after all. As you well know, the Zora armor allows even a Hylian like you to climb waterfalls with ease. Of course, it will not help you with climbing waters that have been tainted with sludge. <laughs> oh. Oh, so that's... Okay, so that's the little hint of like, hey, that's the Skyfish Island. Oh, okay, so we totally missed this. What? Oh, you know what? In that case, I'm so much more proud that I figured it out without literally any help from the game. Besides, here's what a Skyfish Island is. Uh, good luck. That was awesome. Okay, now let's head to the water temple. Uh, also, we haven't been to the top here. Whoa. Oh my god. You know how there was the statue in Zora's Domain of Sidon? They put the Mipha one up here. They put the Mipha one here. Also, there's... Uh, is this an arowana? Are you serious? Oh my god, it totally is. Oh, we don't know where the ancient arowanas are. They're literally in the Mifa fountain. I that's I'm so mad about that. I'm that's so Okay, anyways. Wow. Yeah. That's that's really neat. I really like that a lot. Alright, here we go. Godspeed! Let's go to the giant waterfall in the sky. Uh, and also put on our um, Zora armor. Okay. And let's swim up to the... the let's swim up to the islands in the sky. Wow. Whoa. Wellspring Island. The Lanaru Great Spring Sky. Huh? Huh? What? We're in low gravity? What the hell is this? Dude, we're on the moon! That's so cool! Okay. All right. Uh, let's keep going. There's a lot of sludge here, but let's figure out what the hell's going on. This is so weird. Um, okay. Wait, so what is this? I'm drowning. Oh, that's kind of cool, actually. We can use this to float. Okay. Uh, chat, I'm going to save really quick. And then uh, I'm going to go to the bathroom really fast. Okay, guys? Um, so I'll, I'll be right back, and then we'll go talk to Sidon. Does that sound good? Um, in the meantime, I will uh, leave you with this bouncing DVD logo screen. Actually, and Nintendo Dogs. Okay. Uh, if if it hits, let me know. Okay.
boys. The plan is simple. All right. Hi, I'm back. Uh, did it hit? I don't... Okay, from, from all of the no's and no, it didn't. And ah, oh, God. Um, uh, I, it, I, it seems like everyone who is saying yes currently is uh, is lying. Uh, so, uh, moderators, if you want to uh, just uh, ban all of them really quick, uh, I don't want to... Uh... Yeah, of course it didn't, dude. What do you think? The, the video is 10 hours. You think it's going to hit the corner in the first four or five minutes? Come on. All right? Calm down. You got to wait a little bit. Patience is key here. Okay. Let's continue. All right. New bull. One small step for man. One giant leap for mankind. <laughs> okay. All right. Let's not decide. How incredible. What is this place? My body, it feels as light as a feather. This is a strange place indeed, but right now we must focus on locating the source of the sludge. Like it's time to divide and conquer. Let's split up for the time being. Okay. Uh, Sume Shiro, thanks so much for the uh, twenty dollars. The quality content I subbed for a bouncing DVD logo is the best game ever made. I know, right? Okay. So what? Okay. So what is this thing? Oh! Oh! Whoa! Oh! Oh, we're good. All right, I thought Link was drowning for a second there. So we can also go down over here. That's kind of cool. All right. All right. Let's. So we have to progress our way through these. Uh. Uh. <laughs> we have to progress our way through these uh, sky islands. Um. Okay. Yeah, progress our way through these sky islands. Uh, with the low grav involved. That looks so cool. This, it looks really cool. Wow, look at all this. All right, so we have to make our way to what I think is up there. All right, we'll have to figure that out. Okay. The next right in here. Yeah. Oh, look. There, there's Terrytown down there. And there's, and there's, and there's the Skull Island. And the tech labs. All right, we gotta check that out later. Or right now. No, okay. <laughs> Give it a sec. I kind of messed up. Oopsies. All right, let's go back. <laughs> My bad. All right, we're all fine. We're all fine. Okay. All right. And then the next one should be right over here. Okay, when's it start? Okay. Nice. I wonder if Link can drown. I mean, yeah, obviously, but you know, still. Hello. What are you? Huh? What is this guy? Are you, okay, we're just going to spin away. Okay. Oh, uh, you're not dead yet. Okay. What the hell? What kind of construct are you? A soldier construct four horn. Oh, 24 fuse attack power. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. So we've gotten to stage four now of enemy scaling. A soldier construct three horn or four horn. Or was that a captain? It was a soldier construct four. Okay, so we haven't seen a captain four yet. Whoa. Okay. You can kind of like go around here. Like go up. Okay. Interesting. Very interesting. All right. We might have to use some uh, fire hydrants ourselves later. Looks like. Okay. I would like to get out of the sludge, please. Thank you. I can see why the Zora hate it. It's very annoying. All right. Um, I guess we can just like walk up this way. Yeah, all of the Sky Islands are just like inundated with sludge. It's kind of gross. 
Kind of grody. I wonder what caused this. Oh, there's a chest here. Um, and you know what? I shall get it. Splash fruit. I'm glad they made like water like somewhat of an element. It's kind of cool. Oh, a hydrant. Okay. We already have uh, hydrants. Um, but uh, we will get more for sure. Okay. So I can just jump across. That's pretty sick. Oh, and our jumps too. Like our climb jumps are great. Wow. So I wonder if it's like, you can go over here. This is going to be a really fun, uh, a fun dungeon, I think. Like casket of some sort. It looks like a casket. Oh, a hover. Oh, we got hover stones. I don't think we've ever gotten those. Okay. If we want to make hover stones, we can. However, I don't think we need to. I think we can actually just go across here. I mean, like, look at that. Yeah. Goodbye forever. All right. I, I misjudged. I, miss my, I misjudged my own abilities. I misjudged my own abilities. Okay. Oh, uh, they're right here. Okay. All right. We are going to face them. Then. Dude, that's so weird. I wonder what a soldier three construct looks like. Okay. Oh, that's so much damage. 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 Nice. <laughs> Did I mention that was a lot of damage right there? Crazy. Uh, okay, got another soldier contract four. I would like a um, a Zonai weapon though for it. Like that would be nice. A Captain Three Spear. Um, wow, with attack of plus four, that's actually a really good pickup. Um, yeah, yeah, that's a really good pickup. Uh, I'm gonna keep the Smasher for now, but uh, wow, glad we went uh, went out of our way to to do this. Can I pick up this bow? Okay. Nice. Okay. All right. Yeah. All right. I'm glad we made it like all the way over here. All right. Still haven't seen like. Yeah. Yeah. I, I guess we have to look forward to like a, a soldier four uh, construct. Or sorry, a, a captain four construct. Okay, thank you for that. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, the low grab is so funny. <laughs> it's so funny, like, battling with it. <laughs> I got it, dude. Uh, it's hilarious. I love it. Oh, whoa. Dude, I mean, like, look at look at this area. Wait, wait how did that just... Why did this just appear? That was weird. Oh! Oh, we got a flex construct here. Oh, I didn't even see that. Okay. Hello. Don't do that. Oh, and we're in low grav, too. Dealing with it. Jeez. That's so... I, I, you know some developer out here was just like, what if we, like... What if we just, like, turn down the gravity? And just, like, everyone was like, Yeah! Okay, almost dead. All right, do your, do your second phase here. Oh, but it's not as fast because we're in low grab, too. That's amazing. I missed. Okay. <laughs> some, some developer was just like, yo, what if we did this? Hear me out, dude. And then everyone heard them out. It was amazing. Yeah, love that. Love that. Okay, there's a uh, flux core two here. 
Um, I would love to add it to a weapon, but particularly of Zonai variety. Oh, a Sage's Will. Okay, great. Um, we don't really need that right now. Sage's Wills um, aren't entirely useful for us. A Soldier Force Spear. Yep, that's, that's pretty good. They're giving us some good weapons here. Uh, I have no qualms about it at all whatsoever. Uh, okay, let me uh, fuse this then. Because uh, it's it's too good to, uh, you know, to wait. Yeah. Yeah, I do love spears. I think they're my favorite weapon in, in Tears of the Kingdom, Breath of the Wild. Um, I think they're just, like, done so well. Also, what is... What is down... I, you know what? I'm going to check it. There, there has to be something down here. There has to be. You know? Yeah. What? Yeah, no, this is the start. Oh, there's a chest here. Look at us go. Look at us go. Okay, we're, we're making our way up. Slowly but surely. I'll take this large zone I charge. Nice. Dude, the fact that we're in the sky here, too, is amazing. Speaking of amazing, uh, two things for uh, you guys in the live stream. First off, subscribe. That would be amazing. Um, stream for almost four hours. Uh, so subscribe. Uh, if you like the content and you want to see more in the future, um, it's a really easy way to let me know that, hey, I like Tears of the Kingdom and I want you to play more. Uh, also, um, it gets you notified of when uh, the edited videos of this playthrough come out which uh one just came out um this morning uh, right before stream actually uh, so if you want to check that out go watch it um it's um i got my edited playthrough we're, we're going with it live we're currently as it stands this stream is probably either video three probably video three um so uh yeah let me save here first before we continue so uh yeah my editors are kind of insane um, we're editing the playthrough literally live. Like, as I'm streaming this right now, they're, like, editing it. So. Uh, we'll have another, uh, edited part of the playthrough out in a couple days. Oh, okay. We got a shrine here. Uh, in the middle of the Great Spring Sky. Yeah, literally best editing thing on YouTube. Not even joking, dude. Like, actually serious. It's crazy. Orbs of water. Yo, thanks for the subs. Uh, Andronomical. Uh, Brian, the whole mammal. Erased. Thank you, guys. Uh, there's a lot more, but I just want to say that. Okay. Orbs of water is what this one is called. Oh, I got to be all the way up. What is this? Okay, so for this one, um, oh, first off, I like do this real quick. <laughs> Sorry, um, I, I use recall on these two, um, but I wanted the chest, so, um, sorry, one sec. Yeah, all right, so we got to use recall on these. Nice. Boom. <laughs> this is so cool. This is so cool, dude. Okay. Uh, so then what we need to do for this is I think the same thing. Where you have to like make it like bump up. We go here. Then we take this. Then right here. You don't even have to attach it. I think we're good. And then uh, I think we... I think, I, I think we just take the, the water. Yep. And it bumps up. Boom. 
Whoa. And we can like target life off. Nice. Go team. Here we go, dude. We got it. Not too bad. Uh, this should be number one, right? We haven't gotten any others. Yeah, okay. Yeah, we have, uh, what, 13 hearts and um, a wheel and a quarter of stamina? Two wheels? Like, we have almost, like, uh, almost three wheels of stamina? Crazy. Two and a half wheels. No, sorry, two and a third, whatever. Okay. Uh, now we continue going up. Uh, Wellspring Island. We're kind of almost at the main area, too, here. All right, what is this? Oh, it'll shoot out. Okay. Okay. We just leave that here. We go on the glider. And then we shoot. All right, I'll take it. <laughs> That's pretty neat. Okay. Oh, is this a captain? No, this is a captain three, isn't it? Yeah, this is captain three. No, captain two. This is a captain two. Bloodstained moon shines upon the land. We now know that's on Zelda. Spirits of slain monsters return to flesh. The world is threatened once again. Those are almost the exact same words that Ganondorf used in the memory. Hello. Nice. <laughs> oh my God. That was such a hard fight. Whatever shall I do? Okay. Ooh, I do want a Zonite Spear though. Oh, hmm. Yeah, no, I still want the Zonite Spear. Okay. Uh, let's see. How do we get up farther now? is the next great question. I mean, we can climb, right? Now that we're here, what is the spot? Okay, right, so there's there's a sludge right here. We can't climb up the sludge. Oh, I'll take the strong zonite longsword though. For sure. We can't climb the sludge, right? Yeah, we definitely can't. Even if we try to like, oh, water it. Oh my God, water. Oh, I, wow, I threw it really far. Um, yeah, sorry. Crap. And how the hell am I supposed to get up? Uh, let's see. There is a, a solution. I think I know one of the solutions what it could be first off uh we can get up here with our zora armor yeah oh oh can i ascend from here actually uh i can't it's way too oh no but i don't need to ascend because I can just climb these waterfalls here. Yeah! Yeah, that's it. That's how we do it. We have to climb these waterfalls. That's how we do it. That's pretty cool. Yes. It's like stepping stones, though. Oh, and we got an old map. Okay, where does this lead? 
we're underground. Oh, okay. Uh, it's actually kind of close. We can get there. I wonder what that leads to. Okay, nice. Oh, we can go actually all the way over here now. There we go. Up to the Oh, that's a that's big boss, big boss arena. Um lot a lot of guys here. Uh just don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Um one second. Sorry, I just gotta do some murder real fast. Uh you know, just, just casual thing that you do when you uh murder things is doing murder. Um so it's really cool that I can murder you. You know, it's an honor, actually, to kill you. And I hope you recognize that. A uh, soldier's spear. Nice. That is valuable. Who me? Uh, I feel like I'm really get used to the... I, I'm afraid I'm really get used to the uh, jumping and everything, right? Um, like, I'm going to get used to the, <laughs> the low gravity. And that's going to change. Uh, I'm really used to the... I'm going to get used to the low gravity. And then it's going to literally, like... When I get back to regular gravity, I'm not going to know how to control the game anymore. Soldier four blade. Wow. Okay. I really like that. Uh, and I will take it over this. Yep. And it's durability up. That's pretty cool. All right. So how do we get up here? Oh, we, we can just jump. That's fine. This also works. Okay. So this got a recall, right? Yep. All right. Nice. All right. What is this area? What is this place? We're getting to the top. Actually, I, yeah, we're almost. Oh, my dear God. We're almost at the top of the uh, Sky Islands here. Uh, nearing it. Uh, we can do this. Um, and attach right, right here. That should that should work, right? Probably work. Okay. That's so cool. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so this should be able to hit that and bounce up. Yeah, there we go. Oh, you loved it. Dude, you love to see like solution like puzzles and like solutions that you come up with. You know what? I I see it and I, I hate that I want to do this, but I'm gonna look at the I'm gonna look at the chest. Oh my dear god. Dear Lord in heaven. Oh, of course they made it so you can't do that. Sorry, it's the low grav once again. It's quite literally the low gravity. There it is. Okay. I literally went too fast. I should have like pressed Y to like smack down there. You know, that would, that probably would have been the smart thing to do. Right? Like just or just like stop pressing forward. There we go. Oh, I'm such an idiot! Oh my dear. Okay. <sighs> okay, come on. Third time's the charm. Captain 3 Reaper. Wow, we're getting actually some really awesome weapons. I'm going to drop this. Yeah. These are actually really nice weapons. Seriously. Okay. Now we can continue. 
Well, they're also giving me us like they're giving us like a lot of weapons, which kind of unfortunately leads me to believe that like we got a hard fight coming up. Also, you can see all of this sludge. Yeah, you can see all of this sludge is, is from the top there. It's literally coming from whatever that is up there. Like that source. Oh, there's there's Sidon. Okay, it's right there. All right, I got it. Don't worry. <laughs> oh, we were supposed to probably like build something to get across, weren't we? Oh well, I just flew. That's fine. All right, what's going on, Sidon? This really is such a strange place. My body felt as light as air, allowing me to soar surprisingly high when I was climbing the waterfalls. As we are in an unfamiliar, uh, as we are in an unfamiliar place, let us proceed with caution. Link, please take care as long as you forge ahead. Okay. Hello. And goodbye. All right, this is the Captain Three. We haven't gotten to Captain Four statuses yet. Nice. Okay. Thanks, Sidon, for killing him. Oh. But. Okay. Uh, done and done. Uh, Link, let us keep pushing forward. Uh, okay. I don't know why that was a cutscene there, but sure. <laughs> Weird. Um, that's a beam emitter and a beam. Okay. Uh, strong zone knight sword. Mighty construct bow. I will take that over the regular construct or the strong construct. Whatever. All right. Here we go. Let's go to the source of whatever is causing all of the sludge in Zora's domain. Hmm. From what I can tell, all of the sludge waterfalls are flowing from the ruins up here. In other words, uh, if there's a source for the sludge somewhere, it must be... Link, uh, once you're amply prepared, uh, let us dive right in. Okay, cool. All right. The time has finally arrived. Off we go. Okay, here we go. Let's do it. Let's go to the source of the sludge. Oh, we are so high up. Wow. What the hell is that? The water temple. Yep, we got a water temple. It, it's coming back. Oh, dear God. This is the water temple. Whoa. Whoa, dude. Okay. Stop siding. How magnificent. To think that such a structure was floating in the sky above our own Zora's domain. Link, look. There's the source of the sludge. That is surely the source of the sludge. I am certain of it. We must do something about it. Huh? Interesting. There's a water spout there. That's it. Yeah, the water spout. Uh, you see it, do you not? If we can only make use of that water, then we can turn off that sludge. Okay. Um, for the editors here, I'm going to splice real fast. Um, it's, a, it's an early splice, but we're going to split it so one does the uh, dungeon and stuff. Um, so I'm going to splice this real quick. Here we go. All right. Alrighty. Here we go. Uh, so I can't... Can I activate this? I mean, I'll try. I'll, I'll still try. We probably can't, though. Okay. Oh, no. Okay, we can. Uh, but we can't actually activate all of the water spouts, though. Yeah, because there's only one. And so that's not going to do anything to the sludge. It helps a little bit, but not, not much. That's a cool mechanic, though. Yeah, seems it did not work. Saw two, though. Using that mechanism did have an effect. 
Okay, that sound again. Cherished kin. This is the source of the pure waters of Zora's domain. Oh. Use your power to turn on the four faucets and you can collect water here. Okay. So that's where the four faucets are. Okay. So we have to turn on the four faucets in order to defeat the sludge. Uh, the four faucets, I see. If we turn those on, uh, then we can do it. Okay. So, uh, chat, how, um, do you think I can solve this in about 30 minutes? Or do you think I can solve this in... Yeah, I, I can do this in about 30 minutes, chat. I'm not going to speed run it by any means, but do you think I can? Right, there's B1, which we're on, and then first floor. No, wait, we're on first floor, actually. Okay. So the first, wait. Oh, um, so down over here below, if we go here, down below is like sludge. Okay. Okay, interesting. All right, let's go over it this way. Uh, I'm not going to speed run it, chat, but I'm just going to go with speed. Hopefully that kind of like makes some sense. Okay. Water temple first floor. Uh, there is a chest down there. That's what hooked me. <laughs> I was like, what if, can I get this chest? Oh, come on. There it is. Uh, a sapphire. Okay, cool. That's monies for us. All right. So, B1 is right here. Huh. Um, I think we go back up. I think it is not a big ask to go back up. Yeah. Okay. So, let's go and explore around here. It seems like that's a good place to start. Uh, we want to do the four faucets, so if I can find out where one of them is, the threads will start, you know, being, putting themselves together, and then I'll have, like, a better time overall. That is a big boy construct. Okay. Nice. Oh, we can, like, get instant flurry rushes now. I don't want to use all my arrows, though. I mean, we might have to use an arrow during the uh, boss fight. That's why. Or some arrows during the boss fights. Ooh. I will pick up your weapons. Um, and a soldier spear. Um, is that like a mighty soldier spear, though? I feel like that might be. Ah, uh, we have like enough, like... Actually. I can't drop this. Um, yeah, soldier spear... Is a mighty Zonite spear. Okay, so that's actually kind of huge. Okay. Sorry, I'll use this in a sec. Uh, I'm, I'm like literally min maxing it as we speak. <laughs> All right. Okay. And a mighty construct bow. Okay. Upgrading all of my items with this new stuff. So let's go. All right. So then I want to actually make a new. Getting distracted a little bit here. I'm, I'm going to use a Captain Construct. Sorry. The Captain Construct three horn is still better than the... Tony. Okay, we'll we'll wait then. We'll wait on, on fusing that. I think we might come across a Captain four construct. Okay, so... um, The faucet is up here. Uh, I see that right over here is a ball? Which is interesting. We're going to have to figure out some sort of way to get the ball somewhere unsure as to where it looks like it is not used to this um oh there's this here okay there's okay something up there mm, actually you know what this seems like a chest spot but it might also be a good place for something else All right nice oh you know what you're supposed to do there Oh, you're supposed to definitely put like a choo-choo jelly uh, with an arrow. 
Okay, uh, chat, I'm going to really fast uh, restart my uh, capture card uh, because we're getting some crackles. Uh, Florian Teal, thanks so much for the uh, channel membership. Thank you. Uh, durability up, uh, Zora Shield. Let me drop this. Okay, so uh, this is the faucet stuff. I just like get up here. I think we can just do that. Interesting. Okay. So then what is... This is the faucet? Why is this... Oh, okay. So we do need to bring up... Okay, I see what we need to do here. So we need to bring up the big orb um, by using probably some of these. Um, that makes a lot more sense. Like the, the, the floating platforms. That's definitely it. I understand. What a cool dungeon. I I was like, when I when I like first saw that there were dungeons in this game um, with the wind temple, I was like, oh, there's a water temple, isn't there? And I was just like hoping. I was hoping like for the, the love of anything that ever existed. I was like, dude, I swear to God, if this is like anything like the Ocarina of Time water temple, I'm going to lose my goddamn mind. Let me turn this off. Uh, there also seems to be this, which I'm assuming opens. Yeah, it uh, opens this waterway as a uh, potential and probable. Uh, what, what I can only assume, it opens this waterway as a uh, um, shortcut back up or down. Uh, so, you know, uh, pretty cool. All right, so let's put this down here. Uh, oh, I didn't. Oh, it's going all the way down. Oh, oh God. Okay. Whoops. Um, you know, we didn't need that one anyways. You know, uh, I didn't really, I didn't really want that. That's fine. Uh, let's just take another hoverstone out really quick and activate it before we do that the better idea you want to activate these things oh no actually no you don't uh that's not the solution to this you want to splash fruit this right here and then this uh will clear it and then i can take the big ball right here with ultra hand uh and put it um on one of these that now that's the actual solution uh i was going to do a little bit of something else yep there it is. Okay, cool. Right, I'll probably just end up running out of battery soon. Um, these are used for something else, which we'll do in a second. So it's fine that that kind of like disappeared. Okay, so the big ball's right there. Uh, and it should fall anytime soon. Oh, what's up, Sidon? Nice. It should go right here. Ah, uh, but it can't for some reason. Uh, that being, it's not heavy enough. There's a lot of water being pushed down. So if we want to make sure that the water level is lower so the ball can get in, then uh, we take this. Doesn't matter how we orient it. Oh, uh, we take one of these. Doesn't really matter actually at all. I'll, let me take, just take one. Okay. Um, let float. We leave it like right here. And then we take this gate, put it up, attach. So it sticks. And then the water is going to lower. And thus, the orb will go into the well. Awesome. Really, really cool. Uh, yeah. Okay, I thought you were going to throw that. All right, we got a new capture card, uh, Jet. I'll probably test it out tomorrow. Uh, so I don't get the crackles every, like, couple hours. Okay. So I now take you, and then I'm assuming I... Okay. I, I splash this, right? This is the water wheel for the faucet. All right, it's the first one. Yeah. All right, can you... 
you interrupted me. <laughs> I, I was going to do that, and then and then you're like, tutorial explain. There it is. There it is. All right. First faucet down. Awesome. You got one. This is great. Just three to go. Three more. All right. Um, so we got one here. Now the second one is like down a little bit, looks like. Like over here on the um first floor. Okay, and there's a bunch of fire. Okay, well, I wonder if the solution could literally just be this. Oh, I need to activate it. Looks nice. Okay, nice. Oh, it is supposed to be that. Oh, look at us go. Oh, but am I not heavy enough for... Well, I guess I'm not heavy enough for the... Uh, um, uh, for the button. So can I put this down here and like force it? Yeah, okay, I can. Awesome. Uh, however... It looks as if that I have to get a ball into here somehow. Okay. How do we do that? Okay. So the ball's over here and we got a bunch of hovering stones. I mean, we just do one too, you know, like leapfrog it. That works. Uh, like leapfrog is a viable uh opportunity for this okay yep i mean i don't even have to i can just go across it uh, but i was prepping for the uh ball here okay okay let's go right here oh shoot um wait uh, let me go across here okay uh, I'm gonna take this. Then let me go up. Yeah, that works. So I, I, if as long as I can like take one of, oh shoot, oh, I'm gonna get hurt. No, I'm not. I saved it. Let's go. Let's go, chat. Hell yeah. Okay. Oh, I didn't mean to tap. I wonder if I could. Wait, that's actually. Okay. Let me do here. Okay. This is like actually working and it's stupid, but it does work. So, you know, if it's stupid and it works, is it, is it stupid? That's, that's the, that's the actual question, you know? Okay. My battery is kind of running out here. I'm glad I had like four. Jeez. Imagine I didn't upgrade my battery before. Seriously, like, I was going to, like, just not upgrade my battery the whole, whole time. I was like, what's the use in upgrading a battery uh, for the game? Turns out, there's a lot of them. Uh, it's actually really useful to have more battery. All right, nice. Okay, so we got the ball. Okay. And let's put it here. Although it won't stay. So, I propose uh, a weird solution here. Uh, by putting the ball to here, taking this, and just pressing it up against the thing here. No? Oh, is this not activated? Oh, okay. It wasn't activated. So I just, like, keep it activated here. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Uh, and that is the second faucet. Cool solution to a fun problem. There we go. Well done, Link. Now you just need to open the remaining two. All right, two more. Okay. Um. So far, this is actually the easiest temple we've uncovered 
The hardest one I would say is for like as for puzzles, I would say is the fire temple. My favorite temple so far was the wind temple. Like for sure, I think. Hello. <laughs> charge all right so the next two are actually over here all right nope other way uh yeah this is definitely i think so far the easiest uh temple okay. i think so far all right now okay so now i guess the question is how the hell do we get up here um oh i found it um there's a bubble device right here uh that we need to recall Um right, he's on it. Very cool. Okay, so the bubble's not going anywhere. Which is a little curious. I um Oh, okay. You know what we do? We splash fruit up here. This thing. Um, and then we can just get up here, I think. Yeah. All right, that works. Okay, nice. Uh, there's also a light like here. Oh, you're fire? Uh, wait. I just pick up... Oh, I, that doesn't have anything... Uh, any damage to it. Uh, let's see... I will do this. Captain 3 here. Yeah, that actually feels like faster. Nice. All right, cool. Okay. Oh, a mighty construct bow with quick charge. I like that a lot. Oh, right. We got the Demon King's bow. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, I forgot, I forgot about that. Okay. All right, up here. Uh, is this... No, this is just a soldier four. Bro! Dude, I just got one shot! Oh my god, I just got one shot! Damn! Holy shit, dude. Oh my god, okay. Um, Soldier four constructs are actually like no joke well okay what is that up there all right let me kill this construct here real quick okay all right he died nice i will take that that's a lot of that's a really a lot of good stuff okay okay let's see how do I do that? What is inside there? It's so odd. Okay. Oh, is that the... Okay. That is the... Thing. Okay, okay. Let me figure this out. Oh. Yo. Look at that dragon, dude. Holy... Okay, that's neither of the three. Yo, hey, sighted. 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 Damn, dude. That's kind of badass. Um, That's so pretty. Dude, I'm just like, I'm just in awe of the, the sight here. Wow. All right, I mean, we're almost done with the, the temple, but damn, dude. Okay. Hello. Goodbye to John Cena. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, 
So what's what's the goal? So the goal is to get this to stop, maybe? So recall? I can't recall on it, but I can like Oh, you know what? I can't recall on it, but I can like maybe try to snipe it. That may be kind of badass. Oh, or I put something in it. I just threw my weapon. Did I just throw my weapon? Oh, I just literally threw my weapon. Uh, but, but, uh, 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 like maybe putting one of these platforms on it. I could I could maybe do it, you know. Okay. Bum, bum, um. Okay. Here. I'm focusing. I'm focusing. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Oh my god. I'm so dumb. How did I can't believe this. I can't believe it. Okay. do this there's also those bubbles which i'm not confident in doing yet maybe maybe i have to get um do this oh my Do I think this is the actual solution? Um, I don't know if I do. Yeah, there's no way. That's insane. You're supposed to slow it down, probably. I don't even know what the solution is. I'll take it. Dude, I sniped it through. Oh my god, that was sick. I sniped the water throw and I sniped the actual uh, arrow. I dude, That's crazy. That was crazy. Okay, uh, that's the third one. So we have uh, one left. Just one more, Link. All right, one left, uh, which is on the other thing. Oh, let's go over here. That was crazy. Dude, that, I think that was my favorite cheese solution. Here. Because that was kind of great. I'm not going to lie. Okay. So the other one's right here. So this has to do with uh, power. It has to do with power. Okay. 
Okay. We need to connect this somehow. Okay. So there's here. Oh, 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 I see what to do. Okay. So I need to, I need to make paddles for this. Uh, let me make it vertically so it's easier on me. Okay. Uh, all right. So this. Um, I mean, <laughs> that, that works, right? As like a paddle. It doesn't have to be even, right? Um, uh, all right. So this, this will start, if I move it here, this will start the, uh, motion, right? Okay. Uh, which makes this power go. And then how do I connect these two pieces of power? Um, it seems as if I need a, um, metal object of some sort. Um, a metal object. Uh, I wonder what that could be. Let's see. I don't anything nearby that I can like nab for this. I wonder why this like Um actually you know what? <laughs> I don't think I need a metal object. I mean, this will be crazy if it's actually the solution, but yeah. Okay. That's what I thought. Oh, oh my God. Yes. It's like water also conducts electricity. Yo. That was amazing, dude. Oh, I figured that out so fast, too. Okay, wait, I got it. I got it. One second. <laughs> it's, sorry, it's temporary. All right, there we go. All right, and that is the last faucet. Here it is. You did it, Link. Okay, they're all filled up. Now we just need to use the central device. Okay. Now to complete. I don't know. Was that like that was like that was like a uh, we'll say like 30 minutes or something? Not too bad. That was uh probably the easiest dungeon I've done today. Actually, at all. That was probably the easiest dungeon. That was pretty simple, actually. Um, not too bad. Uh, David, thanks for the channel membership. Dude, I should play the witness. <laughs> I feel like I'd be pretty, pretty good at it. All right, let me save here uh, and uh, heal up food. Uh, yeah, that works. Okay, here we go. Let's do the boss. <laughs> what is okay? So, what is the sludge? Um, Look, okay. the sludge dissolved. The domain is surely safe now. I, I don't know about that sign. Something just came. Oh, he, huh? he's right behind me, isn't he? <laughs> Not good. Is the sludge in the same room as us? What the? Muck rock? What are you? You're so small. Creature must be responsible. Oh, oh, what? But there's two of them, and he, and he possessed the shark. Huh? Let's go. 
Oh, that's so cool. Okay, okay. Uh, so I probably have to use side in here. Um, to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. To, 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 to do that. Okay. Oh, and then, and then get the guy. Get back here. Get back here. <laughs> He's so funny. He's so funny. Okay. Nice. So you have to... Okay. So you do have to use Sidon uh, to get the mud stuff. Um, and then uh, Sidon uh, puts it away. And then you can hit him. Okay. Like that. Okay. Perfect. Actually, pretty easy. Not too bad. Okay. Woo! So much damage. My God. Second phase. Wow. Oh, my God. That was amazing. Wait, so, okay, so what? So you added sludge all over the arena now. Oh, I did the shark. Okay. Um, or, conversely, we don't have to clear any of it away. Okay, we do. Okay, we actually need to do that. Okay. Um, there's the muck rock. Come back. Okay, side and I need you. Side and I need you. Oh, you're using a beam! What the hell? Okay, that's fine. Side in. Where's your, where's your stuffs? There it is. I missed, I missed, I missed. Okay, it's fine. Okay. Oh my god, you've added so much sludge. Oh, the sludge makes it so Sidon can't actually go either. Oh! Okay. Dangerous. Take care of yourself. Okay. Okay, no, I want side. Okay, Tulin, I actually don't want you right now. You're actually annoying. <laughs> uh, Tulin, okay. There it is. Okay, thanks for that. Okay, side, you can charge faster, though. Um, You know what? What if I did this? This is going to sound so stupid. What if I took this spear? I'm going to do this mid boss fight. I'm, I, I'm not even kidding. I took the spear, pulled the choo choo jelly out right here, and then fused the choo choo jelly to the spear. Will that work? Okay. Wait, but maybe that works with the Mukdorong, actually. Maybe I don't even need Sidon. Oh my god, I don't even need Sidon. Oh, I definitely... Wait. Okay, wait. Wait, but I totally did damage to him. Okay. Here we go. Nice! I still got him. Still got him. Perfect. I had to shoot him through it. Oh, come on. Okay, nice. Oh, I don't do too much damage right now. Why? Oh my god, I didn't do any damage to him. Probably because he's in the sludge, actually. That probably makes more sense. Okay. Okay, nice. Got him. All right, let's go. Why is he not taking any damage? What the hell is going on? Okay. All right, there we go. Okay. Side and I need you again. Nice! Got him! Okay. Okay, here we go. Need you again. Oh, where are you going, my guy? Snipe! Got him. Okay. Oh, please. Faster. Oh my god, it broke! Please! Oh, I can do this. The Captain 3 Reaper works. He's almost dead. He's almost dead! One more hit! Really? Wait, can I snipe him from here? I can't. Oh, that was... Dude, really? Alright, side in. Nice. Alright, one more hit. One more hit. That's it. So we need... Nice! And we got him! Woo! First try, too. He looks so weird.
What an odd boss. Ugh. Oh, it's so, it just looks so sad. Oh. It's like a squid. And there we go. All the sludge is going away. Actually, really fast dungeon. Uh, I like that dungeon. Uh, I like it. Uh, it was, I think, the easiest dungeon um, of the four. My favorite probably has to be the Wind Temple. Uh, my least favorite... Oh, I don't know. It's a tie between uh, Fire Temple and, and uh, Lightning Temple. But, however, um, I think... Um, I think both of them were still really fun. So, all right, here we go. Another heart container. That makes 14, 14 hearts. God, that's so many. Uh, I also want to say thank you so much to Roy Corvette for the 20 gifted memberships. Thank you. Can we get a W in chat for that? Thank you so much for the 20 gifted memberships. Uh, if you have a membership in the channel, um, uh, why don't you put a, a Picro gift, uh, in chat? A little, a little Picro gift, uh, emote. Um, uh, uh, that you get when you get a membership. Okay, here we go. Sidon, you get the sacred... Sorry, you... Sidon, you get the secret stone now. And this is the, uh, last of the four dungeons. Uh, from what I know, at least. <laughs> There's four regional phenomena. There, I don't know. I guess the, the last dungeon would be, like, the castle. Sidon, my cherished kin. That voice again. You're the one we've been hearing this whole time. Indeed. Whoa. I am your ancestor from a time long past. Whoa, dude. I served the first king of Hyrule as a Zora warrior and a sage who, like you, could direct the flow of water. You are the pride of the Zora. Your fluid, graceful movements as you fight. I would expect nothing less from my descendant. I love seeing Link next to Sidon here. You invested the monster that sullied our domain, but it was a servant of a greater evil, the Demon King. His true purpose was to prevent you from obtaining the stone that you just found. My secret stone. Which amplifies your the water stone powers. That you are wearing. Yes, and it is important you know more about the stone and the demon king. So listen. Oh, you, look, you can see the stone in the background. I, I, I didn't notice that. That's it crazy. It concerns the imprisoning war and the destiny of our people. I love the Ra the Valruta mask as well. Uh, just all of the uh, Zonai masks. Live long lives. This all the, happened in a time ancient the uh, the Shika modeled their uh, divine beast off of the Zonai masks. A great evil, the demon king appeared. He invaded High Rule and sought to cut the new kingdom's time short. But Rahu, the first king of High Rule brought me and five other warriors together to oppose him. To fight the Demon King, Rauru entrusted us with secret stones. And we saw this in the memory. Treasured artifacts that amplify the power of those who carry them. As the Sage of Water, I bore a secret stone and fought alongside my fellow sages in battle. However, the Demon King's power was overwhelming. Even my strongest defenses could not stop his ferocious attacks. I, I do wish they <laughs> didn't the repeat end, the cutscene. Our leader realized it would not be possible to defeat the Demon King outright. He chose to end the battle by sealing the Demon King away, sacrificing himself in the process. So that was the imprisoning war. Some time later, another of the six sages, the Sage of Time, 
came to visit me. Yep, that's Zora. The of the Zora and that is clear. Zelda. Sorry, that is the Zora and that is Zelda. The magic restraining the Demon King will eventually be undone. When that happens, a noble swordsman named Link will oppose him. That's us. We must help. Lend him your power. He will need the Zora's control over water. The course of the Zora's future was clear. Eventually in the future. It would be our honor to aid in defeating the Demon King. I swear to you that when the great evil returns, the Zora's Sage of Water will awaken once more. And that Zora's Sage of Water is sighted. The Zora people and their sage will fight alongside your swordsman. Hell yeah! That is everything there is to share of the imprisoning war and of the destiny of the Zora. Zora's domain is once again safe thanks to you. However, the Demon King continues to threaten all of Hyrule. Dude, I love how you can see the secret stone design Sidon, in the background. My cherished king. It's so cool. I don't, I don't, I didn't notice that. My secret stone and honor the vow I made to the Sage of Time. And Sidon. Fight alongside the sword. Yep, Sidon's going to become the Sage of Water. Woo! God damn, dude. It's my destiny to fight by your side. I came here so that I could save Sora's domain. But it looks like all of Hyrule will need my help. I'll do all I can, just as my ancestor Let's did. Let's go, Sidon! I will accept this secret stone. Let's go! There, secret stone of water. Ooh. Yeah, part of his uh, um, character arc is essentially... Um, some Im imposter syndrome, you know? It's like, how, c how could I lead the Zora people? I am the Sage of Water. Behold, this is my new power. Ah! <laughs> wow! <laughs> Damn! The soundtrack. God! That's so cool. Your hand. They're best friends. They're best friends. I, Sidon, the Sage of Water, swear that I will fight by your side. Oh, God, the music. Please accept this. It is proof of my vow. And here it is. Literally doing the wave this time. Quite literally, like that, it's thematic, it's on theme, it's exactly what they're doing, all right? That, you can't deny that. I, I just, whoa! <laughs> Come on! It's the water secret stone! Okay. And we got the next infinity rock. Uh, What's the middle one, though? Hi, Sidon. With that ring, you will always have my power with you. We're partnered up again. Yes. Yes. All right. <laughs> let's head back home. Best friend. Best friend, Sidon. That's so cool. He proposed. Okay, just get him getting down on one knee was because Link is short, not because he was proposing, guys. All right. Go touch grass or water. Actually, don't touch water. Touch grass. Just, just, never mind. You want to touch water. Touch grass outside. Ground, not water. God. Hmm? King Dorfan. Huh? He's going away. We saved him. Oh. Uh, oh. He is, he is a lot older, though. You can kind of tell. Oh. Mm. 
Wow. Ah, it's as pretty as it was was. This is crazy. Oh, and the theme's back. Whoa. Link, welcome back. Hi, Yana. Uh, Link, how have uh, you been? The sludge has vanished without a trace. Uh, Link, thanks to your courage, the inhabitants of Zora's domain are safe once again. No words could express the, from the depths. No words could express the depths of my gratitude. As for you, Sidon, though Link certainly played a key role, your own efforts to save the domain were nothing short of magnificent. I always believed in you, Sidon. Now you have unequivocally proven your worthiness to bear the crown. Oh. That's why I shall joyously take this opportunity to pass the throne to you. F Father, this is so sudden. No, it only seems that way. In truth, it has been heavy on my mind for some time. Sidon, my son, it is time to ascend the throne as the new king. Take Yona's hand and as one, lead Zora's domain to a brighter tomorrow. You can do it. It's his honor. I will not let you down. I swear it. That's the spirit, my boy. Now, accept your place upon the throne. The finest swordsman in all of Hyrule shall bear witness to this momentous occasion. That's that's my king. <laughs> yes. <gasps> yeah, it literally, like, King Dorvan was literally like, Sidon, my guy, you dropped this. You know? <laughs> <laughs> Silence, everyone. Whoa, he's dripped out. I hereby inherit this crown from my father, the exalted Dorofen. From this moment on, I shall be the king of Zora. <laughs> At the same precious moment, I ask that you also open your hearts to my new queen, Yona. <laughs> Why am I emotional? <laughs> Goddamn. The sludge threatens us no more. We are once again free to swim through crystal waters beneath azure skies without fear. We cannot have achieved this without our dear King Sidon, our heroic Sir Link, and all of us who can call the domain home. I'm so proud and so very grateful to count myself among the Zora of this domain. However, that does not mean that all matters have been resolved. Right you are, my love. As, as long as darkness lurks in the depths of Hyrule, this peace we have fought so hard for could vanish like a bubble on a needle. We shall not allow that. It is now time for the Zora to help Link prevail. Everyone, I ask that you lend him your strength. Doing so, doing just that shall be the first task that my... Ah, I can't read today. Doing, ju doing just that shall be the first task that I and my partner in life and in leadership shall undertake as your king and queen. First things first, my friend, uh, regarding the whereabouts of Princess Zelda, when I obtained the secret stone, we saw a vision of the Sage of Time. Certain it was far more than a passing resemblance. That was Princess Zelda. Uh, in stark contrast, the lookalike sighted in the present day is harming others and even attacked father. As such, I can only believe that our princess is somehow in the bygone era of my ancient ancestor. However, if my hunch is correct, was the true identity of Princess Zelda... Um, uh, what is the true identity of Princess Zelda who is running rampant in this area? So we do know that that's Ganondorf. Uh, whatever the answer, it is painfully clear that we have no choice but to find her and ask her directly. Link, as I have just ascended the throne, I must offer my sincerest apologies for being unable to accompany you. Still, I shall continue gathering information about our lost Princess Zelda. Please promise that you shall once again uh, grace our fair Zora's domain with her presence sooner rather than later. Whatever comes to pass, I know that you and I will always be connected by the power of a sage, uh, no less. All right. It was good hanging out with you, Sidon. And thank you for your vow sage of water that reminds me uh link as i understand it you have already visited rito village goron city and gerudo town i'm certain that our allies at lookout landing would benefit from the information you've gathered oh my god it's the end game now it may be worthwhile to return there and report your findings okay it is the end game now okay so we've completed all of the regional phenomena now, the only thing we have left to do uh, is go to Lookout Landing 
to discover what we need to do next. Next time. No, okay. All right. So that was for the that was for, that was for the video. Okay, we're still streaming. <laughs> All right. <That> was... <laughs> All right. All right. Let's go do a memory. Uh, let's go do a memory. Uh, there should be one over this way. All right. I spliced there for the editors. So it's an it's an hour. So. Um. Jesus Christ, man. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. I I, I probably got I got you guys. I got you guys. No, we're uh we're we're you know. Uh, we're, we're all good. Uh, all right. Let's do, uh, let's do some memories. Let's visit Terrytown. Let's do Okay. Okay. So, uh, yeah. So basically we have, oh, oh, there's side. Sorry. Uh, science vows, some is avatar. Okay, cool. I'm actually going to turn that off because it is not useful for me. Um, I will turn on two lens though, because two lens definitely is. Okay. Uh, so, all right. So, um, we have, uh, discovered most of the game here. Um, at least the overworld. You can see we've kind of like beelined in certain directions. It looks like an X. Um, but we just finished the Zora's Domain regional phenomena. We did Elden, uh, which was, uh, drugs. We did Tulin, which was a, um, uh, a blizzard. And then Gerudo, which was zombie wasps. Uh, so we've found and completed all of the regional phenomena and all that's left is the castle now that's what i would say if that's actually true now we actually have a couple more memories to complete here um and i want to discover a couple more things um now the memories will give us a full a, uh, a bigger picture of what's really going on in the world uh and what zelda has been dealing with in the past i mean we saw before that ganondorf uh killed sonya took her stone and then kind of, you know, destroyed the world. So what's next? So uh, let's take a look at this memory over here. And then uh, we will probably go over, check out Terrytown, some of the Oculus stuff, maybe a labyrinth, and then go to the Lost Woods and the final memory. Um, so uh, yeah. All right. So the next, the next memory, uh, we're going to go over there. That's the next memory. That's what we got to find. Okay. Um, just reiterating as well, since we are definitely in the end game right now, uh, no spoilers, uh, do, do, do not spoil, uh, you will be a uh, banned on site and I, uh, uh, yeah, no, I agree with that. Yeah. You're banned on site and I don't care about you. Um, uh, so, uh, by the way, um, just, uh, just do that. Uh, uh, don't, I said like, don't spoil. And then that's it. Don't pack seat. So don't tell me how to play the game. Uh, just enjoy, put a smile in chat or something like that, you know? Um, all right, let's do this. Let's put like a smile in chat. Um, so. uh, and don't, uh, also suggestions of like, have you done this yet? Have you done that yet? Will you do this? Uh, keep in mind that that could also be a spoiler because I might not know what you're talking about. Consider. Okay. Let's go over to that memory. Uh, way, way far away. Uh, okay. First off, all right, let's, let's go to this right over there. Uh, it's not the memory, but it's like it'll kind of like help get to the memory, you know? No. All right. Okay. Almost there. The fair and sky are. Like oh, we also haven't discovered the cubes or the spheres yet. I definitely want to do that for sure. Like, for sure, for sure. Okay. Hello and goodbye. All right, we've already done this part, which was a shrine quest. We have so much stamina. Uh, and let's go to the memories. Yep, here we go. All right, so there's this last memory. I have no idea what this could be. It seems like a tombstone from what it looks like. Which is kind of sad because that's like Sonya. <laughs> Dude, rip Sonya, man. I'll miss her. <laughs> like one of my favorite characters in this game and happens to be like off, you know? Like rip. All right. Oh, I found. Okay. So the fun thing, the fun fact that I found out like while looking at these memories um, is that in order to figure out where the tier is, you just look at it and whatever filled in spot it is, that's where the actual tier is. 
Um, kind of cool small detail that uh, uh, we figured out. Pretty neat. Pretty cool. So you can see it's it's right there, not on the right or left or anything. Or like up down. Yep. There we go. All right. Yeah, I, I'm so glad we did the memories in order as well. That makes the playthrough like really cool. Kind of like really special. Okay, here it is. Uh, here is the second to last memory. Uh, this also occurs after Raru gave the secret stones to all of the sages. And Ganondorf stole Sonya's secret stone by, well, killing her. So, you know, and destroying the world. Here we go. Second to the last memory. Oh, where is everyone? Under underground? No, this is in the Forgotten Temple still, I think. Oh. Oh, no. Sonia. It is a gravestone. No. Oh, Zelda. Yeah, that's... King Raru, Sad. before you face the Demon King tomorrow, there is something I must tell you. I came, I came to this era after finding a man underground. Oh, uh, yep. Go on. This sets the motions of this game. The secret stone did to Ganondorf. At that moment, I knew for sure what we found underground, that was him. He was still alive, still powerful. He continues to live on all the way until my time. In tomorrow's battle, we won't be able to defeat yeah, him. They lose. No matter how strong we think we are, he'll survive. So, and you, and you. Knowing that, what does Raru do? Maybe so. But it is my duty to try. <sighs> it was my hubris that set us on this path. I must atone for my error in judgment. And above all else, I remain the King of Hyrule. As with any leader, it is my duty to safeguard and protect my people. Yeah. Even if I must risk my life. Raru. And if it proves impossible for us to defeat Ganondorf, we rely on your knight and that legendary sword he carries. Oh my god. Our last line of defense will be Link. Even I remember, if... oh my God. that was a future where you never appeared in this world. And you are here now. Zelda, I believe there is a reason you were sent to us. So, we gotta unpack that. to mean something. Huh. Interesting. The reason I am here. Wow, okay, that's there's a lot to unpack there. First off, time travel shenanigans are time travel travel shenanigans. There's that's a lot. Second thing, um, that is also imagine someone telling you in the past or just in your present being like, Yeah, the battle you're going to tomorrow, you're gonna lose. Um, and you're also gonna die. Like Raru for not breaking down and just like running. Um, and, and, and still just being like, yeah, I might. But you know what? You told me about that legendary swordsman 10,000 years in the future. Even if we just hold him back until that day, he, he's the one that can defeat him. 
that's dude I, oh that's so that's so badass you know it's like if i have to sacrifice my life and the lives of everyone i love in order to have one final shot ten thousand years in the future i will damn now the other thing we gotta unpack is that R raru said that um the the timeline in which zelda and link get like found ganondorf under the castle when raru sealed him away um was not the timeline in which zelda went to the past so it looks like this is like the first loop uh as it were um where you have like you have the regular timeline here and then zelda gets shunted into a second timeline um 10 000 years in the past so it's not only the way this genuinely could only work right is if it's actually a uh, and this is gonna sound so stupid the tears of the kingdom is a um is is, is a uh, multiverse <laughs> right which causes a new timeline to appear we saw kind of a little bit of this in age of the uh, age of calamity um and it looks like they're sticking to this theme it's like if you time travel to the past you create a new timeline you don't like go back to the past of your current timeline you just create a new timeline um so in the original timeline that we're living in right now, Zelda never went to the past. Or the moment Zelda went to the, uh, the past, right? That timeline was like awful. So now we're living in the timeline in which Zelda. Bro, my brain is dying. <laughs> Just, I think <laughs> the gears like broke. <laughs> it's just like, oh, bo, 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 bo. <laughs> um, okay. So the Zelda, is, so, so the timeline in what? How does that make sense? Okay, so. The original timeline where Zelda and Link visited Ganondorf and unlocked him again. That timeline did not have Zelda in the past. Oh, you know how you could probably think of it now, actually? Oh, but then, like, but the, like how then how then are we there? Because it makes sense from the frame, like, because you got to think of it like frames of reference. Um... The sim similar, like, with everything else, right? Like, a, a frame of reference from Zelda, the timeline is still straight. It's still linear. She's just shunted 10,000 years in the past, but in her future, right? Um, but then for Link, right, once Zelda's in the past, does that then change the future for everybody else, too? Now that she's done that? But then that couldn't have happened, because if she went in the past and changed all of the events up leading up to the future, then we wouldn't be in the timeline that we are in right now. Okay, you know what? Um, my brain's breaking. Um, I think we need to complete more of the game in order to figure out what the hell is happening with the timeline of this game. Okay. Anyways, uh, well, we got that 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 we got that memory. That was really sad because of Sonya's grave. Um, however, um, I think we go over this way and uh, check out Terrytown. Uh, and also Akala. And then uh, we go over here. Unless we should, like... Here, I'll... Um, here. Um, let me, let me like... Okay. Um, let me think here. I, I'm wondering if I do look out first. Like, I, 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 I talk to this. And then I explore... Because I don't want... Like, this could, like, activate the end game, and I don't know if I want to yet. Um, I think I think I do everything else first, and then I go and do the lookout landing stuff. You know? Dude, all, all I'm thinking right now is that um, um, if you thought that I had, like, a, a ton of new content by playing Tears of the Kingdom with a bunch of new challenges... Uh, and 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 speed runs and everything, guys. I don't think you understand. Zeltic is going to eat. Zeltic is is literally for the next like ten years of that man's life. 
is going to be a uh, full on into the lore of Tears of the Kingdom. Like Nance, Nance is going to be uh, have not only a poppin' channel, but he's gonna have too much to talk about. All right. Um, let me go. Okay, so let's go. Let's go visit Terrytown. Um, we haven't seen Terrytown yet at all. Um, and I really want to see it. What does it look like now in the future? Um, that's that's. I'm really curious. Also, like Oculus Citadel. Let's go explore a little bit, and then we'll go over there. Um, and I also want to get the final memory, uh, which is located right about here, uh, which is the Lost Woods, and it's in the shape of a Master Sword. Yeah, the, all right, so the last memory is literally in the, like, the last memory is literally in the shape of a Master Sword here. Uh, so I want to go grab that later. Okay, let's go over this way. Um, yeah. Yeah. And let's go to Oculus Citadel. Uh, this is actually, um, fun fact, in Breath of the Wild, the Oculus Citadel was the last sort of beacon of hope for Hyrule. Um, and it was overrun by Guardians. All right, let's auto-build us a vehicle as well. Here. Meow. This is so cool. I love this game. I love this game. I love this game. This game is so cool. I love this game. Did I mention I love this game? Um, because this game is uh, probably one of my favorite games, if not my favorite game of all time. It's uh, man. I just hope that the lore is good at the end. Okay, here we go. We're into this monster forces. Okay, there's a lot of monster forces here. Oh, and a uh, silver or uh, silver bokoblin. Interesting. Okay. Anyways, good for you guys. I uh, I hope you figure out. Some oh, never mind. I gotta run. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I actually gotta run. Um. <laughs> uh... Yeah. Marauders of Akla. Oh, whoa, dude. Oh, okay. So the mon... Sorry. So going to, to Akala Citadel here, we can clearly see that... um The monsters have taken over the Citadel itself, which is a little concerning. Oh, it's raining. Nice. We got it. Uh, that is a little concerning here. Um, yeah, the Oculus Citadel ruins. But let's check it. Can I, like, imagine if I can just, like, ascend all the way up? Oh, whoa. All right, we got some uh, horriblins here. Goodbye. And also, uh, goodbye. Oh, I missed Nice. That's the second. Uh, is there another? Oh, there's another one right here. I ran out of arrows. That's fine. Oh, yikes. Okay. <laughs> Peribolins are actually kind of funny. I, I kind of like them a lot. I'm not going to lie. They're kind of cool. Uh, okay. Uh, and then you're the last one. Nice. The team. Oh, you're not the last one. Oh, you're the last one. God damn. Aw, oh, really? I can't hit you from up there. Oh, but Tulin can. Yeah, I think Tulin is, like, my favorite avatar to have. Uh, he's definitely, like, extremely useful at the very least. Okay. Oh, uh, let's see. Oh, is that a... Okay. Dude, every single time I see that, I'm like... Uh, 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 is, is that... Is that... Is that a Korok? 
Okay. Um, and then was this it? Wait, no, this was just building. Where was the chest? <laughs> Up here? Might have been. Um. Wait, chat. Am I dumb? Where's the chest? Oh, it's right here. I am dumb. That is the chest right there. Okay. Guard sword stick. And then we can go through here. Okay. Uh, a little bit farther up, looks like. Oh. Uh, aha! I need to not miss this. Awesome. For a bubble gem. All right, can I go to the top of Akala Citadel through here? I totally can. Okay. So this is the top of Oculus Citadel. Neato! Uh, this is also where the uh, tower was before. Um, covered in uh, sludge and muck. However, uh, it looks like there's only a shrine here. Kind of cool. Wow. It is worse for wear. Uh, Oculus uh, Citadel ruins are not, not doing well, you know? Yo, Max B, thank you so much for the channel membership. Thank you, thank you. A prone pathway. Okay, cool. Uh, before we do this shrine, I want to say... Scott, I have a secret for you. I don't know if you knew this, but... Him. He is here. He is available. He, him, the doodle plushie. He's so cute. Look at him. You know, the doodle plushie is available, guys, and he's available forever. Uh, buy him at pointcrow.shop. Uh, go check it out. Um, he ships internationally, and he's here. As uh, he's adorable. Well, I have like, we have like five of them. No, like ten of them in the house. In this room alone, there's one, two, three, four. <laughs> and I have so many, and they're so cute. Um, so get him. Uh, he is available. Uh, he'll be available forever. So go uh, go and nab him. Uh, it's at pointcrow.shop. Super soft, super uh, squishy, and absolutely lovable. What was this? Okay. Turns all the way to the right. Interesting. And this one turns it all the way around. Okay, so where do I want to go? Um. How do I want to do this? Okay. Um, this one's weird. I don't have any arrows. Shit. <laughs> I feel like as if that's like important to have for the shrine. Oopsies. Oh well. Uh, that was a good weapon, but oh well. Oh, I could have gotten the chest there. Okay. Uh, Savathusi, thanks so much for the uh, channel membership. Really? 
This trend sucks. <laughs> this yeah. okay oh. um it still works if i just like do that yeah. all right this i think this works i think we can do it I, I think we can do it like this we just have to ride it Hey, thanks for all the subscriptions, guys. I appreciate that. Yeah. All, right. all right, I did it. That was, um... I probably should have used the send earlier. I probably could have used the send earlier. Also, I do want to call out every single person that if I do not solve the puzzle within a minute, starts calling me stupid and dumb. Um, it probably took you an hour. So there you go. If it works, it works. All right, here we go. Dude, our armor is great. Okay, so that's a, it's a thunder Gleok there uh, that I will not be facing uh, because the Gleoks are awful um, to face. Okay. Um, but next, oh, Din Rall. Uh, next, I think we go to Terrytown. Oh my God, we go, we we're so close to Terrytown. It's right there. What? What? They have like a whole new. Okay, we gotta check. All right, we have to check out Terrytown. Actually, we gotta get the. Okay, there's a Thunder Gleok right there. Okay, okay, I, I, I mean you no harm. <laughs> okay, please, we we can talk about this. Actually, I don't even want to talk about this. All right, I'm just gonna ignore you. They say communication is key, but in this case, um, it's key to my survival to not okay hi and goodbye all right let's go to this uh let's go to this tower and then we'll go to Terrytown. i think we do that i think i, I think that's the move here i definitely think that's the move All right. Hello, Ulri Mountain Skyview Tower. Uh, what a mess. Okay. Oh, yeah. Wait, you haven't built things yet. What's up, huh? Uh, we made another Skyview Tower, didn't we? Uh, I dashed here as fast as I could. And it looks like you're pretty fast too. Did you come to see Skyview Tower? I hate to see it, but things are a bit of a mess right now. Uh, how so? Oh, uh, that flying monster took the terminal from the Skyview Tower. Oh, so we have to bring, take it and bring it back to you. Okay. Um, yeah, it, it'll, it'll be like five seconds. Watch this. Literally watch this. Uh, easy. L literally easiest thing of my entire life. Now look at us go. Hello. I brought it here for you. Hey. 
Uh, the terminal. I got it. Mister, you got the terminal back. That flying rascal was the worst. Ah. Ah. Uh, and to carry such a heavy thing on your own, too. Ah. Ah. Uh, I'll repair the terminal once it's in place. Sorry to ask for even more help. Okay, here we go. And here it is. We fixed it, sort of. Ah. You really helped me out. I'll get the terminal up and running in Skyview Tower right away. <laughs> I'll tighten this and done. Uh, there, that's not going anywhere, even if the monster is real determined. Oh. I could have done it without you. I really appreciate it. Okay. Uh, second, wait, this is our second to last tower. Wow. We're really completing this game, guys. We're almost done. I wonder if you could have fused that to like a, a weapon. All right, here we go. Captain! Captain! Look out! Wow. Wow. Look at that. That is uh, the upper right side of the map. There we go. We're almost completed it. We've almost completed it. Where are we dropping, boys? Uh, You see, I already know. The answer happens to lie in... Uh, well, first off, let's, let's, let's beat this boss, and then we'll go to uh, Terrytown. Hello. Hello. How's it going, my guy? Don't mind me. Just walking through, passing through. Oh, I didn't want to send. What am I gonna do? Like, I auto build. Oh, it's a clue. Uh, it's a construct too. Okay, that's fine. Here we go. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. Nice. Got it. Oh, that's so much damage. Okay. Not too bad. Okay. I got a recall. Here. Hello. Oh, never mind. Okay, you're going to explode. Whoopsies. Okay, let's try again. I failed that one. Okay. Come here. You gonna do it again? Okay. Perfect. Awesome. And I failed. <laughs> again. Died. Come on. Come on. Give it here. Okay. Now I'm good. Okay. Almost done. Got, I think, two more to go. Awesome. Easy, dude. Easy. 
Uh, a homing cart. A zoning device automatically heads for monsters. Oh, that's new. Okay, let me fuse this. Yeah. Nice. Definitely what I want. Okay. Okay, let's go to Terrytown. Let's go to Terrytown, guys. Oh, well, actually, let's first get the shrine before Terrytown. I want to be able to teleport back here in case we need it. Missed the chest. Oh, I don't need it. I don't need that chest where I'm going. I'm simply too good at the game. So consider it a handicap. God, this game is so pretty. How are they gonna top this? I, I I don't know how they will. I have I have zero idea if they're gonna be able to. I don't think they can. I don't think they can top it. Okay. Uh, Razitaki Walk Shrine. <laughs> what is that name? The Razitaki Walk Shrine. I know. Oh, it's one of these, isn't it? Damn it. Okay. Proven Grounds. Vehicles? Proven Grounds? All right. Oh, uh, really? That's fine. I thought I'd be able to get the vehicle myself. Um, that's okay. Uh, let's do this. The Proven Grounds is like, uh, small eventide stuff, basically. Oh, really? Um, or it makes it like eventide. Where you lose all of your stuff just for a challenge, you know? All right, what's this over here? Oh, this is just a vehicle itself. Oh, can I just run these guys over with my vehicles? I totally can. It's amazing. Yeah! Yeah! Think that! All right, we got a barrel towards someone here. Goodbye forever! <laughs> Vehicular manslaughter! That's right, that's right. And I do it again, and I do it again! Oh my god! Okay, wait, hey, 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 wait, wait, okay. Sorry, I, need, I, need, I need to come back. Oh, nice, yeah, no, 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 burn, burn the other guy. Yeah, for sure. All right, I need to back up, sorry, all right. Oh, one second, one second here. One second here. Oh, one second. One second here. All right. I just need to do a three point turn. My bad. All right. Here we go. <laughs> Palm the wheel. Palm the wheel, Link. How's it going, my guy? Oh, oh my God. I'm so sorry. I didn't see you there. Oh my God. I'm so embarrassed. Oh my God. I, you know what? I'm so sorry. Um, hitting, uh, question though. Uh, is a hit and run a felony in Hyrule? Uh, I don't know if it is. Like, I just, I just need to make sure. I feel like, you know, like, it, like, is it, or is it just like a, like a misdemeanor? Or actually, is there any law against manslaughter, like vehicular manslaughter? You know, I don't know. I, I actually don't know. I feel like they don't cover that uh, in the manual. Do they even have traffic laws? Did we create the first, like Hyrule's first cars, or was that the Ega? It's probably Ega. I, you know what? I created Hyrule's first car, right, with the Sidon car. So I feel like I should be able to make. At least some judgment calls based on uh, the laws surrounding uh, automobiles. Hello. I'm so sorry. Goodbye. I'm actually not sorry at all. I'm so sorry. I, I'm actually not sorry whatsoever. Once again, I'm not sorry. I wish I were. I'd be, I, you know, if I were sorry, then I, you know, that'd be kind of cool. But I'm not. 
Oh, oh, oh no, another one down. So, you know, hey, we got like a quarter left. Let me just like make another, uh, another round here. Uh, don't worry. Uh, we're like NASCAR, only making left turns. Hey! Hey! Oh, God, sorry. All right, here we go. Another one down. Really? That didn't kill you? All right, fine. I'll just take this in, uh, matters in my own hands. Okay, that didn't kill you. This might kill you. And then you over here. Awesome. Uh, in chat, I um didn't even take damage. Not too bad. Not too bad. All right, here we go. Another shrine completed. All right, what do you give me here? Anything good? Oh, I don't want it. I actually really don't want that. <laughs> Not good. It's it's like, like I know I can use it for elemental effects, but I just don't, so. Oh, I gotta put my, uh, uh, my depth armor back on, you know? All right, Light of Blessing. All right. All right, let's go, guys. Let's go visit Terrytown. Oh, this is the old, um, this is the old Great Fairy location. Oh my God, of course, of course they did this. And they put a Korok here. <laughs> of course they did. All right, Terrytown, Terrytown, Terrytown. Uh, actually, let me go through the actual entrance for Terrytown. I've never really done this before. I don't think anybody really has. Nobody's really gone through the Terrytown entrance. But you know what? I think we'll do it. We'll do it justice. Okay? We'll see Terrytown for the first time uh, like this. Here we go. Look, it's Terrytown. Hudson Construction. Whoa. It's it's so complete. <laughs> Terrytown was like one of my favorite side quests ever in video gaming. Like whatsoever. Like it was like amazing. And it was so heartwarming. Let's check it out now. It's all built, it's all complete. mod chat i don't i can't tell if you guys are idiots or trolling it's not a mod chat <laughs> this is the new game tears of the kingdom what is the fuck 
Oh, they're trolling? Oh, okay. I fell for it. But um, I just want to tell you guys all that um, there are jokes that are funnier than that. <laughs> you see, a joke requires somebody to laugh. Okay. Uh, let's see. All right, we have only three light blessings. Wow, Terrytown's so pretty. <gasps> oh my God! Wait, oh, it's it's Ross and and Hudson. They're married. They're married. I'm so worried. Oh. Just yesterday, she was talking about it happily. Perhaps you're overthinking it. I thought I understand. I know that you're worried about Madison moving. But Nari told me that Madison has been acting really cheerful lately. I can't help but wonder if she's, you know, putting on bold face after she's going to be picked up soon. <sighs> Please, if you keep acting like this, it will make it more difficult for Madison to leave. It's a once-in-a-lifetime journey for a Gerudo. We should support her and give her a grand send-off. Mm. You're right, of course. It's a special journey, and we should do something big for her. Is Madison... Is Madison their daughter? <gasps> huh? Ah, a customer. Oh, oh, welcome to Hudson Construction. Let me guess. You're in the market for a dream home, right? That's no surprise. Our unique modular building style lets you put uh, rooms together to create the perfect home. But I'm so sorry. We're still not ready to open for business. Mm -hmm. Wait, it's you. Ooh. Oh, look, it is. It sure has been a while. You know, thanks to you, Terrytown is doing some real good. Uh, nowadays, it's kind of, kind of village that welcomes folks from all over to come live in peace. And we have a daughter. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Looks just like her papa. She's wonderful. <sighs> My little Madison. <sighs> Hudson, you got to get it together. Ugh. Sorry, I've got to go. We're kind of busy right oh. now. I'm going back to work now, Rodson. But don't worry. I'll try to think of something nice to do for Madison. Madison's independence. Right. Um, I'm going to restart my capture card really fast because it's getting some crackles. We should be all good. Hudson and Rodson. Okay. Um, Madison's independence. So it seems like, um, yeah, Madison is going to Gerudo. Um, and uh, yeah, Rodson was super excited about it, but Hudson wasn't. What am I going to do? Ooh. We're so deep in conversation, we hardly made time for you earlier. Sorry about that. You know, Hudson Construction, we like to say, Ooh. it's sun and done. <laughs> Here I am, president of the company. I'm supposed to be strong and decisive. Ooh. When it comes to my own child, I feel so unsure about things. Ooh. I mentioned her earlier. We have a daughter named Madison. She's wonderful. All the best parts of me and my wife, Rodson. Madison, well, she's going to leave and move to my wife's birthplace, Gerudo Town. Uh, the Gerudo have a law that says they can't associate with men until they come of age, you see. I mean, it's fine when they're very young, but when they start to become more aware of the world around them, uh, someone comes from Gerudo Town to pick them up. Uh, I've been told that for a Gerudo, spending time in Gerudo Town is an honor. And Madison does seem to be looking forward to it. Anyways. Uh, I want to give her a big set off, but I didn't realize this would be so hard on me. Uh, sorry you had to listen to me go on like that. I should really get back to the job site soon. <sighs> I want to spend more time with my little girl before she has to leave, but I have so much work to do. Uh, my wife has her hands full too. She's so busy, she can't even take work requests. Mostly, I just wish someone could spend time with Madison so she wouldn't feel so lonely. Aw. Oh, wait, let's go visit. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go talk to Madison. Where's... Okay. Okay, let's, let's let's go talk to Madison. Um, where is she? Uh, probably at the job site, I think. Um, that's so cute. Uh, yeah, Ma oh no, Madison's in the house. Okay, yeah, let's go talk to Madison. Uh, give her give her some company since uh, her parents are oh. working so hard. That's the company storehouse. However, the door seems to be stuck and can't be opened from the outside. Maybe someone's blocking it from the inside. Oh. Um, uh, okay. I mean, let's go up here instead, I guess. Um. Oh. Yo. That's Madison. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. <laughs> she does look like Hudson and Rodson. Oh, my God. <laughs> good morning is uh, Savota. Uh, good day is Vak. And goodbye is... Uh, what is goodbye? <laughs> what? Aw. Uh, don't frighten me like that. For a second, I thought you were here to take me away on my big journey. Uh, I'm doing all this studying because I'm moving to Mama's hometown. Where she's from, there's this amazing language called Gerudo. I want to teach every son in the village to speak it too. So I've made it my miss son. 
to memorize as many words as I can. Uh, the sun in the name is just uh, the, the running joke. Uh, I'm getting tired, so I have to say goodnight now. Uh, but when I wake up, I'm going to give uh, less sun to Granny Monari. You should come with me if you're interested. After some instruction sons for me, you'll be speaking Gerudo in no time. For this lesson, you're going to be giving a Gerudo quiz. Uh, you should try it. Well, then, see you later. All right. Um, uh, okay, so he's going to find uh, Granny Minari. All right, so let me go to sleep here. Um, uh, let me go to sleep. And then... Yeah, let's go to sleep. And then we'll be able to... Uh, do this Gerudo quiz lesson for, um, uh, uh, for Madison. Yeah, she's a good person. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Um, alrighty. Let's, uh, let's go. Oh, um... I say let's go up uh, and see, but yeah, she's gone uh, because we need to talk to Whoa, what's 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 the name again? Uh, Granny Minari to give her a quiz on the Gerudo. All right, let's find her. Let's find Madison. Wherever she could be. Um, Probably at the work site. Oh, it's Kilton. Okay. Um. Uh, is she is she down here? Oh my god, it's the work site. Whoa there! Want to use the rail car? Interesting. Uh, there's a fee for that. You're free to use it once you pay up. Okay. Um, Madison. Oh, Madison. Oh, over here. Okay. Hello, I'm going to spend time with you because your parents are busy working on your uh, departure. Uh, Granny Minari, uh, Savota. Uh, oh my, you're in good mood today. Madison, is it time for another lesson? Uh, of course, and it's a new special occasion too because a new student is joining the class. Uh, okay, now pay attention, son. Granny Minari, it's time for Madison's Gerudo quiz. What is the Gerudo word for Granny? Uh, granny in Gerudo is... Uh... Oh, I didn't study. Probably, uh, Vada. <laughs> nope, too bad. And Granny Minari is out of time, too. Uh, yep, let's give it another try. Um, it is definitely, for sure, Vaba. Ding, ding, ding. That's right. Ah, uh, Vaba. It was on the tip of my tongue. Uh, well, there's one more Gerudo speaker around here. Uh, thanks to Madison, I've grown rather knowledgeable about their language myself, you know. Uh, well, it's how they talk in Mama's hometown. So if every son can talk like that here, well, then Mama won't be so lonesome, right? That's awesome. I feel better knowing Mama will be okay. But now I think uh, I need to think of a way to help Papa. Uh, I've got it. Papa's always so busy. So I'll make it my, it my mission to help him with his work. I'm going to ride the rail car to the job site where he does all the work. Oh my God. She just wants to be like her parents. She's, she had to grow up too quickly. At her age, she should be clinging to her Mama and Papa's legs. Not working up a sweat trying to make sure they're happy. Aw. Then again, maybe she won't have to. Ever since Haggy was put in charge of the rail car, it's been a whole lot harder to catch a ride. Oh, so Madison's learning to be independent as a as a child. Uh, unfortunately, Rodson and Hudson um, are a little too busy for her, so we're keeping her company. Yo, I want to ride the rail car so I can help Papa's construction site and help him get his work done. Uh, but I forgot the guy uh, won't give me a permission to ride until I pay him. I never had to pay until the tea took over. <laughs> Guess I'm going to have to hop uh, on board the rail car without him noticing. But I'm going to do that all by myself. Uh, I need for someone to cover his eyes or something. Is there like a... Can I like literally block his vision or something? Oh, wait. Also, can I ring this? <gasps> That's so cool. Oh my god! <laughs> of course it is! Of course it's a Korok! Yahaha! Oh my god. Alright, so I need to cover your eyes. Hello? Uh, I thought it might be valuable when I picked up, but this weird rock's giving me creeps. Right. 
Oh. And to the construction site, there's a small fee to use the rail car. Oh, no. Are you not turning around? What? Ah. Uh, you can only pay once. Yeah. Here's 20 rupees. <laughs> ah. Give it a whack. Uh, goodbye. Okay. Now that Hudson's back at the site, there's no no one to stop me from collecting that fee. Oh, he's not. He's not. He's a little scum. Oh, wait. We can, we can hide your eyes. There's no way that this is actually the way we do this. Are you kidding me? <laughs> we have to literally hide him from seeing Madison here. Stop that. This rock belongs to me. Oh, sorry. All right. Well, now you can't see me. <laughs> you good, man? <laughs> everything, everything all right? All right. Let's let's go. Let's go, Madison. Let's go. You can't see us. Okay. How am I gonna do that? I can get someone to maybe cover his eyes. You can go now. Go 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 go. Go go go. He can't see you. I'm nervous about it, but I trust you. I'll run straight there. Okay. Go, Madison. Go. This is kind of cute. This is this is this is actually kind of cute. Cause like I'm just remembering the Terrytown quest from uh, Breath of the Wild, where you're like literally building uh, the site and you're getting everybody uh, around the world to populate the town. And Hudson, um, Hudson, well, falls in love with one of the uh, the vendors, Ronson. Uh, my mission was a success. Okay, I can finally get to Papa. Okay, he's gonna be so happy to see me. Thanks for helping me. This is so cute. Um. Okay, now let's go to the drop site and uh, see her. I'll, you know what? I'm thinking I'm gonna leave him there. <laughs> out of sight, out of mind. You know. Oh, the job site. Oh my God, they're building a full. Whoa. That's so cool. The Hudson construction site. They're making a full town here. Oh my god. I love this. You can hear like the... the, the it's the, still the Terrytown song. But it's uh, it's more of a um, um, drum-based sort of uh, percussion. So then it's like... It's like they're literally building this place. That's so cool. Basically, Rob, thanks for the uh, channel membership. And Devil Man, um, thank you so much for the membership as well. Thank you. Uh, all right. What's up, Madison? We made it. Oh. Hey, you didn't, uh, you didn't mention you were coming here too, mister. Uh, it's strange. Papa keeps mumbling himself. Mm -hmm -hmm. Cool. Oh, it's you. So, you know, I've been doing a lot of thinking, uh, trying to figure out what I could possibly do for Madison. Oh. Uh, and, well, what I came up with was this. Town is pretty far from here, and there's uh, plenty of monsters along the way. So I thought I'd make Madison her own special air balloon. That's so nice of you. But I wanted to make it really special. I'm just not how, sure how to do that. Yeah. Especially not. I love the balloon you made, Papa. It looks like the sun. Mm. God, that's so adorable. The sun. Ooh. That's it. Let's color it yellow like the sun. I've seen sun lines around here. I, I could use them to make a dye. Uh, but for me to dye something this size, I need 10 of them. Uh. Um, yeah, I already have them. I'll make finding them my new mission. Uh, sunlight lines are quite rare, though. I'm not sure where you'd find them. Uh, I've seen a sunlight line before. It was attached to the ruins that fell from the sky. The sky, huh? All right. Well, I actually already have 10 sunlight lines. So uh, here they are. Huh? Uh, that's awesome. You did it. You really and truly collected 10 of them. What's this? You found them all for us? Looks like I'll have no problem dyeing the balloon the color of the sun. Uh, I wasn't any help at all. I failed my mission. Uh, that's not true. No, you, you helped me. Your papa is about to turn this balloon into the sun, isn't he? I know. Why don't you help me with that? Aw. <laughs> Aw. She just wants to help. That's so cute. Mm -hmm. Quicken quality. Blinken, we're done. That's why every son chooses Hudson Construction. <laughs> they have their own jingle, too. Aw. That, wait, that's adorable. At last, it's done, and morning is already here. I'm just happy I get to watch my little one sleep a little bit longer. Uh, uh, Hudson! Oh. Mm -hmm. uh, Ronson, uh, what's wrong? Uh, no, don't tell me. <sighs> yes, her escort has arrived and is waiting at the village entrance. 
Oh. I see. All right. Oh. Let's all go together then in Madison's special sun balloon. Uh, would you join us as well? Uh, you know, uh, see you're off. This is so cute. <laughs> wow. I feel like I've been turned into a bird. <laughs> oh, Madison, don't make such a ruckus. You do not want to fall from this height. Ooh. Hey, everyone. Uh, yo, take a look at that. The sun's waking up. Oh. It's a blessing. It's blessing the start of your journey, Madison. Whether you're in Gerudo Town or Terrytown, never forget that we're all standing beneath the very same sun. <laughs> the only distance that matters is the distance between our hearts. You see, your mama will always be beside you. Ooh. We'll be touching down soon. Hold on tight. So sad. That's that's I dude, I'm so glad we went to Terrytown. I dude, I love the Terrytown side quests. Oh, they hurt they like they they hurt. They like they hit your heart. Like right 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 there. They make you emotional. God damn it. Papa, your present made me very happy. Hmm. Madison, you know, if you get lonely, you can come back any. Sorry. Never mind. Papa needs to be strong, just like you. My little Madison, it's time for you to go out on your big adventure. Oh. Yes, it's time. Oh. You can trust me. Uh, I, I'll take care of your mama and papa. Don't worry. You can go. Oh. Oh. Uh, go become a wonderful Vi. And come back with lots of stories to tell. I can't wait to hear about your adventures. I'll come visit you in Terry. Uh, I'll come visit you in Gerudo Town sometime. Uh, uh, when I do, let's play again. <laughs> Thank you, Everson. I, I mean, Sark, Sarkso. Oh. I'm gonna become a great Vi like Mama, and I'll meet wonderful Vo like Papa. Hi. Dvorak, Everson. Yeah, become independent. Let's go. You got this. Oh. oh. Ronson. Did I manage to keep a smile on my face? Oh. Yes. Uh, you did great. Uh, she didn't cry, so it's good we didn't cry either. Now, this is the start of a new life for us, too. Mm -hmm. Let's pull ourselves together, if you're ready. Mm. Yes. You're right, of course. <clears throat> okay, I am ready. Oh. Uh, sorry about that. You know, you were a really big help to me. Honestly, I can't thank you enough. Those sunda lines were pretty valuable, weren't they? Well, as a way of saying thank you, please take this. Sure. Oh, yeah. Oh. Uh, and this is from me. Aww. <laughs> You've already helped me so much. But if you ever visit Gerudo Town... Oh, sorry. Uh, but if you ever visit Gerudo Town, please check in on Madison. Mm? What are you talking about? Have you forgotten that vote aren't allowed in Gerudo Town? Mm -hmm. uh, right. I, I guess it slipped my mind. <laughs> Now, I've got to get back to work. Don't you have a customer waiting for you, dear? Aww. That's... That's that's so sweet. Madison's independence complete. Aww. From from setting up Ronson and Hudson together uh, to five years, six years, I don't know. It, it, to some amount of time years later, uh, their daughter all grown up uh, and uh, living her own independent life. God, I love Terry Down so much. <laughs> oh. Okay. Um, let's go see if we can actually see Madison in uh, uh, Gerudo. Um, yeah. <laughs> A little emotional. <laughs> okay. Uh, Gerudo, let's see about Madison. Uh, dude, what a... Dude, I think every single, like, side quest that we've, like, taken up to has just been, like, so good. It's, like, been the best side quests here. Okay. Uh, let's see if we can find Madison. 
Uh, where would she be? Uh, there's Riju and everything. Uh, you're doing great. Um, uh, that's not okay. I wonder if we could see Madison. Oh, oh, oh there, there's Madison. Mama, Papa, I forgot to mention I made a great friend. Uh, oh. <laughs> they sure are cute when you're there asleep, aren't they? I bet they're having happy dreams right now. Most Gerudos sleep really deeply, you know. We get high quality sleep that way, which helps us build our bodies. One of the reasons we go quicker than anyone else. Of course, we sleep less deeply as we get older. <laughs> I'm told that when I was a child, hardly anything could wake me up from a sound sleep. Oh, she's made a good friend. That's so cute. Oh my God. Okay. Let's, uh, let's discover some more things here. I think we want to check out like maybe like a labyrinth or two, uh, maybe the tech lab a little bit and then probably get the, um, last, uh, tower and probably memory. Oh my God, dude. That, that was adorable. He's emotional. Yeah, I, I think it's like without fail. It's like every single time there's like a Terrytown side quest. It's like one of the best side quests. It's like, especially like, especially since like there's, I don't know. It's like, it's, it's because we've like lived the whole life of that entire family so far. It's like kind of extra special, you know, like we did that. And to see, like, your favorite characters do more is just amazing. Um, okay. Now, let's go down to the tech lab. Okay. Uh, let's see. Something over there. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's go to the tech lab. Uh, and then maybe the, the labyrinth? Uh, I want to, I want to check out the labyrinths as well. Um, that seems like relatively important for me to do here. Uh, very curious too. Okay. What a game, dude. I hope you guys are enjoying, uh, as, as much as I am, um, because this is so fun, right? This is so fun. It's crazy. All right, uh, let's go down. Uh, I want to get the stable here because I'm going to run out of stamina, I believe. I'm going to get the stable. Uh, and then uh, we can figure out some other stuff. What is... I just water. Okay. Uh, man, I still have not... Dude, I think they took out Lionels in this game, but... Dude, I, I don't even know. I haven't even seen one yet. There's supposed to be a Lionel in Akala from Breath of the Wild. Uh, all right. East Oculus Stable. All right. Uh, one point to our uh, pony points. Nice. Oh, we got a reward. Okay. Uh, once again, uh, do you want to rescue a horse? All right. Let's take the horse out. Re let's take out Regret. Yes. Okay. Um, okay. But I, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll figure it out. Um, a towing harness. Remove harness. Okay. Gotcha. I'll give it a regular saddle. Anyways, um, thanks guys for not spoiling things um, or telling me things about the game that I don't know already. Um, please ask when you feel like changing your horse's gear. Okay. All right. Uh, that's right. Did you meet Melania at Bloodleaf Lake at, uh, in the north? I did not, actually. Uh, if she takes liking you, uh, she can boost her horse's abilities. Oh, okay, cool. All right, let's go regret. Uh, we haven't seen Melania yet. <laughs> Lots have been putting in work. Yeah, they have been, uh, from what I know. They've like they've told me um, that they've been putting in a lot of work, um, and uh, I, I don't, I don't know what to say. Um, 
Um, I wish more people would realize that uh, spoiling things for others ruins that thing for them, uh, even if it's out of like uh, good good intentions um, and to just like you know vibe. Um, it's uh, it's I, I will say this: it is a much uh, uh, different experience on on Twitch um, because of the moderation tools that we have available for us. Uh, because YouTube's moderation tools are ass. Now I'll, I'll go on record saying that they suck. Um, but um, uh, yeah, I um, um, I don't know how to get it more across. Uh, just don't spoil things. Uh, that's like the the main deal. Um, like you can we can have fun uh, and we can we can chat we can, we can chill uh, without without spoiling you know. Um, and, and, uh, you know, the other thing too, is like, I've seen some, like one or two people like complain about, oh, wow, I'm getting timed out. My, your mods are blah, blah, blah. Um, no, I agree with it. If, if my mods make an action of like, they time you out or they ban you, I stand by that full, full, full stop. I've, I mean, hell, I've known some of these, uh, people for like three, four years now. Um, <laughs> they're like some of my really good friends. So, um, so just FYI, um, you know, uh, just, just, uh, I, I, don't know how to uh, moderate chat more um, on YouTube um, as much as you, you know. Uh, I think it has to do with the mod tools specifically. I don't think it has to do much with you guys. Um, but uh, I, we're trying our best. So, you know. Um, so, yeah. Um, no, I wasn't spoiled. Uh, no, 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 I wasn't spoiled. Uh, this is just, uh, me just in general. Um, I've been, uh, every now and then, like every, every, you know, I'll, I'll, every couple days I'll like talk with uh, mods or, you know, uh, my team and everything and ask like, Hey, how's it going? And, uh, from what, <laughs> from, <laughs> from what I've heard, they're literally like, we're in the trenches. Go, 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 go. Oh, they shot back. You know, like a full, like it's, it's like a war zone, you know? <laughs> so, um, yeah, we're trying our best out here. Um, it's. I just wanted to put this on the record of like, um, it's definitely YouTube's moderation tools, and it definitely makes it like a, a lot harder to stream on YouTube. And um, until I fix that, I don't know if I would do it full time. Um, that's why I stream on both Twitch and YouTube because uh, um, we get the best of both worlds. Uh, because on YouTube, a lot of you guys get to see my stuff and enjoy it, you know. Um, and uh, uh, yeah. Also, I mean, I, you know what? I will, I will address this here. Um, I will say that I do uh, really like um, you guys. Um, I really like, uh, I really like my YouTube chat. I really like my Twitch chat, and um, I, I think streaming on both sides is great. Um, so I, I wanna, um, I wanna keep doing that in the future. You know, um, so like overall, even though I'm talking about all of this stuff, um, don't get me wrong. This is like a thing that's like, ooh, that sucks. But I want to really, like, address and, and be like, hey, I'm having fun, you know? And I want to say thank you for having fun with me uh, through all of this. Um, seriously. So th there may be, like, one or two hiccups in here and there. But we're all just people, you know? We're all just trying to enjoy a game. And uh, I'm glad that you can uh, sit here and enjoy with me. Okay. Uh, let's get this uh, shrine here. Yeah, there we go. The Jochi Eu shrine. Uh, before we go to the tech lab. Okay. Courage to pluck. Huh. Courage to pluck. Okay. So the goal of this shrine seems to be um, we need to get a uh, this ball into here. Uh, this is an ascend spot. We need it. And we have some electricity here for some reason. Uh, can I move this? I can move. Oh God, it's Jenga. <laughs> Dude, it's Jenga. Roy Corvette. Oh my God. Thank you so much for the 20 gifted memberships, by the way. That is very kind of you. I appreciate that a lot. And if you got one of those memberships, uh, put a P Crow gift in chat. Um, that and also Ando Nell. Thank you so much for the membership as well. Yeah, I'm only, uh, chat, I'm only serious about like chat stuff 
every now and then just because i really care about the community that we um create here and the uh like the the, the viewership you know the murder as it were um that's why so if you're ever wondering why does he keep talking about this it's because i want I want this to uh, be a fun spot where we can all, uh, you know, play video games together and enjoy. Okay. So, um, how the hell? Okay. So I need, I need the, I need the blocks to like, I need to pull the correct block in order to create instability enough where it'll fall down this way. No. What's my goal here? Wait, idea. Actual idea. Wait, legitimate? Like, actually, great idea. I have. Watch this. Wait, not that. Okay. Okay, we do this and then ultra hand right here. Got it. Nice. Hell yeah. And that's how you do it, guys. You can recall something and then ultra hand it. So we don't have to do whatever uh, fuckery they wanted us to do. Pretty fast. Light of Blessing. All right, so we can do... Um, oh, I don't know if we got another heart or, like, more stamina. Maybe more stamina. That's always good. All right, and then we go to the tech lab next. Oh, thanks also uh, for the um, uh, subscriptions, guys. All right, it's been six hours today. My God! Holy... It's been six hours. Well, thank you so much for uh, subscribing, guys. Thanks for... Thanks for enjoying. If you haven't subscribed already, feel free to. It is free. All right, let's check out the uh, tech lab here uh, and see what's up with it. Oh, what is going on here? Oh, Lord. What's happening? Okay. Okay. Yeah, it's really rainy at the tech lab here. Uh, this uh, this is where Robbie was uh, way, way long ago. Yeah, this is where Robbie was. And he would build us ancient parts. What is it? Wait, you! It's Link! Get ready for battle! Wait, what? Huh? Oh. Uh, is this where the Giga... Wait. <laughs> Okay. We got a Yiga Blade Master and we got you. Easy. Okay. Wait, so that's not Robbie. That's That's Koga? Wait, what? You're not Look, I'm sorry, okay? I'll make your little uniforms without any more complaints, I swear. Oh, so that's how it ha- Yeah, so that's how the Yiga get their outfits, right? It's Konba who wears CC outfits. Okay, we might have uncovered a little dark truth here. Remember CC back from Hateno Village, right? With the little uh, uh, Reed sort of politics stuff. I wonder how CC is able to afford all of that uh, fancy material. Turns out it's because the Yiga clan pays them, right? Big Yiga clan is funding CC's campaign. Oh shit! We got some full on corruption here. Hold up. Hey, hey, superstar, you're not here with the Yiga clan, are you? So please tell me you're here to rescue me. Uh, that's fantastic. I've been cooped up here forever. The name's Konba. I've got a knack for style and the nimble digits. I need to spin my ideas into reality. Uh, last that pure talent is why the Yiga clan kidnapped me and forced me to make their outfits for them. Oh. If I ever sew one of those tacky rags again, I'll be, uh, it'll be too soon. 
fact, you should take the Yiga armor I just finished. The look may lack, but my tailoring is sublime. If you wore the whole set, you'd fit right in with the Yiga clan. Oh, so then they wouldn't attack me. On that note, I got to hurry out of here before they get back. Don't worry. I'm more athletic than I look. Uh, see you around. Thanks for the save. That's pretty cool. That is really cool. Um, I still do like the depths armor better, though. I mean, like, look at this. Like, we're, we're badass. All right. So that's what the tech lab is. We get the Yiga armor. Okay. Cool. Oh, uh, interesting. You can also see, like, I guess, like, Yiga hideouts here on where they are. Oh, we've actually already done all of this, I think. No, we haven't. I lied. Anyways, cool. Oh, there's a chest here, too. Uh, a travel medallion prototype. Oh, but it's unusable. Okay. But we can set a travel... Okay. A travel medallion is, is there. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. That's pretty neat. Okay. Um, Depths. I do want to do the depths here just a little bit so I can get the um, um the depths armor. Like, finish off the depths armor. Okay. Before we get the final memory, okay? I uh, Before we get the final memory and the final tower... Okay, I want to go to the depths and get the final depths armor. Uh, yeah, okay, so in order to do that, uh, let's go back to the pose. Okay. Oh, let's go. We look so cool. Okay. Oh, here we go, guys. We're right into the depths. East Akala Plains Chasm. Oh my god! Oh Jesus! Why is there a frog here? And he's so large! What is going on? Hi. I am in gloom right now. Jeez. Okay, he is literally eating me right now. Oh god. Oh god. Please stop. Please. That is so disgusting. Obsidian frog scourge of the depths. Oh, but this is a full on, full on boss fight. Okay, I can get up here and then I can uh, spin to win, I think, with this blade. Okay, I got one. Okay, I got two. Okay, the blade broke, but that's fine. Um. Yeah, I'll, I'll do the pulverizer here. That works well. Okay, stop. Let me shoot you. Nice! Okay, I only have one arrow left to hit him. So either I beat him right now... Or... Um, I have to shoot that last arrow and hit him. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Last arrow here. Awesome, I hit it, I hit it. Okay, gotta get this last, last one. Oh God, oh God. Yes! And we got the obsidian frogs on. All in the darkness too. Damn. Oh, you know what I could have, uh, in hindsight, I probably could have done this. There we go, a little bit better. 
Oh, we got an Obsidian Frox Fang. 24 fused attack power. And Frox Guts. That's disgusting. Oh, uh, that's gross. Okay, there's the light root over there. Crazy, actually crazy. Oh, dude. Okay. All right. So let's go to the light route here. And then um, we're looking for this Poe right here, the bargainer statue. Um, and that bargainer statue will allow us to uh, get the last uh, of the uh, depths armor that we're looking for specifically. All right. Here we go. Here's the light route. Oh, it's the Atlantis uh, light route. Okay. Um. Yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, that's not that's not too bad. Uh, it's not too bad of an area. It's a little bit small, but sure. Uh, we're looking for up here. Yeah, okay, there it is. All right, the green ping is what we're after. Uh, dude, hi. Dude, I love the depths. I think it is... They, I think they did it so well. It's a little, obviously, a little, like, concerning with the depths where you're just kind of, like, um, there's, like, so much to explore. And then, um, you know, it's, like, actually, like, all dark and everything. But it makes you, like, have some, like... Um, it has, uh, it makes you have some, like, it forces you to solve problems that you didn't think you would have. Like, at what point are you, like, really struggling for light in video games? Especially, like, a, um, like, a Zelda game. And you're, you're just like, hey, figure it out. Like, it's not our problem. Right? Like, we, we create a dark environment. You gotta figure out how to get around, and it's dark as hell out. Good luck. It's, it's great. Yeah. Depths is amazing, dude. Oh, all right, that's fine. Um, I'm just curious about later. All right, go up. I want to get the depths armor, and then I think we head over to the last memory. Um, unless I like missed anything. Oh, I want to do a labyrinth or two. I think we do the last memory and then like a labyrinth or something. <laughs> I think that's what we do here. Okay. Go to the uh, po the bargainer post statue. Should be up this way. Okay. Wellspring of power. Okay. Where is this man's? Where is this man's? I want to sell my soul for some uh, extra drip. There we are. You who stand before me make an offering. Okay. Uh, you've encountered my brethren. Stay a moment. Okay. Please be the depths helmet. The hood of the depths. Desire it. You must make a suitable offering. Okay. I need eight more pose. Eight more pose. Just eight more. That's it. I, I just, just eight pose. Um, if this is the wellspring of power, there should be posed nearby. Wow, that was a really far throw. Um, okay. The wellspring of power should be like, like over here. Dude, I will be discovering more and more of this game. Um like un until like i die any more pose oh wait i can like do this now i have the zora armor so i can climb up the waterfall oh my god that's huge please have pose up here you have no pose you have no pose 
or hose. You have neither. Oh, there's some over here though. Okay. No pose. Okay, this one's five. Okay, so we need three more. Should be good enough. Nice. Okay, perfect. Yo, James Taylor, thank you so much for the uh, five gifted channel memberships. Thank you. That's very kind of you. Uh, if you got one of those, uh, use a Pcro gift in chat. Um, oh yeah, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. All right, we're almost to the, the other end over this way. Yeah, thank you so much. And then up and around. Okay. I will uh, go over here. And then we'll grab the last piece of Depth's armor. Okay. Here it is. Okay. Um, let me let me get dripped out here. First off, let me throw here. Okay, so you can see it, and then let me get dr absolutely dripped out. Okay. So before we get the next memory, we're gonna get that last uh that last piece of armor. The hood of the depths. I've returned the lost spirits to the afterlife. Here we go. The hood of the depths. Damn! Damn, dude! He looks sick! He looks absolutely sick. Actually insane. Oh, wait, wait. Plus the katana? Oh, we gotta, like, actually, like... Look at that, dude. <laughs> That's so cool. Looks like Xant. All right. I will. I do actually like, for some reason, I do like this look a little bit better. Um, uh, personally. So we're going to keep with it. But like, dude, the depth. Oh, the depth drip is sick. Yeah, this is, this is our look here. Okay. Uh, let me... Let's start with this and then let me put our thing back and then i actually don't want to break our guy um all of our important stuff so all right there we go is that the grim reaper okay so uh let's go up and yeah i mean okay let's check it out so what what, what do we have left to to uncover that i want to uncover personally Hmm. I mean, there's like, there's the uh, Thunder Sky right here, which is kind of cool, I think. It might be. Um, there's, uh, I definitely want to check out one of the labyrinths. So let's do it like this. Okay. So let's check out the last memory. Let's check out the last memory and do all of this. And then we'll do a labyrinth. And then probably the lookout landing stuff. That's what I'm thinking we're doing. Yeah. Oh, we want to do a sphere as well. Right. I haven't done a sphere. <sighs> okay. Uh, time for the last memory. But before we do, I do need to go to the restroom. Uh, I need to go to the bathroom. So... Um, give me half a second. Um, I will, right before we do the last memory, I'm going to leave you guys once again with where you guys left off at the bouncing DVD logo screen. I'm not even joking. This is actually what we're doing. All right. Let me know if you find said DVD logo into the corner. Okay. Wait, let me, let me write the, let me do a nice like Comet Observatory.
boys. The plan is simple. All right. Uh, how's it going, guys? Oh, welcome back. I am here and no longer in said bathroom. All right, let's uh continue playing some Tears of the Kingdom. Let's get the last uh, memory. It actually hit. No, I don't believe you guys. I don't believe it actually hit the corner. Did it act? Okay, chat, did it actually hit? I don't think so. Alrighty. Next memory. All right, let me heal a little bit here. With our 85 apples. All right, cool. Um, so, yeah, so what we're going to do right now is uh, we're going to, I guess, go to the Lost Woods and maybe Typhlo Ruins and get that last memory um, with the last Geoglyph. Looks like everyone's about to go to war. And uh, I mean, we'll see about it. Wait, speaking of which, what the hell happened to... What the hell happened to... The Lost Woods? What? Oh, okay. So the memory's over there, but... Um... What the hell? All right. The, yeah, the memory's over there. Like, the geoglyph's, like, right here. Um... But the Lost Woods? Like, you guys good? Like, what happened here? It's like someone nuked the Lost Woods out of the sky. The ground? Oh, my God. What if the Lost Woods are, like, in the depths? Oh, let's check this out. Let's see what the Lost Woods actually are here. Like, I have no idea what to expect from them, and yet I still feel like whatever I expect will... Oh, oh. Star! 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 Star fragment in the sky. That was so cool. Oh my god. We just did that. Okay. The Lost Woods? What is going on? What? Okay, the last memory is right over there. It's, like, right there, but, like... Uh... What's happening? Yeah, should I get the... Yeah, should I get the, uh, Lost... Uh, should I get... Should I check out the Lost Woods first, or do the memory? What do you guys think? Lost Woods or memory? All right, let's do the memory. All right, we're going to return to the Lost Woods in a sec. That is something to look forward to. Let's go do the memory. Jeez, dude, what the hell happened here? What the hell? The Lost Woods uh, seems to be lost, all right. Like, there's, there's no woods left. It's just shadow and darkness great <laughs> great guys uh, wow we are we are almost at the end okay wow okay um I think yeah, we'll just head over. Maybe this isn't the correct path, but it is a path that we're going to. <laughs> we're just going to climb the mountain sideways. 
and uh, head on over uh, to the last memory. The memory of which um, is um, a, what I'm assuming is the um, the Master Sword. Um, because they're about to go fight Ganondorf um, after he killed Sonya and took the secret stone. Also, uh, guys, thank you so much for all the subscriptions. I appreciate it. Uh, for those who, for those, uh, while we're walking, uh, for those who watched the edited video um, of the playthrough, we're trying to get out more edited videos as soon as possible. There might be one in a couple days from now um, on part three. Uh, I think it might be the four-ish parts or so. Um, we'll, we'll, we shall see. Um, but how'd you guys like it? Uh, how'd you guys like the, the part two? Uh, I want some, I don't have any arrows. Wow. I want some feedback. So then, uh, you know, we can make the next one, uh, uh, even better than the last. Um, it was, uh, it was an 80, uh, it was a 70 minute video. It was a little long. Get the shrine. First. It was good. Okay. I'm busy watching the live stream. Okay. You know what? Point taken. <laughs> Point taken. Point taken. Oh. I should get a minecart again. Dude, Typhla ruins are no longer covered in dark. All right, let's do the shrine. Uh, yeah, I just hope it wasn't too long for you guys. I would rather make it long and really good than short and kind of like too cut. All right, spinning gears. Um, it's gonna sound stupid. Can't we just like? Okay, <laughs> I solved it. <laughs> I solved it, guys. Um, okay. And then let's do this. Oh, oh, you know what? I should do the other way. Yeah. So we need to do the other way like this. Okay. And then... One more. And then we do recall on here. Nice. Go team. Woo. Paladin, thanks so much for the channel uh, membership. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate that a lot. I was doing some work. Okay. Okay. I think we get the memory next. Uh, which is right here. Okay. All right. Let's let's get this memory. Um, let's find out where it uh where it is. Where's this tier? Might be like right. No, it's definitely like at the tip over up here. Hey, this one has to be like one of the easier ones at least uh to find. Okay, here we go. 
Okay. Yeah, up here. Nope, nope. A little bit farther. A little bit farther up. Uh, cause okay. So small recap before Ganondorf took a secret stone. Um, vowed to destroy the world, and then uh, um, killed Sonya, and then was you know all that. And now everyone's preparing for war and to face off against Ganondorf uh, for the last time. Here it is. Here is the memory. All right. Let's check it out. The last memory. All right. Let's see it. Managed to restrain him somehow. Oh, this is after the fight. Yeah, it's the beginning of the game. But Link, I am not sure you'll be able to stop him. Wait, what? What? Yeah, this is in the past. Oh! But we sent the Master Sword to the past. It's after the fight with Ganondorf. Oh my god! I, I think I totally I totally called this. Why? It's why. Master sword. There it is, and that's the same cutscene from the beginning of the game. Oh my god! there is a reason you were sent to us it has to mean something to recover the master sword <laughs> this is her meaning i know why i am here it's something only i can do we will finally stop him To become an immortal dragon is to lose oneself. I'm. I'll be forever changed. Are... <laughs> wait, wait! Don't even be drastic. Don't be drastic. She went through draconification in order to actually live throughout all of this time and to heal the Master Sword. Zelda, Zelda's a dragon? In our time? That's the dragon we saw at the Water Temple! Ew, that's the dragon at the beginning of the game! That's the Master Sword! Oh, oh God. Oh. 
Oh no. Oh, and she lost herself. Oh. Oh my God. That. So the dragon we saw at the very beginning of the game after the Temple of Time was Zelda. And on Zelda, she is literally, for the past 10,000 years, while being an immortal dragon, has been recovering the Master Sword herself for us to use one day against the fight, well, in the fight against Ganondorf. Oh my god. Um, all right, that's a lot. Um, okay. <laughs> god, god damn. Okay. Um, this, this game, bro. This game. <laughs> This game! What the hell? Bro, you can't make us feel feelings like that! That's like not allowed, dude! That's like not allowed! Oh my god. Okay, well, um, yeah. We should go check out. First off, I'm gonna get that tower. Second off, we're gonna check out, um, you know, uh, the dragon's tears. Uh, right there, the, you know, the, the literal, that's why it's called the dragon's tears. Oh my god, because the dragons literally cried. Oh, there's so much. Typhlo ruins, okay. Oh, I see what we have to do here. Okay. Do I have a rocket on one of these right now? I don't, okay, but I will make one. Oh, there's actually a rocket over here. Okay. Goodbye. Are you okay okay uh the okay the the thing that we have to do for this tower right here is obviously we need to um uh get the uh rockets here um uh in order to get these off uh like move these things are you you can't do a rock oh it's such bull those are those are rocket arrows. That's disgusting. Oh my god, dude. Okay, anyways. Um wow, there's so many things that are happening right now. And uh my brain is moving a bajillion miles a minute. This is uh ridiculous. The story is insane. How the hell um are they like okay with this? They're like, oh what if we make Zelda a dragon? Huh? Nice. Okay, let's go down. I'm so glad we got those memories in order. I feel like if we got them out of order, it would have been definitely like not as good. Uh, I can't repair the Skyrim Tower, but the terminal has not been working. Uh, but I, I, I fixed it. So um, I will take uh, this Skyview Tower, please. Uh, the last tower in Hyrule. Oh, we look so badass. To infinity and beyond! The last tower. Wow. The very last tower. Dude, we're in the end game now. We are in the end game now. Service Mac complete. Okay, awesome. And uh, we got okay, some more sky stuff. Cool. Nice. Okay. Um, yeah, we got all of the memories, dude. Um, and then there's this last one right here, which I think we'll grab. Um, you missed a memory. I don't think I did, chat.
Um, one, two. No, I didn't. I don't know what you guys are on. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, all right. So now that we got the last, the very last tower, the whole... Dude, every, all of this is complete. Wow. Now that we got the very last tower, we can see all of Hyrule. Now, the depths, eh, we, you know, we, we, we still have some to explore in the depths. We haven't uncovered everything there. Uh, in the sky, we've done, uh, I'd say about like half. I'd say a quarter. We've done like about a quarter of the sky. We've done a lot of the surface. So, uh, well, let's check out uh, the last, uh, last secret memory i don't know let's check out the dragon's tier let's try let's check that out okay it's so good okay What are you? Dream homes, sun, and everything else. Okay. Oh, we didn't finish. Oh, uh, there's probably some more stuff in Terrytown as well. Here, one sec, chat. One sec. Um. Also, we haven't. Okay. For the depths, we also need to get this spot on the old map hmm, we got the depths armor i mean there's more like probably cool stuff down over here i mean like and we also found that one thing like um we also found that one thing where was it where was it it was like the it was in the bargainer statue it was no it was the forge construct i think yeah it was this um, we also haven't done this. Um, okay. All right, let's go do, uh, let's go do this. Um. It's not, I know, I'm not sidetracking, I promise. Right? I'm not sidetracking, I swear. Hmm. Let me ask you guys this chat. Um, do I do more story progression in the way of like, do I go and do lookout landing or do I go and do, uh, the dragon's tears or lost woods? All right. The tier. All right. That's what I thought. All right. Let's go do the tier. Yeah, what just dropped over here? Dragon's Tears. I mean, it was literally the Dragon's Tears, but... Dude, the amount of suffering Zelda's gone through is insane. Like, it's actually ridiculous. It's actually, like, unfair. Okay. Oh, here's the tier right there. Uh, but first, let's do the shrine. <laughs> I a little sidetrack, all right? A little sidetrack. Come on. Let me have it. Turbine power. Okay. This is a turbine. Um, okay, so this will... Right, let me put this here. Let me check this out. Okay. Just do the tier. Or crow L. Guys, whoa, hey. Calm down. All right, it's not the end of the world. This is this is a stream, okay? Uh, uh, chat, if you want to uh, watch a more edited version of this, you can wait. Um, we're, we're having edited videos out, okay? Um, 
calling me names uh, and uh, say I'm stupid, do the tear, all this stuff, L, all that stuff. Um, that's immature as fuck, and I hate seeing that. Um, so, guys, um, calm down. All right, let me create the content here. And if you want a more curated experience of edited stuff, uh, then you can watch the live, uh, th then you can watch the videos that we put out, guys. Okay? Don't be assholes. Um, because in that case, um, I can, I can literally pull a, um, what was it, was it when you were like in middle school? It's like, um, I can turn this car around, right? Um, like I can end stream. Um, I'm totally okay with that. Um, I, I know you guys, I know it comes from a place of, um, endearment and love and also uh, excitement, but let me do what I want. All right. If you want that curated experience, you can wait for the video. Thank you. Uh, all right. So there's a turbine here. Oh, 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 whoa. whoa, whoa. Okay. Turbine with the fan here. Um, okay. Oh, Jesus. Oh God. Oh, what have I done? <laughs> what, what have I done here? There we go. Okay. Okay. Awesome. Awesome. We got it. We got it. Uh, so what is, okay. So we got some flame emitters here. What is important about flame emitters? Why? How do I solve this? Okay. So in order to open the door here, um, let's see. Oh, wait, can I like take this off? Um, can I put this on anywhere else? No. Because like, why are, why do these exist here? I've got to figure it out. Oh God. Oh God. I'm, oh shit. Oh, cause it was still spinning. That's why. That's why it messed up the first time. Right. All right. Let's check, let's check this out. All right, here we go. Let me figure this out. What the fuck do I do here? Electricity. There's a flame emitter here. Also a chest. Um, is this like permanently on? Like what's going on? All right, let's throw this down. Let's try this out. Let's try something. Um, it's like fire with the, oh, 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 they're, uh, they're torches. Oh, okay. Okay. So I can, I, oh, but these, okay. These light up. I have an idea. Okay. Let's stop this here. We have a turbine that allows me to go up. However, um, what if I don't need to go up any longer, right? And I just take this and I put the flame emitter on the turbine, right? And then we reattach this. And so the flame hits all of them before they can be put out. Let's go. Hell yeah, dude. Okay, that was that was okay. That was a cool solution. That was a really cool solution. Yeah, and to cap it all off, if I see my chat being toxic towards me, um I that doesn't make me want to stream. Uh so uh shut the fuck up. I'm serious. And um yeah. Um, okay. You be toxic towards the streamer. I don't have to stream. You know, I can make YouTube videos. Whatever, right? Please be nice. Thank you. All right, cool. Uh, I don't need that energy in my life, you know? Oh, you know what? We should probably... Ooh. Probably get some... Uh, uh, we, we have six light of blessings. We probably should get, like, a heart of stamina, too. Um... 
What do I want? Let's see. Um. Chat, should I get a heart or stamina next time I go over to uh um uh to uh a statue? Hearts. I I've uh, I think I have 14 hearts right now, and then I have two wheels, two and a third wheels. Heart for sure. I think probably hearts. Uh, we do have a lot of stamina, and I don't think I need more. You know. So okay. Oh, whoa, whoa. Pirate ships. Oh my god. What? There's full pirate ships here, dude. That's crazy. Oh my god. I we gotta check that out sometime. Uh let me ping it real quick. How far is that? Oh, that's actually pretty close. Okay, cool. Alright, um, alright, let's do the uh let's do the tier that um Zelda's dragon just cried. This uh this seems like another memory. Um, but one that we weren't aware of with the geoglyphs. All right, so this is um, what I presume is, um, well, after after Zelda got the Master Sword and realized she needed to become a dragon. Is that the Temple of Time? Oh, it's right afterwards. Was that the sword that seals the darkness? The blade that shatters so easily against my power cannot save you from me. But, but, uh, but you saw that though. will continue to gain strength if bathed in sacred power. The stronger that power, the more powerful the sword becomes. Okay. After all, you possess more than power over time. You have a sacred power that can dispel evil. To swallow a secret stone. She's putting it all to together. Become an immortal dragon. She's putting it all together. Blessed with eternal life. She puts so much power into the sword. There's no way it could ever be destroyed by Ganon. That's why she knows it's ten thousand. I'm counting on you. She becomes the dragon to pour all of that power back into the sword, so the Ganon cannot destroy it ever again. Oh my god. And she gave the steward construct the oh my god. And that's the that's how we got the pure pad at the beginning of the game. Link, I will restore the master sword for you. The soundtrack's the the opening. I will care for it until the time comes. It's the opening cutscene. It's the rendition of the opening cutscene for Breath of the Wild. My sacred power into it. It will <gasps> Be the weapon that defeats the Demon King. To become an immortal dragon is to lose oneself. And she's doing this all for the greater good. Oh, Zelda. Zelda? <laughs> Wait one second, chat. Sorry, it started crackling. One sec. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm I, I started crackling. I can't have it crackle. I'm sorry. Okay, sorry. Okay, just pause real quick. Okay, anyways. Oh my god. Zelda! Protect them all! 
Oh, oh, oh my god! She literally lost herself. All of her memories gone. And displayed throughout Hyrule Kingdom. And now she just lives alone in the sky, nurturing the Master Sword until Link takes it back. Oh my god. That's lit that's why it's called Tears of the Kingdom. It all makes sense. That's in that oh, wow. Wow. I don't Oh my god, and there's silent princesses that, that bloomed around us. Look! They're all there. That's the flower of the princess. They all just appeared. I think we, I think we know what we need to do now. And, uh, I think we need to get the master sword. Oh, look at all the silent princesses. Oh, that's so sad. Oh God. Oh my God. That's so sad. We got to pick up all of them. Um, so, oh, <laughs> damn dude. Wow, okay. Wow, that's a lot to unpack. That's just so, so sad. All right, I mean, let's get the Master Sword. Um, here is also my thoughts, okay? Um, I believe I know what the DLC for Tears of the Kingdom is now. They're going to come out with DLC for sure. They, they got to. Um, I'm willing to bet that the DLC is figuring out, um, why Nadra, Feroche, and Dinral exist in the world too. Because those are also three other dragons. Um, and, uh, how they, you know, what they had to go through and why they swallowed their secret stones. I'm calling it right here. That's, that's. That's my thoughts. That's what I think the DLC is gonna be, assuming that we don't discover that later um, down the road in this in this story. <sighs> wow. All right, let's teleport to the tower real fast, um, and um, see if we can catch Zelda in the air. Okay. Uh, okay. There's Zelda right there. Okay. Here we go. Let's see if we can uh, uh, go nab the uh, Master Sword, I think, from her. Wow. Dude. Dude, what the hell did we just want? What the hell just happened? Jeez! That, that, dude, this story is amazing. The story is insane. Like this is ridiculous. I, I, dude, it. <laughs> they make you feel so bad for Zelda. She's had, she's literally forgotten herself to become a mortal in order to give the Master Sword as much power as possible to be able to defeat Ganon. There she is. Oh, wow, 
dude. I mean, just I mean, like, look at look at the antlers. Look at the. Okay, this is gonna ruin everything. Um, but uh, uh, you know what this is, what Zelda's dragon reminds me of. The the monsters versus aliens um bug bug guy <laughs> I'm so sorry It totally does I was li literally literally Am I wrong? <laughs> I'm not wrong guys Oh my god. Okay. Here we go. Hi, Zelda. Hey. Whoa. Oh my god. We're literally we're riding the dragon. And here's the master sword. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, I'm so sorry, Zelda. I'm so sorry. Oh god. Oh, we need stamina for this. Come on, come on. Yes, we got it. In Breath of the Wild, you need hearts. What? Did we, did we get it? Zelda, are you okay? <laughs> Quick question, chat. Should I do? Re should I read you the cutscene without without the mask? <laughs> should I should I keep the mask? <laughs> should I take the mask off and then and then go again? No, okay, all right, all right. <laughs> wow. Oh my God, that's so pretty. Oh, the Master Sword's gold? Let's pull it. Wow. Oh my God. That's so pretty. We got the master sword. There it is. The true and finally complete Master Sword. With all of the sacred power of 10,000 years. Link. Link. The Master Sword. Your sword. She is the key to destroying the Demon King. He defeated her before, but a long slumber will heal these grievous wounds. Oh my god. And when you two next face the Demon King... You will have 
my strength to help you through her. Link, you are our final hope. I pray. This sword reaches you in the future. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. Wow. It's so pretty. We're high above the clouds. God, that's gorgeous, man. We're back to the Temple of Time. Bye, Zelda. And we got the Master Sword, the legendary sword that seals the darkness. Its corruption was healed by its time with the Light Dragon. The blade gleams with a sacred luster. It can oppose the Demon King. Bye. Bye, Zelda. And I think the, the really sad part about all of this is not the 10,000 years that she spent healing the Master Sword. It's the forevermore that she'll have wandering the world with no other purpose for the rest of her life. All right, well, we got the Master Sword, which doesn't have an attack power. <gasps> it doesn't have an attack power. Huh? Um, can I like put a meat on it? Oh, <laughs> there's no way. <laughs> there, there's no way. Take the meat. Oh my god! The oh. Wait, what? I infused Master Sword plus one raw meat. Wait. Wait, what? What if I add a uh uh a Gibdo bone to it? Fuse has already been used on this. Oh, oh, oh okay. Can I remove? Okay, I can destroy it. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> so it seems like, dude, I how how does the master sword work then? Um, it has a, 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 some attack power. No, no attack power. <gasps> Damn. So what if I? Okay, let me do the. Like, what if I, like, hold this, put this down, and then fuse it with the Master Sword? And I swing the Master... Oh, oh, oh. Wait, what? Wait. Wait. When you... What? When you fuse it with something, it becomes that thing. So... <laughs> so when I fuse it with the meat... It becomes the meat <laughs> for a temporary amount of time. <laughs> okay, yeah, we're keeping meat on it, I think. I think that's I think that's great. We got the meat sword. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Oh. So it's quitting so so if I'm correct on this. Oh my god. Wait, wait. I haven't used it. Can I like can I do this? Okay, so it is there's some durability to it. Right? Alright, so the master sword can break. It's not it's no longer not used. 
the meester sword. The meester sword. Okay. Um, let me go and um do the lost woods then. That was insane. That was crazy. Oh my god. We're finding out so many things. Hi, Zelda. Hi. All right. Well, let's um let's go to the Lost Woods then. Damn, dude. Damn. Damn. Um. Damn. Subscri subscribe. Subscribe. <laughs> Uh no uh the uh the actual thing is I, I saw somebody uh in chat uh, asking when the edited video of this stream will be out and it'll be out as soon as possible um but the uh current as it, as it currently stands the actual um um uh the we we're on we we just released part two of the edited series um so if you want to check that out that's live on YouTube right now. Uh, so if you wanna if you wanna check that out, um, it is uh, live right now, like uh, literally. Uh, if you want to watch the edited portion uh, and all that, uh, so I actually recommend doing that. Okay. All right, let's go to yeah the Lost Woods. All right, here we go. I was so close. Okay. Um, yeah. Wow. I really like that too of like they made you use stamina because you had to hold on to the dragon rather than um hearts. So you can't get it too early, right? Cuz you have stamina. And that was man, that was really cool. It was really cool how they did that. Um, because the in Breath of the Wild you needed hearts to get the Master Sword, um, but in Tears of the Kingdom you need stamina to get the Master Sword. Okay. What the hell? Oh my. Okay, so we're in the Lost Woods right now, but what is happening to the Lost Woods? Uh, hello? What the? Huh? The Lost Woods. And it is creepy as hell. Um. <gasps> what? Okay. There's like a new trick to this. Lost Woods. It's like pulsing. It's like, it go is it like red light, green light? Bro, I swear to God, if it's red light, green light. Okay, so I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Pause. Stop. Okay, no. Um, that'd be cool, though. That'd be really cool. Um... Anything around here that can give us a clue into what we want to do here? <gasps> hmm. I am confused. Okay. So what if I... Do I need, like, light? Like, do I need to be glowing, maybe? Would that help at all? 
Oh, wait, it did a little bit there. I think. No, I could be wrong. No, I don't know if that's... Um... Let's see. Let me try... Let me try uh, making a campfire here. Uh, and then do this. Hold. Put down. Bang. I right, shoot the jelly. Okay, no worries. Okay. Okay, set my thing on fire here. So, like, have a torch. Why did that seem to work a little bit? Okay, so... It, it didn't work totally. Um, can I use like a... Yeah. Does that work? Bright blooms maybe? Let me try bright, bright blooms again, but like closer. Definitely not bright blooms. Bro, I am lost here. It's the Lost Woods! Yo! Oh, uh, Matthew, thank you so much for the uh, channel membership. Okay. I think there's like one or two options I could try as well. Okay, running isn't one of them, clearly. Uh maybe taking out the master sword. No, okay. But I did chop a tree now. Um, okay, this might be a stupid idea, um, but considering that there is a gloom hole here, I don't know, maybe this is, maybe this is just for, for Elden. Uh, it's, I, uh, all right. Um, we've seen before that you can like ascend from the depths in like one or two cases. This, okay. This actually might be like the stupidest thing that I've ever like, oh God, we might get so sidetracked here. I'm so sorry. Um, but I still want to try it. Um, if we go underneath, cause clearly going above isn't working. Can't go over it. Can't go around it. I guess we just got to go under it. Um, so we'll try that out. All right. I think we'll try it out. Minshi Woods Chasm. Okay. That might be good news. Okay. Oh, we're going down deep, deep. Oh, what the hell? Minshi Grove. Hyrule Forest, great depths. I love, dude, I love that, like, sound. When you get to it. Um, first off, uh, there's, there's a light ray right up there. How far is that? It's actually so close. Okay, I think we get it. I think we grab it. Um, I think we grab that first. I think this is the way. I think this is how we do it. I think I solved it. Um, there's a bunch of Elden stuff over here. But this is like so... I don't need more pose. I don't know why I'm grabbing them. Um, this is so like... I think it's big brain. You have to go underneath the, the Lost Woods. You have to use the depths. Um, why am I going to the Lost Woods? Now, that's a great question. Um, I don't know either. It just seems like a cool place to go. Um... 
seems like a pretty neat place to go. That's that's all I'm thinking. Uh, literally, like actually, it's the same thing as like Terrytown and everything else. We're trying to explore around. Dude, I can't, dude, that's such a sad story though, man. Like, God, I, I keep thinking about the whole Zelda like dragon thing, bro. All right, dragon, uh, uh, sorry, not dragon. Rockets are based, by the way. No shame in using rockets. Okay. All right, let's see about this light route. Nice. All right, we'll take it. Um, wait, does this actually prove my theory? Okay, so light route is here. We want to go. Yeah, I think it does actually. Okay, yeah, no, you do have to go below. Okay, yes, there's a pathway there. Yeah, okay. You do have to go below. Um, that is hot. Oopsies. Um, you do have to go below. Um, uh, Lost Woods. Uh, to get access to it, looks like. Neato, dude. All right, the way it starts is right over here. I think so, right? Yeah. Ah, uh, that's hot. That's hot. Okay. So then, uh, how do we get to the? There's, there's a. A light route right over there. Which is kind of helpful. I think we go to the light route. Why is it so lava-y down in... Oh, no, no, that's that's because that's the fire temple. Right, right, that's the... Yeah. Um, okay. Yeah, okay, so we follow the pose, I think. Yeah, up to the light route. And this is like the way we're supposed to go. Or... Wait, no, wait. Yeah, yeah, the light route's over here. Yeah. This is like the way we're supposed to go, quote unquote, for the Lost Woods. Right, yeah, because there's like a... There's a pathway that we're following here. Literally a pathway. Everything else is surrounded by gloom. Oh my god, I can't believe we found it out. That's so cool. That's so cool. Okay, every, there's a lot of gloom here, though. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, uh, I think I think chat. This is where we uh, uh, put on our gloom-resistant armor. Okay, let me uh, let me wait for the gloom resistance to, to start, though. Uh, and we're just gonna like run through it. Okay. Nice. Korok Grove! Yeah! Oh my god, and we're right underneath. Oh my god, that's so cool. That's so cool. Okay, there's a light route over there. There's also like, whatever. The oh, I think that's where you ascend. That's totally where you ascend. 100%. Yeah, look at the... Oh, it's so creepy. The Lost Woods uh, trees. Ah! Uh, yeah. Damn. Okay, that's a really cool way. Um, I like how you get you have to get the Master Sword through doing all the memories. I think that's pretty cool. Um, I, I, like, subscribe to that. That's, like, that's like a... It's a good way to do it, in my opinion. Um, but I'm wondering, I guess, why? And we'll figure this out later. Um, or, like, what's in the Lost Woods? Like, if the Master Sword is in our pocket, like, what is the, the Master... Like, what is the Lost Woods? Okay. Okay. 
Uh, light root, dispel darkness. That's cool. All right. Oh, and then this right over here. Yep. This leads up to, uh, I guess, the roots of the great Deku tree. Is that what that is? I guess it, I, I think it is actually. We can just walk through it. That's fine. We have enough hearts. Oh my god. It totally is the roots of the Deku tree. Oh, yes. Oh, that's so cool. All right. What does this reveal? Yeah, look at that. Yep. That's really cool. Uh, wasn't there another light route like right here that we saw? Oh, it's like right over there. It's actually really close. Oh, because it's the four um, uh, Deku tree. Like, um, uh, it's, sorry, it's the four Lost Woods uh, shrines. That's why that makes sense. Okay, we don't really need to get those. Okay, um, and then I guess if we want to see the Lost Woods themselves, we use Ascend right here. All the way back through the depths. Damn! Oh, that's so cool. Borok Forest. We did it. The Great Hyrule Forest. Oh. Oh. There he is. The Great Deku Tree. Oh, he has seen better days. You're so he's so sad. Oh. One sec, let me get the shrine though. Muscanor shrine. Swing to hit. Okay. Um, okay. Oh. That's that's actually this is a funny. This this seems funny. Okay. So we need to swing this up to attach, right? Actually, we can just attach with the Never mind. Okay. Probably need this. There we go. Got it. That was cool. Right. You have to make like a hammer. Uh, speaking of hammers, it looks like we have to do this as well. keep thinking stasis you know for this um oh i was like maybe i can attach a rocket to it Oh, okay. So with enough momentum, actually, you can get it to move. Right? You put the... You have a high potential energy here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. So now you can get it to move all the way up there. And then it'll slide back down because uh, it'll do that. So then... What we can do is actually we can attach a. I didn't mean to do that. And attach a log. Do this right here. 
okay so it becomes a little bit longer and then we can and then we can uh one second we can we can do this uh okay we can start oh it worked <laughs> yay dude it worked okay cool i didn't we didn't even see it i just voided out during the cutscene cool and then, and then you die, actually. That's that's part of the strat there. Uh, you, you actually want to die. Um, uh, so. May the light of blessing grant the strength you seek. All right, let me take off the uh, mask for uh, this cutscene. If there uh, probably seems to be one, honestly. Hello. Oh. 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 They're so. They're so sad. Oh my god. And the chief. He's so sad too. Oh my god. Why are you all so sad? Oh. Oh, God. Why is there so much malice in here? All right, let me, uh, really quick, though. Um, uh, get, 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 get a heart. <laughs> okay. There we go. That's uh, 15 hearts. Wow, that's so many hearts. Jesus. I thought they would start like a second row yet, but I guess not. All right, maybe we use a send to get to the top of the Great Deku Tree. What's going on here? Why is he so... Why is he so down? Um, oh, we're in his mouth. Oh, <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> We're we're in his mouth. Okay, that was that was weird. Um, and then the top here, the sunset fireflies. Hello. Yahaha. Yahaha. Oh, hey. Yahaha. Oh. That's so cute. That's so sad. Oh, do we have to talk to him right here? Oh, yeah. We can talk to him here. Oh, my stomach is not well. Your stomach's not well? Um, is there... A, your stomach is... Oh, uh, is there a way I can, like... Oh, 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 my God. Yeah. The Deku Tree Chasm. Yeah, if, if my stomach had a giant hole in it to the underground, I wouldn't feel well either. Dear God. What the hell? Oh, oh, wait. No way. I hate these things. I hate these things so much. I can use a master sword on them, maybe. That's the ma I don't think the master sword did like any damage. I'm not gonna lie. Um. Okay. I'm gonna change over to. Oh, let's see. Flame blade. Aquarate blade. No. no it's wrong thing. Oh god, dude! I still haven't figured out how to beat these things. Other than that! Wait, let me get all these, uh... Um, let me get all my guys out. So you guys can help. 
All right, I got one. I got one down. I got one down. Oh, I flurry rushed one of them. Nice. Oh, but I still got grabbed. These are the worst enemies, dude. I'm telling you right now. Um. Okay. Now that I have these, I can um. I can. Oh, I have one bomb here. Yeah. That works a little bit. Okay. 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 Don't get grabbed. Don't get grabbed. I only have three hearts left. Oh no! Okay. Nice. I got saved. I got saved by Julian. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Nice. One left. Okay, perfect. Got him. Oh. And there's Phantom Ganon. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Can I, like... Yeah. Okay. Oh, my God. That is not an easy fight. I'll put it like that. How the hell? How the hell? Okay. Korok Grove. Okay, we haven't started yet. Okay. Um, okay, so let me like prep a little bit here. What's my best? I'll okay, diamond. I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna fuse the diamond with the master sword. Okay. See if that works. Okay, uh, I'm also going to do a Zish. Uh, get all of the, um, not champions, but like guys out, you know? Stop, 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 stop. You're not even grabbing me. Stop, stop. Oh, I just got grabbed, didn't I? I did, yeah. Come on. Come on. Oh. Stop! King stun locked. Thank you. Leave me alone. I don't have any more. This is insane. This fight is ridiculous. Oh my god. I don't have any arrows either. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's prep a little bit here. Um, uh, okay. Okay, um, I... I want to use this. Actually, I'll, I'll use this. And then, yeah, we'll start here. Okay. I'm prepped. I'm ready. Okay. I'm ready. Here we go. Okay. Just dodge, dodge. Dodge, dodge. Uh, gnarled long stick. Okay. Uh, I'll use this. The soaring stick. Okay. Nice. As long as I can dodge, I'm good. Okay. Nice. Fire worked really well there. Okay. Next one down. Okay. Good so far. Okay. Just got to keep dodging. Got to keep dodging. Okay. Oh, you got me, you got me. Oh, don't put me in a blender. Okay. Okay. Uh, and then, here we go. 
All right, one left, one left, one left. Oh, two left. Okay, one left here. Oh, why do you keep growing? Why is there more? Okay, um, and then, okay, so that should be maybe the last one. I'm gonna take out the Master Sword here. Um, okay, I'm gonna take out the Master Sword here. Um, and then I'm going to uh, fuse the Master Sword um, with this diamond. Oh, that's a send. Sorry. Oh, that's a lot of damage done. Okay. Uh, where are my apples? Here we go. Nice! We got a flurry rush! Huge! Huge! Oh, with the master sword! That's huge! That's amazing! I wonder if I do extra damage. I don't know if I don't know if I do extra damage, but I, I'd like to think I do. Nice! Another flurry rush! He's so close. One more hit! Yes! Yes! Take that, Phantom Ganon! Oh my god! Well, that should make the great Deku tree, you know, feel better. <laughs> If I had that in my stomach, I would also feel awful. <laughs> wow. Oh, and then the Koroks. Hello. You did it! Thank you so much, Mr. Hero. The, the great Deku Tree is waiting for you in Korok Forest. We did it! Let's go! Uh, oh, you can just like ascend like that if you want to. Actually, speaking of ascension, I am wondering, I am assuming there's probably a chest up here. Seems like there would be. Um. Oh, but you can use that to ascend to the top. Okay, in case you didn't have the uh, shrine. Okay. Alrighty. Now, where are... Yeah, okay, here we go. Dark clumps. Um, the Demon King's bow. I will use that instead of this. Uh, the Gloom Sword, which is perfect. All right, let's go back to the surface uh, and talk to the great Deku Tree. Oh, this is, dude, this is so good. Okay. Well, hello, great Deku Tree. How's it going? How's it hanging? How you feeling? Right? Give you a little ibuprofen, little Tums, you know? <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Ah, so it is you. Uh, I must apologize. I'm still quite groggy. Uh, as though I'm awakening from a bad dream. Uh, you rid me of that unpleasantness deep within me. Yes, you went to great trouble to restore me. Thank you. Uh, it's been some time since we last spoke. Have you been well? Uh, yes, the last time we spoke, that was when you came here with the princess to retrieve the Master Sword. Right. Is, is this the events of Breath of the Wild? It is good to see you, oh, wow. Princess Zelda of Hyrule, and Link, Keeper of the Master Sword. Your blade has been fully restored. This is at the very beginning. This is before Zelda Go didn't on, hurt Link. stuff. Draw it once more. And this is after the events of uh, Calamity Ganon, I believe. Great Deku Tree. Oh, thank you so much. Wait, this is the this is, yeah. Huh. 
Wait, this is the the the. There is no need this is before thanks. everything. I merely watched over its renewal. Oh, oh, it this is hits. amazing that a sword can heal itself, no matter how badly damaged it becomes. This hits different now. <laughs> oh God! It can do more than heal. The sword will continue to gain strength if bathed in sacred power. Yeah, it will. The stronger that power, the more powerful the sword becomes. The potential of this fabled blade may well be limitless. Truly the work of a goddess. A sword that grows ever stronger. Oh my god. The master sword. Damn! <laughs> Damn! Oh, that's really cool. You, uh, you appear to be uh, you appear to be faced with trouble once more. Uh, but I see you have procured the master sword. Uh, that sword, I sense a sacred power within it that is stronger than before. What has come to pass? Take heed and do not rely solely upon the power of that sword. You must steal your mind and spirit as well. I am always here. Do you ever have need of me? You need only ask. Recovering the hero sword um, is complete. Um, but at what cost? Damn. Uh, we've gotten... Oh, we're missing some memories here. Oh, I guess we didn't do them in order then, technically. Um, because we're still missing 11 and 14 and 16. Um, but, uh, those seem to be, um, probably progressed by, uh, story. Um, so, yeah, um, I guess the next thing that we need to do is, um, I want to check out some of the labyrinths here, uh, and then I want to... Um, probably go to Lookout Landing and everything, um, and chill and see what's going on there. Um, Jack, uh, let me ask you this question. Uh, should we do Labyrinth, uh, Labyrinth 1? Should we do Labyrinth 2? Or should we do a Labyrinth 3? Two all day. Really, there's a lot of twos. A lot of twos. Okay. Um, all right. Let's go to the labyrinth. Uh, and then, uh, yeah. Uh, cause it's the, 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 uh, who's here from, uh, the cube cult, cube squad. Oh, it's raining. Oh, lovely. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Where am I supposed to be in? Up this way, up this way. Right. Uh, throwback to cube cult, spear squad. Okay. Uh, okay. It's only thundering for a little bit here. We can like wait it out. God damn. We are in the end game now. I love our master sword, how it's literally it's like Oh wait. We take it out, but if we don't use it, it turns back into the master sword. Oh, that's pretty cool. Wow, that's that's really cool. Also, the depths armor, you cannot tell me that this is not the coolest armor in the game. It's so sick. It is so cool, dude. Yo, El Bozo! Thank you so much for the uh one hundred dollar super chat. Thank you. Uh, the message which reads, uh, a, a stinky poo poo. Um, so, um, just, you know, that's, that is, okay. That's, if that's the way you want to do with your hundred dollars, then, uh, so be it. You know, I, I can't, I can't judge, you know, I've spent, I've spent money on work. Uh, all right. Here's the labyrinth. 
Whoa. Let me save here. Um, all right, chat. Before we go to the labyrinth, and um, after the labyrinth, we'll do a lookout. Uh, we'll do a lookout landing um, for more story progression after completing the entire map and everything. Um, uh, I'm going to go to the bathroom really fast, okay? Because I got to, you know, I'm a human. It's what humans do. Crazy. Um, so let me uh, be uh, right back. Uh, let me know if it hits, guys. All right, let me know if it hits. Wait, I have one second. I've been I've been made aware. I have been made aware that uh there is a better DVD logo to watch. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. This was made by Oh, it was made by Litton. Oh hell yeah, dude. Let's go. All right, I'll be back in a in a sec, okay? Let me know if it hits the corner.
Yo. <laughs> How long was this playing for? <laughs> How's it going, guys? I'm back. Okay. <laughs> Did it like auto play Nintendo music? What the? Okay. Anyways. Um. Hello. Hello. Um. I'm back. I am. I am back. Sorry, I had to go to the bathroom real quick. Um. Let's uh. We'll check out the labyrinth. Um. Real quick. Fish. Look at him. He's so. He's so fish like. Um. Cool. Okay. All right, labyrinth. Let's go. It hit Eric. Did it? Did it hit? Did it, chat? Did it actually hit? Be real with me. Don't lie. All right, let's go to the labyrinth. Check it out. It better of. Okay. What do these labyrinths look like? I'm gonna uh, splice here. Okay. okay. Whoa, they're all filled with gloom. Wait, I wonder, does it have the same solution as the last labyrinth? Do they have the same solutions? Because the solution in the labyrinth last time was like. Oh my god. There's no way. Oh my god, there's no way. <laughs> it, it actually does have the same solution. <laughs> That's so funny. They didn't they didn't change the, the labyrinth solutions. Okay, well now I know how to complete every labyrinth. Cool. Uh what is that? Uh, research log, day three. My search has finally led me to a zone I relic. Uh, I must tell Tora about it. Uh, though I must admit, my curiosity remains piqued. I'm not sure I'm quite ready to leave these ruins. For instance, how can I see a lower level from this room? I can see a lower level of this room. How is one supposed to reach it? What the fuck? Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> First off, let me do this. Whatever this is. For you who conquered this labyrinth of the land, I, the ruler of dragons, have unlocked a door. Find it on the south side of the labyrinth of the sky. Okay. Okay. The labyrinth of the sky. And there's also one uh, down below in the ground. Um, I, I'm pretty stoked that we solved that labyrinth so quickly, though, you know? What can I say? What can I say? Pretty good with it. Yeah, that's why they didn't change the labyrinth um, stuff, you know? Raru's blessing. Uh, large zone I charge, okay. Uh, this should give us our fourth, right? Uh, for another... Yeah, wow, we're going through with these quickly, dude. We have 15 hearts, uh, two and a half stamina wheels. We've done a lot of, I've actually done a lot of completion here. It's kind of crazy when you think about it. Um, just the amount of things we've done. 60 shrines, uh, 36 light root. Okay. Um, all right. So we can go down below or we can go in the sky. You know what? It says to go to the sky in the south. It says go to the sky, like the south side of the sky. Right, that's the uh, that's the thing right here, south side of the sky. Oh, because we unlocked the sky now. Well, let's go to the depths. What's down here? Blow my labyrinth chasm. Oh, really? Why? 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 Uh uh. No. Uh uh. No. 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 Uh uh. Oh, I got a big battery. That's so cool. Uh uh. -uh. I leave. I don't want to be here. Uh, whoa. Wait, what's down here? Oh, discovery. I found a, uh, a gloom guy. All right, not a gloom guy, but I found a, um, a frog guy. Where's this guy go? Okay. 
Uh, I just, the gloom hands, man. <coughs> oh my god, it is a Hinox and I have zero arrows. Okay. Let's save. Uh, good luck. Uh, and Godspeed to me. All right, that was half health. Do you know where I am? Okay, wait, I can maybe use like Riju here. Okay. Okay. Okay, good so far. Good so far. All right, he can't get on fire because Oh! oh okay that was a lot of damage um sure. here we go and he's dead nice Okay, perfect. Uh, we got roasted bird drumsticks. Okay. Uh, and also a black Hinox horn with 27 fuse attack power. That's huge. That's a lot. And Hinox guts. Awesome. What else did you have here? A knight's claymore. You oh, a royal broadsword. Yes. Oh, oh my God. And, and a royal bow. That is amazing. The royal bow is an awesome, awesome pickup. Damn. All right, that's great. Uh, so there's a Hinox underneath the uh, labyrinth. That's so weird. I mean, it makes sense, but that's so weird. Uh, let's see. Oh, I had to like, like, um, I have to use uh, so your rock, right? Do I have anything for rocks? I don't really. I actually really don't have anything for rocks now that I think about it. I don't even have bombs. Yeah, I don't have bombs. Okay. Okay, I'll just you know what? I don't have to beat you. I can just I can just run. Like I don't have to be here right now. <laughs> like you feel me? Oh. Wait, are you a sil oh my god, you're a silver Parablin. Parablin? Riblin. Oh, okay. This is the hardest enemy we've uh, faced yet. Okay. Oh, that was huge. Oh! Damn. Okay. No, no. Okay. All right. All right. Oh, no, that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. I didn't, uh, I don't want to live anyways, you know? Uh, didn't need it. Did, life? Nah. You know, meh. It's all right. Whatever. Okay. Nice. Okay. All right. Yeah, okay. And then this thing. All right. Nice. Nice. Okay, this is going well. Okay, and you're dead. Awesome. We got Horriblin Claw and a silver Horriblin Horn. 32 fuse of power. 32 fuse, dude. And a gnarled long stick with a tackle plus eight. Oh my god. Okay, we're doing great. Also, this is this is literally oh my god, this is Trey's stream right now. What is literally like what what's going on? What the hell is going on? What is what is happening? On huh? It's it. it. <laughs> uh huh? Film that Disney had released the. Yeah, that that's. <laughs> I love my best friends. <laughs> oh my god, they're so funny. <laughs> 
That's so good, dude. Oh, right in the bones. Nice. Oh, whoopsies. Explain now? I, is there anything to explain? I, I don't think there is. I, I genuinely don't think there's anything to explain. Uh, ooh, a royal halberd. That is also amazing. This was a great team tour. Right, what else is down here, dude? Right, there's so many of these guys. Arcly arc blades badly damaged. That sucks. Okay. okay. Oh, fairies. Oh my god, there's fairies. There's three of them. Oh, what a good find. What a really good find here. I made enough. Aw, oh, damn it. Damn it. They all ran away. Sag, dude. Sag. Okay. Let's go here. Okay. Up and around at the speed of sound. That was not worth it. That's also not worth it. I need more arrows. I need so many more arrows. It's not even funny. I might, I might just go on a buying spree with um, uh, with Beetle later. Dude, what the hell? Huh? Where are we? Where? <laughs> oh! Oh, so... Wait, there's, an ex there's another way. Oh, my God. There's another way to get to the labyrinth. It's through the caves. That's really cool, dude. That's actually, I like that a lot. That's pretty neat. That's pretty neat. Uh, so if you can't, if you don't have the uh, stamina to go there, you can still, you can still go around. Flotational brilliance. That is, uh, uh, yeah, I mean, that's, uh, I mean, I'm, I'm, I am brilliant, and I float. Okay. What am I supposed to do here? Uh, I can shoot this down. Like, what is that? Oh, I think that was the solution. Oh, okay. Um, oh, it's a, okay. I can't take that from, from, uh, it, it's like stuck to the pole. Um, oh, you know what we do here? We go underneath, we cash it underneath. <laughs> oh, oh my God. <laughs> okay. All right. So it's, it's literally flotation device. So if you like submerge it underwater, it, it, the buoyancy of it. Okay. Good enough. Good enough. Good enough. So then, if I, I wonder then, can I just like do this, or can I like place this here? Yeah, it'll it'll do that. Okay. okay. I'll place this here. And then I do like this. Attach it. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Um then I like Like really sub wait, wait, wait. Not yet, no, I don't want to submerge it yet. What if I take do I wait, are these like balls that I need for like here? Oh, it might be. I might need one or two of these. Um, okay, so then I have an idea, and it's a really stupid idea, but it's an, un it's an idea nonetheless. Okay. 
What if I do this? Okay. Uh, but not too far in the ground. So, like, right here. Okay, that works. That works. Okay. Then I take it right here. Submerge it. And then do that. Okay. And then recall it. And then take Ultra Hand onto this. Oh. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. It's, it's going to be so stupid, I think it'll work. Literally. I think it's so dumb it'll work. Okay, let me turn this... I'll do this. Okay. And then recall this. And take Ultra Hand. Put right here. And then go back to recall. Okay. And that should... <laughs> Work? I, I think you know what um I, th I think it technically did work please let me reach oh my god it did that's <laughs> really stupid <laughs> uh yeah all right I'll take it I don't pretend to understand how that is supposed to work, but sure. Uh, yep. We did it. May the light of blessing grant whatever the thing that you want, seek. Okay, um, now the labyrinth in the sky. How the fuck do you get up there? How the hell? Huh. Okay. Need go shook. I wonder if there's like a. Oh, I guess I could like float up. That is that is um definitely a long way to. Okay. Why is there? Oh, is this a schema stone? Uh, it's engraved zone text. Can't make out what it says. Right. Um, research log day one. It took us two days to reach the isolated island. The weary Taru was able to size the, the zone writing on the stone slab. The dragon ring slumbers in the Libra steps. Wake it and you shall receive due compensation. Uh, after seeing him off his way home, I swore to tackle the ruins myself. The acorn is in nuts. Uh, I prepared to mark my path. Make sure I don't get lost inside. Oh, that's cool. That's pretty neat. I was wondering why we saw this. Um, okay. Um, I think, uh, chat. Um, I've been having a lot, uh, a lot of fun. I, I'm going to end stream, I think, uh, just because uh, I'm getting a little tired. Um, tomorrow! Tomorrow is the last um, Tears of the Kingdom playthrough day. Uh, we've completed pretty much everything I wanted to complete in the game. Um, we've done a ton of stuff. I mean, like, look at all of this completion. It's crazy. Um, and so I will be live 9 a.m. Pacific time when we're going to go, um, to Lookout Landing and start the end 
of Tears of the Kingdom. Um, so, uh, yeah, uh, I'll be streaming uh, tomorrow until I beat the game. Uh, so, uh, yeah, subscribe if you haven't uh, subscribed already. Also, also, chat, um, uh, the video, uh, this video is out. Uh, watch, Go watch this video. I'm going to paste, uh, paste the um, link in chat. Um, uh, go watch the video. Go watch, go watch, go watch, go watch, go watch, go watch the video. Is it appearing? I, I, I think it is. It might be. Um, go click on that video right there. Um, it's the edited video uh, that we just put out uh, of the playthrough. So thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you so much for stopping by. Um, I appreciate all of you. And I'll see you guys tomorrow at 9 a.m. Pacific time. Um, and then uh, mods, if you want to uh, uh, truffle raid out to the, uh, to the new video as well, that'd be sick. All right. Bye, guys. I'll see you tomorrow.